your competition with the Executive Chef Operator. Now available in-game in the Call of Duty Store. Check out all the awesome in-game rewards you can earn for free just by watching the Call of Duty League. What's on tap this weekend? An all-new lineup including a weapon blueprint, emblem, calling card stickers, and XP tokens. Just link your YouTube account now to start earning. Yurt, what's good, everybody? What up, what up? Nice little Red Bull. It's not no playing terrible day. They're having a stinky. It's a good edit right here. I don't know why the music's so epic though. Yo, 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 what's up? Yo, what's good? what's good, Tom? What's going on, guys? How you guys doing? What's um, up, Zuma? Doing, doing okay. Doing all right? You doing okay, Ben? You doing yeah. all right? Yeah, I'm doing okay. What's, what's up? What's up, Sam? You doing Hello, good? Hello, Zuma. What's going on, Sam? How you doing? I'm doing fantastic. That's good, man. It's good. I'm glad you're doing great. I'm glad you're doing great. It's phenomenal. I'm going to need Jesus to get through these matches today, though. I can't lie. Yeah, you're going to need Jesus? What's the matter? You tired? So. It's just, nah, it's just some shit games. Shit games? Yeah, it's nah. Some shit I, games. Uh, I'm excited for the LA Thieves Toronto match. That's, I hope that's, it's that's, close. That's the one you're excited for? Yeah, I actually, I don't know. I think you guys think it's gonna be a blowout. I don't know. I have a feeling like these might kind of make it somewhat close. I don't. I don't think Ultra's been looking as dominant as they did stage one. I think they've been looking a little. They have weaknesses in their gameplays, especially their search game. So we'll see what happens. You know what I'm saying? We will see what happens. You know, and it's a great question, if, if Lucas. Great LA, question. If LA Microphone Thieves win activity. today. Uh, it could cause some problems with the with the winners bracket or some apparently first round matchups could get a little Yeah, if Thieves if here. Thieves win Toronto could get I think 60 which means they play their optic or phase round one oh, That is spicy. Yeah, but it's really spicy if, if, bro. if Thieves Toronto is a likely rematch in the first round of winners bracket if it goes away it should go Yeah, so uh, great. Time to get your picks in I did get my picks in. I went with a four-man entry today because I've been losing a lot. So yeah. I'm going to try and spread it out a little bit instead of just going map by map. So I went Geo Moore, 50 and a half, maps one, two, three. Linz Moore, 53 and a half, maps one, two, three. I went Scrap Moore, 53 and a half, maps one, two, three. And I went TJ Moore, uh, maps one, two, three, 49 and a half. So we'll see how that goes. And then for map one, I did Dylan attach more and Gwyn more because it's invasion. And I'm expecting it to be scrappy. So I want them to go crazy. I want them to I hate the, the one through threes. I stopped doing them. Oh, I, I, mm. I, I've I been doing them and they've, they've been pretty good. I despise good. them. Did they, they, just like, they, bro, you could just have like a 6 Oh, You could have like a two minute hard point. Like, I don't yeah, know. but well, that's, yeah. that's literally everything. That's map. Yeah. Even if you're doing map ones, map two, it, somebody can have a shit map or somebody has a crazy map. It, it's, it's so yeah, hard, fair. bro. It's a gamble. You're gambling. You're fucking gambling. You don't know what the fuck's gonna happen have to die. Uh, I kind of took yours and I took I did Dylan over Linz over and nasty under like I took a little bit of a twist on it So I like tailed one of the legs, but I wanted to keep running the Dylan overs because that's been pretty good Thoughts on Eric Tan hang Tenong. I mean, I think it's tough to judge 
I mean, I just think United squad is just in such a bad spot from a personnel standpoint that like he's not getting them to overperform. Um. But like, I don't know. I think he's decent, but like his adjustments have been not that good. But their squad's also so bad. That's insane that Karachi went unpicked. Wait, is Vegas fucking testing map pool right now? That's insane, no? It is a lot insane. Isn't Vegas godlike at Karachi? Am I tweaking? It's invasion in, in Skid Row Hardpoint shot. Karachi's not in. Am I tweaking? Hang on, let's look it up. Um, yeah, I'm taking a look right now. Ravens are 4-1 and one on Karachi. They, I mean, if they don't want to play it against Vegas, that makes Vegas sense. Vegas is 3-3, and three, so I think it's just... Yeah, but Vegas' like, concepts on that map are better than like 80% of the league. But I'm not blind. They're literally not playing Karachi Hardpoint. Yeah. Karachi control moron. Karachi control and Karachi search last map but we get there. You two times, two times. Rats. Win or lose for them, it's like not the end of the world. Which is on the other side that you are battling right now, you're Carolina, trying to get into the winners bracket. Now, if you take a loss here, are there some ways that you may be able to get in? Sure, but you win, you are in. Let's see if they yep, can do it. I, I hit it two times. That crazy when you think about like that. If you're trying to master your legion, you're going to hard to master class. Listen, they have time in hundred. See if they can do it. I mean, legion was it yesterday, so I mean, they played some great calls. You think so? First blood on the series. One is opening. Duel is going to go at least. Mobile like seventy-five bucks on the season. Microphone activated. Kind of locked in right now. They're loving the squad. The Tem is there, and as Ann said, okay. they are happy moments. Is uh, there's gonna be three. Uh, Nero's having a bounce back series. He got pooped down this really have. And That's sort of what we talked about yesterday. Oh my god, he's turned. Consistent effort and attach. Sometimes it's like we're just you turn is not turn. One guy turn is not so good. Moments, and it's been any of oh, the Jesus others. Christ. Just having those incredible moments as Clayster does come through with two. Yo, can we? Nah, right? We're not Couple trading. Seconds left, and we get ready to rotate. Oh, over. Dead. Dylan's dead. What the it's fuck? Oh. Lurking, just tucked in the That's corner. Tough. Almost comes away with a fellow able to snap. Yeah, I that mean, was so weird. That was definitely a, lunch, a weird looking, second, looking melee, up fight for sure. Fellow able to get away from it. Carolina should break first. Play's gonna find this second, so a nice break opportunity Ooh, here shots. for Carolina. Maybe not. Locking it down, trophy on. You do have who is that first stand alive all the way in the back, but he is taking well, down. Well, this alley so is good. Timing on it's gonna be crazy. Ooh, the Ooh big win from Teach. Yeah, I mean, when we last casted him like yesterday. There's so many moments where Purge, you know, he's lost a lot, needs to get a kill or two, or slow something down, he's able to. Attack. But the guy that really needed to get like those big multi kills that was insane yesterday, Gia, he was a freak. The guy was on one. No, he was. Yeah, I, I... doing it with the sub, doing it with the AR. Big series from him. He's been so it's a good show from Vegas Knight's first two hells. And Caroline's got to make sure they now it's P3 yeah, rotation. This can get very ugly very fast. Just coming out to Butter off spawn and bro getting we'll oh, blue. Get a like gap that, here. Hold right. up. Like, they're just playing with a lot of confidence. Like things are starting to click after they make the move and get Geo on this team. I don't know. It's just like you, what you're doing is working. You just want to keep perfecting that going into the major. Yeah, and that's it, right? So now they're going to try to find hill. some new maps. But over towards, the, you know, this P3, it's a good job from Gio to win off the hill and kind of uh -oh. break this up. You see what it was definitely, oh, oh, Gio got through. They started tweaking on the mini map. TJ, the last man oh, that's a loose one for TJ right here. Uh, yeah, what was that one, from Carolina? What was their happen? setup there? They thought, they thought Gio yeah, got through the gas because they all turned and, like, were looking for him. Able to take that fight. It'll be another hard point string together now for Vegas Legion. They look to get the advantage. As Gio put in damage for the back tank, sets it up for attach. Fellow trying to snap a car now coming into the front. Dylan continuing. Go Another good start now. here on this You're map. The rest of this scrap. We'll see if can start swing it back. Your, well, one of your duos, Tom, he's been absolutely pacing the stage. At these been pacing this year. They just yeah. did not allow a surge to get yeah, back. Yeah, no, nah, Dylan's been in fucking crazy. Like that. I know it is very early, but it's my fucking guy right there. Carolina, now you're down near 70 points early. We know how important and the palace spawn comes in. But there is the break, and then you get a good amount of time from Legion. Yeah, those hard points. Yeah, Nero, go ahead and get him off that hill. Just had the advantage or ahead, able to hold on to it. And little white time never hurt nobody. Oh, he almost drop shot the shit out of him. We'll see if they can continue to do it here for now. The central hard point. Gonna get flanked. Now the palace, she's gone. Holy fuck! Oh my God, what's going on? Is attached getting two. Update in four. The guys get a run. Yeah. Gwyn right now just trying to it's a real alive. great map, great spawn, great spawn hill. All the way Palace. Gwyn, he's going to have to try to make a play, maybe to help them get out for P5. 
And while well, he's gonna do that, so he's gonna find three. a double, but the spawns. CJ Halley has not got nice work on the other game to start, unfortunately. Oh my god. I can't tell if that was a snake or not. It was kind of like a two pump. But it's just TJ now, the furthest man forward for Carolina. Went so close to making that play, just too many bodies for Vegas. Oh, Nero's piecing, dude. Quinn gets rewarded with a pal of spawns. <laughs> He's got spawns out so deep after nearly making the heroic play. But now we get ready for next. You've sort of booked this up. The top street got near the point. Now you've got the a three got play on three here. The are are in. Lining up in front of them will be Purge. Purge able to get the kills. One more he's trying to dance with. Gotta make it oh. two. Oh, Purge. Oh, oh, my clean. fucking Purge. God. Purge. Oh. That was disgusting. That's another one of those moments Purge has had. He's been big for them, man. Purge. 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 You had one player and fellow get a kill. Take a look at the slang right now. A real tough start for TJ Halley. Sitting that triple nag. Controlling blue. Controlling blue. Really though. Then they find those kills. Now they are on the point. We've seen that with invasion, kind of playing around. Dude, Carolina can't get a kill. First. Yeah, this is crazy. Well, that's nah, that's a, that was a great first, first rotation from Vegas. They're getting well, fucking shit on. They're point massively right now in this game. And well, Legion, the listening so good yesterday. Let's go to a listening with Vegas. Give me a breather. I'm short game time. Yep. I'm, I'm, see, I'm, I'm, looking, I'm looking. I'm looking. I'll read on. Angle left. Angle left. I think David. Quinn heard on the right. P1 tank, right side. Right, I'll find him. Contest from ACD. Contest from ACD. Right. Back right, four. Back right, four. Wait, I'm missing. One shot. 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 Back freezer, back freezer hurt. Sending attack. I got my time. I killed my time. Don't shot time. Absolutely, there's two. Nice. All right, one people taking the corner. Fellow. Was blue on me still? You want to take fellow on time? There's two on time. Two on all. There's two on all. Two on all. Yeah. He's behind the bottom. Bottom blue. Bottom blue. One shot. T. Bottom blue. He's one shot. P5. Gotta go kill. We need to go kill. Get bottom blue. I'm going to move down. 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 I can pitch Tom. I can pitch Tom. They're just going to let me know. They're going to fall behind me. Can someone get the time? I'll get in two seconds. I can't get it. You're good. I'm on the tank. I'm in the left. I'm in the left. Oh, wait. You're going to take him. He's going to fly. Dark. 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 Well, Joe, based on how good the listening was yesterday, like, it was a good listening, but for them in game, I think if uh, it, Carolina could work a break here, moments, this actually a might swing quite a bit. A, a little chaos there, but I, I still think you, you kind of heard, like, we need to do this. Let's focus on this guy. Like, killing the guy in blue, like, that yeah. deal with that first. Just sort of, yeah, like, also, hey, TJ went from 4 and 12 to 5 and 16, so he's been setting up the last couple of holes. Carolina, they fight their way back, trying to make this a game. Much needed break over towards P2 from them. I said you were spawning Palace out. It was looking hold for, ugly. Uh, they were for able Vegas. to get, out, get some of the time, but yeah. over towards this P3 rotation, it's been all Legion so far. It wasn't even like that chaotic. It's like, you know, it's different when, they're, when you're rolling and, like, you've got the setup and you're just holding, like, it kind of calms down a little bit. Like, those were some scrappier moments, and... Yeah, I hear you. Caroline can't get fucking close. The layers have been really good. That, that, that's Someone said sure. they had left. They're all gonna be right. Dude, Six times. Like, like, they're all gonna be right. 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 The discipline's really good. Yeah, he was uh, very clear. That he I was know it's cliche as shit, that's but if they sure, really did your reverse left three times, these standings would be uh, pretty alarming. I was about to say he's on three in a row, but the second I opened my mouth, he's dead. Nero uh, stepping up for him. You know, uh, yesterday, you know, we were talking about this map, I think, for the control and how good he'd be. Like, he didn't really have that pop up. The other guy stepped up, but showing his star power currently. It's this advantage you've just, you've held. And the, the nice part going up 100 early, like, even though you chipped away at there a bit of your Royal Ravens, like, still like 60 70 point advantage right yeah and that, and that was the thing with the listening right it's sort of they were they knew where they wanted to be on the map you heard a couple of times let's not play for the hill let's play for certain positions you know it's the spawns and just cashing in where they came now we talked about it earlier there's no roll swap so that was just i don't know 
They might just try to scrim against uh, Toronto. Keep it Microphone right activated. Now. Crazy how, how, how Invasion has turned into like a mix fest. Get some info behind and the stuff. map is so yeah. now. It's like, look at the time limit. Last time we got this hard point, not a ton of time was accrued. Had a lot of white time throughout the course of this as well, but you need every second you can possibly get right Clay looking at? you are Royal Ravens. Man, you'll take this if you're first, right? In, in Legion, they're gonna take that 10 seconds. And I thought run, Carolina boys, run. would have a very clean rotation over to P5, but then a couple of players die. You see the spawns coming in over towards Palace, so it's kind of a 2-1-1. One, one. Okay, so they spawn towards the front, so everyone now is gonna be back oh, parking. This is a great chance for Purge to yeah, have an individual play, go for some spawn kills, but I think Clay sees him throw a stun, so they know his spot top blue but so many people are focused on him look at the hill all of legion are here so it's a full on four on the point that had he insane the back dumpster you get the numbers here if you're royal ravens you take down three you lose one you get control mm, of the hard it's not looking now, good for my really my dawn over so far on the He's other side of this rough segmentation will be gl he can't take all right, his fight, gotta kill. So it's another moment, like we kind of heard during the listening, where you start to kind of chip away at this. You're making some good plays if you're Royal Ravens. It's just, I mean, this is the problem of going down 100 early. This feels like you're always trying to claw your way back. Yeah, yeah nah, yeah, Carolina, yeah, they, no surprise, they started too slow. Yeah, kind of used to this yeah, if you're a fan of them. Just taking, they're going to have to just change the game the now. They need a big break. Point. Maybe they could find their first win, but not looking so right now. Looking more like an 0 and 8. We were going to throw a party too, Joe. They are getting we torpedoed. But you can are. see Geo just going to get on this hill. Has a trophy down. And Nero getting his cuts towards blue. And again, just what chipping away towards that 250 <laughs> point mark. Yeah, right. Any second you can get so close to a victory here. Trying to make the rally. It's Carolina. And Geo now poised to pounce. Going in to accrue some time. Contest some time. Felony able to get a double. Carolina's Just still in it. They're alive. holding on. Again, a nice sequence here from Carolina, but will be too little oh, too later. Do you ramp up some sort of miracle? They're just. For now, Nero is in a position. It's so hard to come back on it from the deck on this map, dude. It feels time. impossible. To play his life, but finally will drop in a gunfight to Gwen. Geo will be next up the bat. You got 10 seconds to go. You can't quite okay. win Holy it here, fuck. so you do a good job at extending this to another hard point if you're Carolina, but. You are close and shot break the here. If you're leading. Carolina, yeah, need to break so this instantly. Now. And now Geo has to be cleared. Kills, the one player oh, no. He's going to be Clay through Dalton. Geo's going to be right here. He's going to have to make the first play. They need probably trophy, though. Hold on. They might. They might. I don't think they get here in time. This is over. DJ? DJ? Yeah. What up, too? Vegas have a good clinical map from Vegas right there. Vegas' hard point has been good. Yeah, they've been looking really, really good. You weren't even able to really think about the next. It's crazy how, like, he it, it started with that P3 break on the first rotation. They built the lead and then they just made it end. They just stayed ahead. Geo just found the one gap. And then everyone out in Vegas are, are fucking killing us, are tweaking. Yeah. Good. Solid. Yeah, just good. Like. Not necessarily like Purge a masterclass, and uh, I fear that uh, that, 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 that Geo map is good like for my picks. Hard point off of a top the Vegas is going to be streaking. Gwyn failed me. Gwyn failed me. All right, Dylan rebounded. I got 24 kills. I went 53, so we're feeling good. On the other side, I just felt like you started a little bit too slow. Right, there were a couple yeah. opportunities. That P3, I think, just right off that first rotation, set the pace for Vegas Legion how they wanted to control the map. Near that second set, Carolina got going a bit, but it was just too late. Yeah, I mean, how often have we seen that this year where it's just like, you know, you have like strong side spawns or whatever the case may be, whatever the map may be. It's P2, like you give up that time and try to set up for P3 and then you get broke. And it's like, okay, we're down 100. It, we see it so much. I mean, obviously it's real common, like a skid row or something like that, but it can happen anywhere. <laughs> like you just try to set up, one break comes through and you're like, wow, we are in a hole. Unmuted. Yeah, you spawn palace and you're like, yeah. This is oh, tough. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I gotta run very far uh, across the map. But now this is where it gets interesting. Again, Vegas, obviously the position that they're in. These next three maps. This is. Uh, I mean, you haven't played this all year in high rise. This next map is gonna be weird. Zero on the year. They have, and then the other two. So it's the middle of the series, right? The middle yeah. three, where it's Karachi like, control. You you haven't played this stage. Skid Row, Hardpoint. You haven't played this stage. So like, if there's an opening for Carolina, it's right now. Yeah, I agree with Merck. 
the high rise has it. This one could get weird. I think it's really been the invasion that's been solid for him. So, like, would you love to get I think if Vegas win this one to 3 0, so. Looking better, we have to see the stage. Like, something that you might be able to take and pull out as a wild card, maybe at the major. Um, anything you can grab. I mean, and listen, we, it's so weird to talk about this stuff because we know they're like screaming this, you know, day and night. Like, they're playing this stuff every day. We talk about them not playing it. Nah, no, no. I mean, bro, Vegas led like, this pretty much wire to wire. What, the lead was basically 70 at one point. It's just different. That's what it basically finished. I mean, or it finished 100. Just, it, uh, just going from scrims to. To matches how many how many times have we heard a player say that when it's a team that's struggling we can just replicate what we're doing in scrims well yeah i mean some teams are playing away in scrims. scrims and other teams are testing to I mean, he's right crutch hard point could have been unpicked here and just didn't just looking at the maps and modes here start off with invasion hardpoint over to high rise snd next invasion and search is not, also I mean, available and they get picked either that one kind of makes sense to me i know a lot more talking about the you know like the top four squads it's like yeah man they get like one more search or one more hard point like they might they might win the tournament like it's really just like but this one should be interesting vegas actually i like vegas playing this map because uh if they can actually like put up a decent look on this map especially in that first yeah, winner's I mean, bracket match they're going to have probably is basically like either fifth or sixth seed against through. either Toronto, FaZe, or Not Optic. Really, and then they started getting taken away and the yeah. struggle started to happen. So Vegas know this. They're going to start to be looked at. So it's an interesting look. I know Toronto and Optic don't necessarily play high rise. FaZe has played high rise. Let's take a look at some of our search and destroy stats here for the major two qualifiers. We're so close. But it gives, it gives them something to Miami think, right? Would you rather play like. Tuesday. Would you rather play high rise? Would you play like term, you know? Joe, as you were going through stuff, what were your thoughts? Yeah, and, you know, we talked about map pool. I think SD, this is, uh, you know, another one where they're definitely going to want to get better. But you look at that, those bottom two stats. I mean, the first first in the league in conversion rate. So when they're getting first bloods, they are winning 80, almost 87% of their rounds. So can they find a little wow. bit, maybe more? Caroline's only won half of their 4v3s uh, is, is um, fucking abysmal. There's no uh, way. Uh, there's no way that stat's correct, right? They've only won 50%. It's yeah, fucking I mean, this criminal. Kind of issue, right, with Carolina. It's actually it's criminal. criminal. Better through major one, but it feels like Yo, two out. times, two times. Going away. A lot was on. Well, their search is getting a bit better, but you see this stats wise, it still still needs some work. So like, let's battle first. Let's the same, you know. Um, or opening duels, like not, not every. Not like the same. Version rates. But when it's like when you're 12, like, is this something where like you're getting a kill and it's just you're not decisive enough beyond, behind that or taking a risk? I mean, it's probably a combination of all. Of yeah, it is just like little challenge, like right. the second step of the map after we have this first blood. Where do we want to go? How do we want to execute? Because anyone can come up with like an opening, you know, here's our route, so the break is what I'm doing. But if it's after that, yeah, then it gets hard. At two yeah, time, gentlemen. Certain yep. situations. It's talking about those first bloods. Maybe you want coming right up right now first with that rival. There's going to be the first. Has TJ. Nearby with the right. should have said that so Carolina is only won half of their 4v3s this stage. So great job by I don't know if that was correct or not, but that was fucking okay. insane if it's true. It they're dead last, Joe, uh, so it there, makes sense. No, well, the that's actually one. just He'll unacceptable. Now you're going to see if they can still get that uh, incredible conversion rate that they have. You put it back into a 3 2 favor quickly. It's a nice trade. This fellow Ooh, was, some the time for Dill. was able to take out Purge. So you're efficient there if you are Vegas Legion. Now, TJ, about to get a maybe the guy three. trying to make a play. We'll see what the oh, timing will be like. Oh, or if it's that's going some to be He's got one to his right, one to his left. Decisions to make. Going to take out the first, maybe grab an MCW, and now he can Ooh. snap. I, I was thought see, he was going to turn on him for exactly a second. You exactly what he was going <laughs> for, but maybe you try to get around the corner and stay alive oh, a little bit longer, but <laughs> nearly able to turn and burn. Yeah, he's not yeah, being I was clicking on one this round. I didn't know the one game. Because you have attached all the way across the map, just kind of saying, hey, I will help pinch based on the numbers, pretty much play off of me, play your life. And there we go, there's the info from Attach, hits the slide and he is out, round done. Oh my on God. You know, it's funny, I was thinking he like knew there was another because he just kept looking over he there the entire out. time. I thought he got a comm or something. This way he kept looking left, kept Bro, looking I love left, watching but... these guys. And then like They're the instant team. MCW and Dude, snap I feel like, off, like Geo. Yo, did video. somebody just yeah, ask, like, super chatted? Like, Geo might be star, uh, uh, might be in that rookie so of the year category, bro. The way you're shooting, bro. First blood conversion I saw that yesterday, Tom. My chat started like, cooking me. Mm -mm. I think uh, mm -mm. he's in the combo. I think this major three cycle will be really key because Wynn was looking good. Carolina's been kind of iffy to stage. Lynch is looking good. Minnesota's been iffy to stage. Geo is most certainly in the combo, and say otherwise, yeah. we'll just be.
wrong. So, I think I, the Sage Tree is going to determine a lot of that, I think. Geo's been, Geo's been looking good. I'm excited to see how he plays on land, for sure. Yeah, I mean, if he has... Don't fall in that. So, three on three. That's one of those where it's like, who's the first fly? Basically, somebody drops the same instant, right? Yeah, and then the third down low, but nice shots from Fella with the Red It's inspirational. Is Gwyn's going to find mm, one, so he's going to one on two. This is a nice read. Throws the stun out, and it looks like Nero's just pushing this, and he's a bubble. What the? Off what the, the fuck? What a ballad, Nero. Play from Nero, Nero what climbs fuck? on up. A great balance. He hopped, he hopped on the I wall and shot him high. The top. He did the yeah, wall. Ran at him. Holy shit. That's respectable, yeah. Look at him go, though. That oh was almost God. real, That was real awkward. awkward. That was so yeah, awkward. Yeah, he the wrong corner. Yeah. And that dude, I was about to say, like, I thought, I thought Purge's like centering and like restap was really clean. I when you go fell on a pistol, I was like, okay, that, that, that was probably real. That's from his end too. Dude, I thought Purge almost beautiful double there, but just uh, comes up a bullet short. But now up 2 0 I think technically uh, got the first blood there in a cash, I think before he was instantrated. So uh, City Real Madrid, Madrid is the time I'm most yep, excited for. <laughs> Microphone <laughs> activated. <laughs> In Carolina, just kind of back to his default. Two players down low. Nero gonna give that calm. Just watching that cross. And Purge, just based on the timing, he was thinking about jumping, thinking about waiting. Almost gets caught and does get caught. Ooh, oh my that's god. trying to find the trade, but TJ known for being a very quick climb. Okay, Dale. Ladder. And where you know you've, if you're Carolina World Rams, you? you're last in that conversion rate. Well, you get the first ball. Oh, that's insane. Now you're. In a two versus two. Oh my god, insane timing. What the fuck? We'll see that if is they insane. Can Clay's gonna be round, pissed if he watches that back. Able to get a pick. Gonna be all on Carolina. These guys are this dog now shit. Looking to clutch. We'll see if he can get kind of two one on ones here. He's got a little time to work with. 35 seconds, not stressing yet, but Bomb obviously in a tough spot. Yeah, Bomb's on. I think the best thing for him is they have no clue where he is. He's not into a spot. That kind of plus the time that you can actually make oh, get around. Oh, there we go. He's just going to run by Gio, oh, but Gio turns oh around. So, uh, again, the time Wait, is Dill's caught. in a good spot, though. I don't think Fella's going to check this. But the time on the clock is not. He's got 10 seconds, five to plant. Snaps. And again, Attach is trying to waste time. And I think oh, he has well. done it again. Salt in round one. Bomb cannot be planted. Gio actually checks it. He actually oh, checks if he was on it. I thought he was going to go for the plant there. There we go. Vegas up 3-0. Enough time. I mean, a fellow did a whole lap of the map. Like, I don't know. Where Look are these at these guys at? I mean, the timing he no, got with Gio in the chat. Like four and a half <laughs> And then, I mean, he, the, the read there onto attach. He's able to win that. But, God, I mean. To my chat, Maybe, maybe man, it's kind of frustrating to watch. He he's, didn't. He's looking at a lap like the entire map. Four seconds yeah, left. Yeah, but I think if he grabbed the bomb and, and played for a slide play instantly, like you, I don't know, I mean, his movement was just ass. The helipad, but I think Geo like jump behind the five second play trap. So. <clears throat> Sometimes Tommy's on this map can be tough. Yeah, it's high rise in a nutshell. Gwen, rival in hand, just lurking by B. TJ kind of here with him, just holding the angle. You can see Geo. I mean, they got a trophy all the way back, kind of in their window. They're thinking maybe somebody's going to get aggressive here. Hold and take this gunfight. Peeking it for info. Yeah, TJ just ready, waiting, lurking, getting some damage in. But now the gig is up, and that position's not going to work for now. Got a gunfight down low. Some nice damage in from Fell, but good job just backing down. It's going to be tough to get a clean kill, and finally it's Quinn on the site. Oh, that trophy. That would hit fuck? Nero, but a nice heads up play from TJ and Gwyn. The double chalice on point okay. out of Carolina this round. Carolina's going to get one here. Nice defense. Right, this is Gio. surely uncomfortable yeah, I mean, from Gio, right? That rival in these close quarter combat scenarios. Picking up kills. Gio can't quite All keep right, the Carolina's track. Carolina's on the board. Gwyn's able to get two in the round. And Royal Ravens, you finally get on the board. Carolina on the fucking board, nice baby. Set up, and as you said, fellow. He was kind of, we see Nero do it, watching that cross from down low. From the Vegas side on defense, he's just playing the, the info down low. Able to back your way and some nice kills from him in the round. And we're still snapping a bit. Yeah, yeah, he had a couple good snaps and like a couple situations that maybe you kind of ego chow in that moment. But I thought it was just a good job, like just getting down, staying yeah, especially up. Especially MCW, right? You're just thinking gunfight. Yeah. Well, especially like, I mean, he snapped on someone's forehead in the second one, but still gets out of harm's way, gets knows. I mean, he gets traded instantly, even if he wins that. I think they had, what, numbers at that point? Plays it well, so three in a row for him, two for Gwen. A much needed round. 
of this is kind of been the same standard setup here. How is it going to be a little bit different? TJ's going to run into a nade, so there's some info for Purge. And there is a first blood. Geo from the helipad stairs. With how quick, or well, how slowly they just haven't really been working up towards B. They've allowed some positions to go okay. the way of Vegas, but a nice trade from Fellow. It's just like once your positions give it up, sometimes this map is <laughs> oh, a place dude, so going for it, dude. A bit. Just, 100%. Any peak someone could be holding from somewhere. <laughs> like Nate hits you now, you're like, okay, now what do I do? But uh, TJ able to wrap back out. Yeah, Dylan's trying it. Bomb planted now to the three versus three. Interesting spot here for Roy. Has to be careful. That's an explosive barrel. Nice to emerge though. Some great shots. Able to find the headshot with the rival. Oh. Almost gets a second. Oh, but he I can't believe he got the kill. Oh, he's going to win that. It's down to TJ. One on two. He gets Bro, picked what are they apart. Doing? It comes down to the retake. Carolina, it's a Who's great question. Get it? And yeah, what well, Purge, like in the 3v3, gets that open First kill. One. I know you were impressed by that. Well, yeah, I mean, he almost found another one. So. Game yeah, on you up a bit. I mean, uh, it's as high as I can go Why without it getting, like, a little too loud. To there. And then everyone's position's known due to him. So just Purge is leading the way. It's I'll jack like up, like, a little. Here we can see TJ just, like, maybe trying to catch a timing <laughs> mm -hmm. with the rival. Knows he's going to have to finesse. Microphone activated. But this has been all Legion. Started to Dylan was in the window. Yeah, he's playing the ledge spot in his spawn window. Like when you spawn to your right and you're like, you know what I mean? Sort of like top four and playing that window. Your channel. Microphone well, now with the run from Thieves, the run from Legion, starting to, I don't know, feel like the middle of the pack. Mr. Yeah. Tommy yeah, G, what's up, bro? Tier now. <laughs> Man, this shit's dusted, son. The fuck? What's dusted? This this series right now? Another first block yeah. over to Legion. Nero Tom, what's going on with Carolina, bro? Talk to me. Trades it. I don't know. They just look like now they're fucking. Three. Oh, it kind of looks like they're getting joked a little bit, but like, <laughs> what's wrong with these guys, Jimmy? Again, be able to get these that looks like they're getting joked more often than not. But I don't know. They're also just letting and fucking. And doing a good job enough to one. They let locks. Geo. I think maybe he's like have his way. I yeah, feel. Like he's ready for it. Along with Purge, nice like Purge is doing his thing. Just kind of had to back away, shooting the barrels. Attach, though, just going to work up, plant this. Weird situation. Pressure. Like I don't know. Vegas is like teamwork and. Exactly uh, how they just want overall execute. team play has just been pretty pretty good. I hear. Wayne trying to hit the player on the bottom. Way better than happen. Carolina. And they pounce on that immediately. I need TJ to find two no here. No hesitation. Geo gets oh, on it quickly. On TJ. I'm sure. Sam, but TJ well, that is in trouble. Another and, uh, round to Vegas. And Geo needs two more kills or something. Comfortable again? The this problem is, is if you look at the one round, fucking round, round that's the problem. This is supposed to be a good series. Team, Instead, it's a fucking barrel getting shooting, fucking dusted on. We are getting dust on. Getting shit on. Really, outside of that, it's kind of absolute dusting. You know what apart, I mean? I can't like do these picks against these teams anymore, bro. I can't. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Not challenging. Absolute dusting. Well, I can't read any series, bro. Like today, I'm thinking Toronto's gonna slam LATs right now. Watch, LATs is gonna fucking come out and make it a series. Watch, you guys. Or some shit. Yeah, like for, it's not the same, but like it's a little bit easier when you're Clay like you might end this one 0 and 5. It was round. It's all right. I did a TJ like two piece LG, here and Geo two like piece with gone. Oh, gosh, shout out Sam LaRue and Nikki. Oh, DJ. shit. DJ, oh. don't even think about oh, it. Oh, some shout out, Sam. Shout out. Hey, that's Sam LaRue. Some information there. Oh, if you're the uh, information comes the way. I fear Clay and his map 0 5. Quickly, Fellow last alive and he is dropped. Oh, no. It's a 6 Legion 1 victory. Uh, Legion make the headset slam. Yeah, he's Continue out of here. Headsets out. From the rest there of the he pack. goes. First time they've played uh, on the horizon. Well, <sighs> this, is, this is looking like a quickie. Headset out. There he goes, folks. Go Wait, did he just go Owen? Yeah, he went Owen 5. He went Owen. Dude. He joins the club with me. Yeah. I can't even count my Owen, though. Like, it was on fucking Desert Siege, S&D. Like, that shit was not real. Guys, I would like to announce to the team speak in a non-boastful way. Yes, my picks did hit. Thank you for asking. Samuel Octane. Let's go, Tom G. Woot, 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 woot. Blaster, Owen 5. Did you hear you got a good shout out in the last round? He joins, the donut, oh, he he gets, he joins oh. me in the donut club, man. Yeah, the Dunkin' Donuts Club. I fear Clay has a fucking donut point zero this count, map for this game. Seriously. My donut really doesn't count. I have... It was on Desert Siege. Like, that map wasn't real. Shut up, Vegas. I need 20... How many kills are you in Dolos next map? 
just doesn't look as lopsided as <laughs> Shout out Desert Siege. That's crazy. Yeah. Those words have never been spoken ass. before. <laughs> Those words so in that order have never been uttered oh in history. Oh my god, the breakable history. walls, bro. The breakable walls. Like, what were we playing, man? Yo, remember the wall bang Tom and Tom with the Bima? I can't believe, like. No, yeah, like, just through the window. So, like, I don't know. There was a definitely a cheese map for sure. So far, great, so that was a great map. Glad, so glad we added it into the rotation. Definitely a cheese map, bro. Would have rather Gavutu, I fear. Gavutu. Would have rather fucking. Wow, that Dude, that, 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 that game had that terrible game maps. SD, that game for S and D had terrible maps. That game in that game in general had terrible maps. I was about to say like they're all they're just bad. They were all bad. Yeah, they're they're not good. Bocage was fun. I want to say it's a good map. No, it was, it was fun. not good. I enjoyed it, you know. I got dopamine playing it. Enjoyed for the sure. next. Damn, did you enjoy the definitely next one? Definitely better map? than it's. It's definitely better first map Bocage than like first map Invasion. Like, like oh, we're about to get lit here. Like everyone knows what's about to go down. Because it's kind of you know. About to be an absolute bang out. Like here we go, lock in. But then like you know. Sometimes, sometimes you were just getting like a fucking Bokash map one, Desert Siege map two, Gavu two map three. You're just thinking in your head like, yo, you could really get the some just diabolic map sets in Vanguard, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? You could play this? the bullshit in Vanguard. Like Gavu two map one, uh, Desert Siege map. You could play a Gavu Gav map three. Desert Gav Boke. Bur Berlin last map. <laughs> Berlin. I mean Berlin wasn't that bad, but holy shit, bro! Double Gav Boke. Get me out of there. You could actually play. Holy it. shit! No, it's actually. Play it. <laughs> uh, gonna be even be. <laughs> play Gav Bokaj, fucking Berlin. <laughs> That was my hell. That was my personal hell, Listen, I think. Listen, we need 24 kills from Dill in this map. A Gav, Desert, Siege, I mean, not Gav, Siege, Gav, Boke, fucking... What was another shit map? For no, no, no. Double Boke. What are you talking about? Double Boke. Boke. <laughs> Boke Kosh map 5 for the fucking bread. You're just sticking in your head. Wow, this fucking... This sucks. <laughs> Dude, Tom, we were in the grand finals of a major tournament and we spawned it on a Boke S and D that we haven't played in fucking eight years and we were just Lock like, yo, it, fuck gentlemen. it, bro. Lock it. <laughs> we got this shit. Motherfuckers are staring through fucking wall cracks Lock and walls. It. They're shooting little holes like they're playing R6 in the cover to looking through it. Oh my god, bro. Like I don't have a trophy system. I'm just sitting oh on my fucking god, man. I'm sitting on spots that I could just get fucking double naded. I'm thinking in my head, like, are they gonna nade me this round? Like, I oh, played it late. with the ladder glitch. Wow. <laughs> Can't pull my gun out anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just running out of losing compose. See, that's how I know we hated the map. We literally got a bug in a grand final. We didn't give a fuck. Yeah, all right, well, we were so we we weren't expecting we were this like, one. Oh, anyway. We're on to the next. <laughs> I can't believe he's centered right there to kill him. That was crazy. What in the fuck? Bump, 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 bump. Hey, shot. Sam, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Yo, Tom, I got a super chat. You mind if I, uh, if I let it rip for you? Yeah, let it rip. It's probably a happy fucking birthday. I'm gonna go fuck uh, him. Sir. It's from Derek Hopkins. He this gave me four ninety nine, and he mm -hmm. told me to tell you happy birthday. That's phenomenal work. I mean, he's just, I mean, Sam, he's cashing out by these birthday wishes. You know it's what I'm saying? It's the same guy every day. It's the same fucking guy. It's Derek. I, I know Derek. I know who he is. <laughs> every day. Fucking asshole. Hello. Hey, guys. How's hey. it going? Hey, what's hey, up, guys? Berg, what's going on, man? Hey. Adam has broken. No. Oh, no. <laughs> Wait, what happened with his bed? I just, I just lost Dude. Yo, Ben, Ben. Yeah, ben. I'm back. I'm back. Would you so rather you drive a sports? Toyota or a Chevy? the number one reason you don't bet on college sports right there. Is this a, is this a, like, what do you mean? What do you mean? Which one, one would you rather drive? Gentlemen, would you rather drive a Toyota or would you rather drive a Chevy? With a very one -sided match I think it's a so joke, far, so I'm not going to respond. Listen, okay, Toyota. fucking piece of shit. Toyota. Thank you, Berg. Thank you, Berg. Berg, Toyota? Toyota, for sure. The question. Thank you for answering the question. Toyota Super, 95, man. What about you, Ben? Toyota or Chevy? I... Probably Toyota. Fuck it, asshole. Wait, what's the joke? Chef, these balls in your mouth or something like that? Yeah, balls in your mouth. Yeah, yeah, I don't know what it could be. Not in your mouth, I would assume. Yeah, 100%. It's something with Chevy, but I don't know what it would be. Chevy, these balls. Tom, I feel like MC. You need to get a new fucking gun next, bro. 
<laughs> Chubby. Shove That's these nuts in your mouth. Yeah. Wow, well, shove these yeah. nuts in your mouth. There you go. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. yeah. Legion versus yeah. Royal Ravens here. Uh, gotta be that, right? Gotta be frustrated after that last Chubby. one. Chubby. Hey, Yo, Ben, congrats uh, on the new car. You got a Yuka. You know, he, uh, he drops a yeah. Here's a good one. Too, kind of I like that one. That was a good one. All right, please 3 0 these shitters. Let's go. I don't like it for early dinner, bro. I'm thinking TJ. I never thought I'd do Sushi. The Legion are time respecters, dude. I could do sushi. I, I kind of oh, that would be a good play. Nice you know, spider roll, dude. Dude, <laughs> get some my, fucking. My dear Tom. Listen, ben, I got an idea. What? Put it in the chat. I don't want to say that loud. Yeah, no, I mean, this is the end of the game. No, it's too large, bro, and I'm also streaming, so, like, what am I going to do? Does he want to go walk over and pick it up for me? You're going to you're gonna tuck that shit in on stream, and no, I will not do that. I mean, they're special today. It's pretty good. It's like double the Yeah, I know. Oh, no. Yo, lock in. Shut up. Shut up. You get some Nagiri, Ben? You just call it a day. Hey, hey. Shut up. Apologies. Lock in, Tom. You can learn a thing or two from these guys. It is two times. Maybe I can. Maybe. Two time, two time. And let's lock in. Two times. Maybe I can. Maybe I also can't. Maybe they might teach me some bad shit. Correct. Maybe they'll teach me one. Just look at the orange arrows. They know what's going on. The orange arrows really, they're, they're fucking tightening the noose right now. Look at them. Jesus. Here on Seriously. Yeah, trying to, we see one oh my God. But a nice retake. Now they got to be worried about that B push. You see a couple players. You see that? You see how they tighten that one up they there? Here we go. We're going B. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, here we go. We already got dumpy control. Yeah, TJ's already there. Let's go. Inspirational plays oh, no, out. Oh, we got it. And he's going to challenge Yellow Alley. No, he's not. I hate this, man. I hate it. Is attack kill war? I hope so. I up, hope so. Off, that's always a tough Dude, the Dylan oh, over, yeah, yeah, yeah. might have been a free today, man. We don't even oh, care no. about the B point. Oh, but we, we kind of just trust our teammates to win every gunfight, jumping over the half wall. Vegas, so you get them off of Isn't... Oh my god. See, this guy's getting joked. Oh, Quinn has been getting joked all series. Did you get a two time? Oh, I gotta hit a two time. You might have to rip it to her, brother. You said, whoa, where the bad comms, bro? I'm like, fellas, we're out of You guys got bad fucking comms, dude. Like, we said two times. Adam, do you want anything from Sushi? I didn't say I heard you. Now you get the extra minute to work. Adam, you should pull up to Benjay's apartment and then kick it on the couch while he streams, and you should sit in the background. Oh, uh, uh, you see, well, the problem is my couch, couch is not behind him. Couch is not on my stream. So. Okay, we'll move the couch then. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'll move my couch right back. next to my <laughs> fucking <laughs> the, the kitchen <laughs> counter. That's that a great be, idea. That would be an insane turn of events oh, the for Ben's stream. Yeah. Oh, shit. All of a sudden, Ben and Adam just start making out on cam. What? What? <laughs> Tom, what is with Tom? You have CT way too early today, bro. It's way too early. It's way too early for the CT right now, bro. That would be an insane way too early. Ben's stream. Adam comes oh, over there. Oh, slammed there that by couch. Dylan. Just another, what, one of those My fear is a mute out angle. Nah, no, we, no, I muted out because no, we were yapping no. hard. Right, can, Tom, we lock? Yeah, can we lock? Tom, Tom is unlocked completely. You need hey, to okay, everybody shut the fuck up and lock in. Everybody shut the fuck up and lock in. Good copy, Ben. I wish someone said that before. Ben, ben, look at you taking initiative. I like when you raise your voice, Ben. I mean, I'm sweating, bro. I need 24 from Dill this map, like... 24? Yeah. Oh, fuck. We already got five. We're chilling. Geo's a shooter. This is gonna be a 3-0, though. Here we go, attach. Yeah, here we go. I hope not. That was a grueling. Uh, all right, go. Kill Geo. It's a 3-0 if they win this D. Up here. Actually, it might... Uh, you find him. They cannot. All good. Just go to the hill. Now we're dead. This shit's dusted. Oh, the time. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Hold on. Oh, uh, Perja. needed that to win. Oh, they're throwing. What the fuck are we doing? Oh my God. Geo. Geo. Oh, the trigger discipline. Lip in the neck. Go to the hill. Kill the guy off the point. Kill the guy off the point, Geo. No, no, kill the guy off the point. Geo, go back to the point. He's okay. He's okay. I'm taking his time. I'm taking his time. He's taking his time. His teammates are going to get out for the free ski. He's thinking in his head. Where the fuck is this guy? Oh, he's on the desk. Oh, that's a big one from Gwen. What are we doing? doing? Oh my God. Yeah, he almost died. Oh, God. There we go. We stabilize. Stabilize. But they took their time. Did Vegas eh. Vegas died ten doing. times. They sent one of the pace right now for sure. It's got a simulator. Yo, what's going on with Clay, bro? Oh, he's getting, what's going on with Clay? He's, he's getting harpooned this year. I might have a point two right now. No, no, no. Too late. 
Should you know, the hard what's, what's Claystrike currently going? He, he can't be good. Point well, five zero, something like, right now. Well, well he had zero in kills in the S and D, and that yeah, really so doesn't help. Right. Claystrike is I mean, currently had, what, uh, he's getting pooped on right now. Sixteen and thirty-one. That's not ideal. Holy fuck. It's it's tough to like a lot of times. What's it's Geo right now? Like crazy Geo dribble, like is a, a 33 and 21, like, 1.5. Right. All right, so I need Geo to get 20 he some kills here. Yeah, like starting on defense, right? Like where you're kind of defending. I think, no, yeah. you, what'd you say? What'd you say? He's at 33 and 21. Oh, I only need a fucking I need a fucking 18 bomb from him, and we're good. That's doable. One of one is a beast. Clay is in the point fours right now. One of one is a nickname. Maybe there's something comes to life a little bit here, and they start to bring it back, or is this just going to be a three? Ah, oh, hell no. Hey, Pop a purge. Ten and five. Okay, purge. 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 Oh my god, maybe even maybe I'm just thinking I was gonna get the best player of the year, bro. No, we were gassing him up a lot in the green room. Dude. You just had to get acclimated. Yeah, you just getting pooped on. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Some like, reps, I don't even know he had a KG, a KD that Gotta get that confidence, you know? KD just get a little confidence. Get some reps in. Get some reps, get some confidence back in your gameplay and your valid. Like Guy's a warrior. Look, he's doing the damn thing. Oh shit. Well, he's up to eleven now and his team's starting to work towards A. Carolina have done a pretty good job. That's two pumps. Keeping them okay, off this, but I think the second he's two will come in right here. Yeah. Maybe the rest two of the points. So now the focus will probably be on B. And we'll see if they can two pumps get the job done for sure. Come on, we just, we just go down. You want to? You want to? Yup, yup. Good feed. Good feed. Oh, that's actually crazy that he stunts like that. Good play. Before there's 30 seconds left in the round, I mean, it's oh, no. looking like there already might be a little success, but it's probably oh, going to go around the here. We're going to send one for a spawn so trap. We're going to play the yellow and red. We're going to get some trades. We're going to clear course. seven. We're going to spawn trap. Here we go. Here we get our zombie spawn. Here comes playing up red. We're going to get some trades. No. We're not. We gotta get, we gotta clear out our shack here, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, there's a smoke on my screen. Whoa, 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 whoa. That had to have been an accident. Definitely an accident. He definitely frowned upon his He threw it. He's just throwing smokes. Definitely a frown. I feel like that's a good play. Dude, help. Here we go. We just checked him out. We're good. We just checked him out. That's all. Oh, it was an accident. Oh, it was an accident. Oh, Joel, you guys got to do bro. Now they're checked out. Got zombie spawns. Oh! Now they have the transition. Wow. Play was trying to get into a spot, spawns. so it just fell out. Zombie spawns right is good. Over towards zombie BB. spawns. Get the here we go. Red spawn. That's yeah, what they were yeah, here we go. 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 I don't like this. I don't like this. Not one bit do I like this. That's a red card if I ever seen one, folks. I don't like this. Okay, Clay gets a nice little moment there. We're able to get two. Stay right here. Wait for our boys. You know, you're in sort of a two versus three. You maybe don't have numbers. And he's brought it now to 7 and 13. 30 seconds to go. Fly. Oh my god, wait. Fly. Fucking pick him in. Yeah, fly, 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 fly. Go fly, fly, fly. There we go. Fly. Yeah, there we go. Here we go. Nope. Nope. Snap back in there, but you're not going to get the kill. You're not going to be able to bring it home. Maybe the game is Dumpster side spawn. And we're getting zombie spawn. Zombies. 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 Everybody get on point. It's time to win. Everybody get on point. Stop. I'm starting. And the round is over. Like Carolina is awful. When you have those close red spots, right, I need Carolina. Listen, I need Carolina to win this offense for this bat, please. I need just something. I need something from these boys, bro. Yeah, honestly, like there wasn't giving me nothing. Like I'm gonna lose the same way I lost my fucking MC like over under like just purely due to like lack of map time, bro. Yeah, here we go. It's, it's, it's three, four down, and bang, hey, you're on to the point. Hey, can you give Ryan fucking power? Yeah, just a he did. 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 He this has been impressive. Bro, Geo impressive is disgusting. Here. One of one right there, baby. Again, for Carolina, if they lose this one, there's still Can a chance they can start winners. Yeah, Relying my boy. On, uh, some others in the lead, depending on how the matches mm -hmm. go. But you, you never want that as a player. It's my boy right there. I just there. really Seriously. kind of expected more, just considering yeah. what's but on you the might be the new center, the winners, honestly. A little more fire, a little the more passion. Is that a compliment? It's tough it's to good do when you're losing, I know, but... Everyone you touch with turns out to be gold. A statement from Legion. 
We're not talking about that. I mean, that's gas. Like that's been happening to me the, my this whole career. Crazy yeah, yeah, reverse sweeps I've seen. Kids that's for me. sure. But it starts with an offensive round. Good off, Ethan Dill. Left your channel. You do a great job. Yeah, that's a real efficient work there. You know right? You're off like five lives. You're able to get it. Probably the best we've seen from them. But then Purge comes through like a hammer and able to take out two. Slow things down for now. Oh, he's gonna find a third as well. Yeah, yeah Purge just hits right over towards good, safety. Uh, kind of blocks those spawns. So yeah, yeah, again, he's the one making that play. Yeah. Okay. For Vegas, Needs for like reason, he's still on this roster. Carolina, yeah, just please, oh god, just runs offense. Is now Carolina gonna start to work up through junk? <laughs> But he, well, Dylan, Ben, 24. 24 from Dylan. His no, name is Dandy. He has if I get a stun, bro. Hopefully he doesn't get hit by it, so Tatch able to... And maybe he might... Chain together two. Well, let's get active, Gio 101. Here you have oh, Red. that's... Back to the blender. Go, Carolina. Now oh. you're taking shots as you're basically taking snaps no, out of no, spawn. No, Dylan's watching left through, now. We're just not in a position to get kills. So quickly, you were able to kind of slip through the crash down. Wait, what are we doing? Apply a little bit of pressure over towards B. I don't know. Scans were in for a second. You have a heroic moment in you now if you're Royal Ravens. Got him weak. Oh, my God. Can you muster something together? TJ's going to drop. Geo hit. Geo hit. Oh, my God. He's out of it. Calm, cool. I'm not blocking red, though. It's just fun close. Yeah, take their time. Can I find a picture, too? need a touch. How did that not open the doors? Now they're all grouped up. You still need have to touch. What? How, how many more kills does Dylan need? He needs five kills. I need five more kills. And he's gonna find the first one. That'll slow things down yeah. here. Thirteen lives remaining. Oh, looking good time. Oh, there is yo, Parrish just finessing, leading the way. Win is getting joked, bro. Somebody's gotta check his name. Oh, oh my, my God! God. So they're getting joked. Yeah. No, seriously. Locked, that was gross. No, they are getting joked. That was absolutely gross. That guy was one shot. No, he was one shot for like four fucking. And a remarkable series like, here from Vegas. Three dead! Oh, three dead. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. The last guy is in fucking bounds. No, like what are we shooting for? Oh, no. Carolina Royal Ravens are on to it. going to go quick. This is good for bets, though. I will say this is good for bets. Great for bets. I need Dylan to go so deep. They're not going to get. They're not going to get here in time. Oh, they're getting there. He's going to find and kill him and Geo. You were not forced on this if you were Carolina. It comes down to one on one. Oh, we're Queen World. We're Queen World. We're Queen World. So still a chance here for the Ravens. All right, I need five from Dylan this round. Please give me five. I need five, bro. Maybe some momentum. Maybe, maybe he thought it was done. Or preferably, I need Vegas not to win this off. Offense. If Vegas doesn't win his offense, I think we're good. He had like a little bit more Dude. to do than like we saw in the previous round. I'll take either or option. Five this or we go to Vegas round five. Legion, I thought for a second maybe it's a chance for them to get back, but not going to happen. They close it out, and now they try to claw their way back in this one. Maybe I just Wayne saw. can earn a streak. You hold the defense here. It comes down to around five. Come on, Clay. Lock it in. But I just saw, like, yes, yeah, one or two players from Ravens kind of hop off that point. All right. And that obviously slows, slows things down. Where is Dylan going? Uh, Top three. Okay. Point. But uh, able, able to, to go. hold on to it was win. I'm just challenging arches, actually. Wait, we might get one. Over to Fellow. And Clay trying to lock down this A side of the map. But Clay getting it taken down. Again, just some frustration. Yeah, if Dylan goes one. From Clay. It's just the time he's not going his way. Oh, that timing was unbelievable, bro. See, maybe they can go Fellow's way. He's got one on the uh, bridge side. Oh, no, it might. He thought it was going to be horrible. Oh, it was, oh Gio it got was the kill. No. Bad. I think it's Gio that ultimately. I need, I need four. Timing, please, please. We've got a lot of round left, Ben J. Yeah, no, they're good. They're good. He's got three this. In a row. A about no. To done. Clay's turn now. Yes. Looking to pounce. Oh, my God. The frustrations oh my God. Clay's continue having a if you are Clay. One, Just one of those series that's going to eat man. you. Yeah, he's All right, don't get a freebie on a spawn there, kill. It looks like he's able to find it. If he finds the first kill, maybe his team helps Going back him for out. seconds. They transition over to this yeah, B defense. Guys, he's the guy out there. Just look at the map position you have right now for Vegas. You are they all over the trap, place. Bro. They, moves, they, they, they would have yeah, if Dylan didn't fucking tall. pinch. Oh, they know this guy's back here. Oh, they lost aim assist for a second. Which is kind of DJ's just getting hunted. Players. Let's go. Bro, we need two more. Right <laughs> Surely we get two. Two is so doable. Come on, Dill. Yes. Oh. There's no way he's not getting to, bro. Oh, my yeah, God. Bro, don't say that. You come to me. <laughs> don't fucking <laughs> say shit like that. <laughs> between him and Nero. This is my real estate. I not get it. Who's going first? He's not oh, even getting a freebie, bro. Well, they got some help, though. <laughs> what are the demons? Can Nero waste yeah, no enough freebies. time for his so teammates tough. to take control of Red? That's really the goal here. I mean, he's mm. wasted a good amount of time. He's been alive in this area forever. One just kind of hits it right Fuck. up the gut, though. Gwyn's able to catch that. Number two in Geo. We'll see if he can make the play. He's at least able Why to get one. On the now point? They start to push up towards the point. Try to take TJ out of the point. Coming up with spawns going to be Clayster. Oh, freebie for Dylan. Yes, we need one more. 
Oh my god, no, this could get so bad, please. Oh no. I might literally get hooked by one. He gets caught middle alley. It looks like Attach is able to win that gunfight. I'm not getting hooked by one. I'm getting hooked. Oh my god, please. I got hooked by one. Oh my god, Adam, send me cash right now. Semi yeah, cash right now. Adam, Apple Adam, cash five dollars so right now. Say, Why would you say yeah, something? Why would you say something? Bro, what happened? Bro, Adam ben, jinxed me. Shut the fuck up. Adam, 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 <laughs> Adam jinxed two, me, bro. Adam, Adam needed two more kills. Oh, <laughs> oh dude. Ben, how much did he lose? Two fifty? Adam said. Oh, for one. Two and three. Ben said there's no way Joe gets two more kills. I had to do it as well. He got twenty three. His number was twenty three and a half. So he did pick the dot. Good right Bro, now. blame you Adam. Adam just cost it as funds, Tommy. Yes. Adam just straight cost us funds. No way, bro. Yo, once again, bet on the results of the match. Whether he was blacked out drunk last night, bet on Paris to win in one cash. Holy shit, bro. Fucking Adam just cost me money, bro. I'm loving the rest of this match, bro. I've played for a week, and I'm 27 and 5 in my last picks, and you just hate me. Damn, I heard fucking crying. People in the chat are fucking going crazy, dude. I fear I just said an extra minute. What's your chat? 0.5. Someone said he needs to try out a new nail color. Jesus Christ. Christ, that's insane. That is actually no, fucking insane. Fellow stepped up. You know, he painted really nails minus twenty percent aim assist. That's true. Like, I can't uh, even tell the rest of my fucking bat. Still a chance for them to start in winners, but oh no, no. Yeah, they're frustrated right now. Yeah, it's an insane one just because those final two teams. Like, if you end up with what five? I don't know to pick on this Rocker Miami series though. Top four, the way. Yeah, I know either. Battle the mids. Once the rest of the time's like four piece. In, but yeah, they're there. Can't do fucking links now. Uh, to break down that first match, we kick it back to the desk. Take it away, guys. Thanks so much, Maven and Merck. And this was faster than I expected. I was hoping for a game five, uh, but Vegas didn't give Carolina uh, any breathing room in this series. I'm actually so tilted down. at what just happened. Was there an MVP? It's I saw okay, great moments from Geo. I saw Kissing, great I moments from Nero. Or is it just a team event? How would you guys describe this match? Team effort, for sure. I, I say think we've just seen a completely different What's map two in this upcoming team? series? Geo, it's Karach, right? They look like different players in the they past series that we saw them. No fucking clue. They are playing teams that already kind of been on the Someone throw me a map set. Any map set isn't there? I'm looking at him. Incredible. The hard point. I knew it was gonna be a, a big stinky crop. Bro, the what are you saying? Bro, Tom, I need you to like lock your brain in. You just said real high two. rise. No, you are real high rise. Karaj is so good. Oh, then we're we're we're, we're taking Linz. Linz. We didn't Linz get us eight on a map two. What do you think? Eight on a map two. Holy shit. You think we think we get eight out of Linz on a fucking high rise, or do we think we can get twenty four on Linz on a Karaj? On a Karach fucking control. Dude, that sounds insane. I don't like... I feel like it's hard to drop that many kills. We got real map ones though. They just they took all the map ones off the board. <clears throat> How come Adam's putting in a fucking... In my DM raid tonight? Like, you really want to do a raid on Destiny, dude? Do we take Lamar... Do we take Lamar under on the Karach? Then we take a Lamar under on the Karach, right? 23 and a half. Do we think Lamar's getting 24 in a Karachi control time? Uh, I fear he's ignoring you. All right. Brother, take yapping. the unders on everybody, bro. Okay. You yap. All right, I'm in here. Sound like we're muted. Like, he's yapping when I want him to yap, and he's like, this not when I want him. Like, like fuck off, bro. Your play of the game brought to you by Scuff, and this one, who better to bring it to you than Gio? Walk me through the AR, AR dominance here. AI dominance. Well, I think what's so interesting about this right, situation is chat. it's going to be this first invasion hardpoint and just his masterclass overall. In both respawns, he was simply that guy. But I think the biggest tale for me in this series had to be that search and destroy because, like Ann said, is the first time playing yeah, high rise. This is typically a very strong search and destroy team. And the reason they put high rise and they test that in their map pool is because typically the ARs are going to be then, in that first opening doing? duel. And well, Nero and Unfortunately, has been 8 and 19 in his opening duels. He has not been winning those first engagements. So, what do they do? They spawn in on a map like High Rise and give Geo the opportunity to be in those first blood situations. And what does he do? He gets them every single time. And that's why they were able to win this second map so handedly. Nameless, are you concerned about Clayster on the other side of this fight? He had an off day today. Yeah, I mean, I'm concerned about the team as a whole. I mean, up until this match, it was a fellow who was struggling the ARs overall. Mm. Carolina just have not been great. Uh, 
uh, they've had two really big matches for, that were winnable, like versus Vegas, versus Miami. Like, you want to secure your spot in winners and control your fate. You have to win these. And in this one, I don't know what to do, like, chat. I know a lot of people are talking about the veto process, and I agree. Why are you playing Invasion? You have never, ever won that map this entire year. It's lost you so many series. So a lot of questions need answering in the Carolina case. There's rumors that Carolina could be playing alongside each other come the next stage, currently all playing from home. With that aside, we got to talk with our winners. I don't know, who, I don't know what to do this first map. Purge is joining like, us live. And Purge, this interview. I'm gonna do some I want to start here asking about that game number one, because we expected this to be a tight fight. But out of the gates, you guys went up 100 points in hard point. How did you take control so early? Uh, honestly, we just played our game. We just stuck to the game plan. Honestly, personally, I was a little surprised to see Invasion uh, Hardpoint get through. Yeah. So uh, we took advantage of that, honestly. For sure, Purge, at first of all, I want to congratulate you on another win. And also how you have been playing individually is night and day compared to stage number one. I want to ask you, when did it click? When did you start feeling this consistency in your gameplay? Uh, I think definitely major one. I mean, it's no secret I was underperforming. Uh, I think there was a lot of factors into that, but uh, I think, you know, Major 2 came and I was just blessed that, you know, these guys around me gave me another chance, you know what I mean? Despite, you know, all the noise and stuff. Sure. So, you know, I knew I had to lock it in. So, you know, here I am. Of course, happy to have you. Uh, Purge, you know, you guys have been great throughout the stage, you individually as well. Do you get, do you feel like you guys have made a breakthrough this week? We've seen some, some big W's and do you think you can contend for a championship at Major 2, truthfully? Yeah, I mean, that's definitely the goal. I mean, you know, we're working day in, day out. You know, we're working on what we got to do, and uh, we're going hard every day in practice. So uh, that's definitely what we're uh, trying to get to. Did Dylan hit? No, I missed Urge, by one. Everyone's looking forward Literally to one the kill. Like, it's just Miami. been that kind of People wearing shorts that for the first time this year in some situations. Chad wants to know about your shoe game. The rest game. of the props what are still going to make it on the trip with you? Because we can see the collection to your right. <laughs> uh, honestly... Um, for game day, I got some new Jordan 3s that I'll probably wear, but you know, the go-tos are the uh, just the white Air Force ones. That's the go-to every time. Fire, man. The cements are goaded. You pull those out, you're at least... Yeah, I got, yeah, I got those. All right, you can go see <laughs> Perch in person. Can't wait to see it next clan. Thank you, guys. Have a good one. Remember, he's going down to Miami next week, and you all can follow with us as we are heading to major number two. A lot to be excited about. Ali, as we ra recap this first match, though, well, what's I'm your big takeaway between these two teams? I'm going to second because the too much. Look out for Vegas Legion come major two time, man. It's next week. All right. And of course, Sounds you like know, there. these teams are playing. You got to sync your calendar, namely. Yep. Yeah, uh, what do you got for this map one? What bet you got? I, this is one I fucking don't know about because they're just such a fucking mid off in the spread, like non existence in one and a half. There you have it. We are done with well, I have, number one. We're I have overall, I have Miami plus one and a half in this because I think it's going in five. But, like, I was saying, map one, the spread is. Three point five now. It, it was one point five. Now it's three point five. Well, three point five is impossible, though. So. What? The three point five is a spread is is impossible on a on like a series spread. Are you talking about a map one spread? Yeah, yeah. Upgrade your oh. No, I, I thought you said that you, you already saw that Miami was oh, plus no. one point five overall. It's, yeah, map one spread map right one. now is twelve and a half. I got three point five on mine. Wait, you can what bet on the spread of so the map? Yeah. Oh, on Check top of it, Adam, you can even live bet hard points. So yesterday when Vegas got a three piece to break P2, I insta live bet before they shut it off. I'm telling you, it's free cash. And everyone's trying to guess if Gwyn has more kills or not. They're all stupid. They are stupid, right? Big, big dude. The mud dog is fucking huge. Live betting big after bro. three pieces is insane. Big mud dog. <laughs> that field, they are stinking. I can't, nasty, I can't believe my shit didn't hit by one, bro. Downright disrespectful. Oh. You are on one today. I can't believe Clay, Clay dropped 29 kills in three matches. Definitely tough. Clay's ass. I can't believe it's not butter. No. I think, uh, I don't know. Caroline's in a rough spot. I think Clay is a good player. I don't. I think he just struggled in that series. I don't. I think Boston would, Boston's actually very happy with the result of that series. Boston won? No, but they win there oh, in tomorrow. Listen, dude. <laughs> I'm thinking thieves tonight. I'm not thinking thieves. <laughs> oh. 
my bad, my dog. We have a Dylan apology. Hater, we have a Dylan apology tweet about the smoke throw on that three. I saw it. I felt pretty sexy. To be yeah. Honest. yeah, I looked in the mirror and thought, God. The Purge is the one who threw it. Yeah. But Dylan, but Dylan apologized on behalf of the team. He said if they got kills, they would have just left. They, they yeah, like, what is this? Like, like forming the line? They just like, you'd like, pass back? Is that like what we're going to do? Gonna, <laughs> it's going to put ourselves back in the spawn trap. Like, I respect that, to be honest. I actually just, respect that a lot. On the map. Yeah, no, I respect that a lot, uh, though. <laughs> They gotta serve a fucking 10 second penalty off spawn, Ben. 10 second penalty off spawn is crazy. <laughs> they can't move for 10 seconds. That's actually really funny. <laughs> like a fucking pit stop, dude. Yeah. Yeah, yo, what's up, Ryan? I'm Ryan, in what? love with the shape of Ryan. <laughs> Yo, Mal, you got a pulls like a magnet. You got a weird shaped ass. I was meaning to tell you that. You're more on the first map. I've been like kind of checking. I think it's definitely possible. It's like honestly kind of bad. I think it's definitely possible. Oh, it is. Let me a pick from like the bottom. It's it's real map one. Lamar actually is like pretty solid this map, even though you would think it's a sub map. Lamar actually gets to his spots and gets kills. Like Miami is decent this map though. Gwyn tweet or a Gwyn tweet? Oh, this is hard, man. It's the All Stars. Oh, I gotta think about this. I don't know how we lose to dog shit, whatever. GG's Vegas, their beast, haha. Lost 3 0. I mean, that's an interesting chirp. You better hope they beat them next time, or, or that's like you're giving them free ammo. It's kind of a risky play to lose to a team and then give them ammunition after you lose. You would think losing would be enough to get the ammo, but now, now if you don't win and they fucking beat you next time you play, they're gonna they're gonna absolutely roast your ass. So that's certainly a decision on a Gwen. What did Chris reply with? Is tagged Paris in it? He's definitely trying to instigate. I'm around the bathroom doing this just like shit, Minnesota intro. Right back chat. I'm mute you and you're gonna hear the call. Sound yeah. resumed. Ew. Yeah, nah, yeah, I was. 30 bucks? Shipping included? Come on, that's not a bad fucking deal. Bro, she tried getting me to pay fucking $69 for a meat review. That's insane for a meat review. That's insane, right? Like, I would have done, done it for free, bro. I would have done it for free. What? <laughs> I'm gonna what? ask Duty to get a Dude, picture Dimmy, of me. Listen, you listen, man. Listen, man. We could definitely. I pay. need Dimmy to stream again, man. We could definitely pay Jets for a fucking Dude, Adam. Whoa, pick. whoa, whoa, whoa! What? It's what your fault that you've been you sending me pics, like. What is wrong with you guys? What's Why are you sending me pics over text? Dude, what is wrong with you? Don't even get me started on his butthole he picks. Bro. Are you a child? Are you a child? We're all older than you. You're Everyone knows older call. than me. You're Everyone not older, older than, me. Older than no, you. You're a child. You're all children. You're a little man. Okay. So think about I'm it. This guy's in a big man's you're an body. You're old man. I still can't believe I flew to. I still can't believe I fucking flew to fucking literal Raleigh and Ryan refused well, to drive an hour Raleigh. to come it's to not an hour, it's because he didn't want to see. He doesn't want to see you. Do you think Kyle were killing at the event? That's like a horrible duo. That's not like the worst duo I've ever watched. We had a great time. We got super fucking. That's not what I. Heard. Kyle said he lost yeah. his fucking well, mind. Jimmy doesn't do bed. that if you didn't know. Yeah. Well, wait, so why would he want to hang you out guys, while like, you're doing illegal activities in his city? It wasn't illegal. It was completely legal. That's we completely not, illegal. Not legal in North Carolina. Definitely illegal. Definitely illegal. But we had a great time. Why would a fucking body turn to the ground and got an arrest out of it? So. No, bro. We drove 30 minutes to movie theater. And I think it was the worst. I think it was the worst fucking movie experience of my life, dude. Why? Did he get naked again? That's not happening to me. No, I walked in the movie theater it was completely dirty like there was shit all over the floor like literal to the point like where you're walking like your shoes would stick to the floor they had no they had no drinks the entire theater was sold out of every drinks not even the water thing would work no popcorn uh we get we get into the theater we get into the theater the lights stay on for the first 15 minutes of the movie bro that's my personal hell bro bro it was actually the worst did you ask for a refund no wait sound muted 
against last time. Both these teams lost to a game five versus LADs in Minnesota. Hold on, I'm just gonna want to. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can you, Listen, if you guys are gonna yap on random shit, can you guys go to a different channel, please? I'm not even yapping. You were you were muted out, were you? Not? No, I know, but like, but like, we were here doing a watch party. I'm not trying to be a dick, obviously, but like, you guys said like Sam and Tommy I mean, muted out. I mean, okay, yeah, but we're also talking like in between the maps, though. Yeah, but they're muting out during the maps. Like, that's what I'm trying to say. Like, no, when the when the when the maps are starting, like, we'll lock in. Don't worry. On the SMG. All right, we well, get one more chance. Is what I'm saying. I call Linz to be the top Sound fighter. microphone and muted. I don't want to be the fucking bad guy, but like, I, I will if I need to. Chat like they come in here and they're just like, like I want to lock in and like watch a map, and they're just like yapping on random shit. Like, I don't think Tommy and Sam are gonna unmute now because their fucking chats are losing full. Like, just get a fucking hint. Jesus Christ. Yeah, doing good. I mean, I don't blame you guys for being doubters of Miami. I think especially after the recent loss to, uh, you know, Southern Carolina get beat up by Vegas, it kind of like man said, it kind of really softens up maybe our reactions to that matchup. Am does pay for the server, Blizz. What are you talking about? It's literally his server. That's just wrong. Like just straight up just not true. Like It's his server, but like, that's what I'm saying. Like, I don't know. In Rio. So if you're feeling good Fucking morons. Miami, finally walked through the W, but like you said, it was versus Carolina. We really haven't been showing anything throughout this stage. But the way that they got it done, last week they were sitting at eight eighth overall in rotations. After that series versus Carolina, they jumped all the way up to fourth. So that has yeah. to be the staple to what Miami need to do. All right, we're just going to, I mean, Tom and, I'm, I'm, listen, we'll Minnesota, just. Sound resume. All right, everybody had two times, please. Back back. I'll be on board here with Vehicle. Yeah, here we go. Do so this is generally a decent map yeah, from Miami. Here we go. I didn't do dunks. I fucking so. love this map. Yeah, this is a great, great map. Top five sure. all time, I could say. Are we yapping or are we done fucking yapping I, here? I gave him a last warning, Tom. I think we're done yapping, Tom. I gave, I gave them a last warning. All right, I wasn't yapping, yeah, but I'm locked. We know you're always locked, Eric. You're not the we problem. We can talk, but we were like singing and shit. I think Jimmy Demons was singing. No, I fear Tom's... Tom's got CT right now. What angles do we tie to... We got the CT okay. plus. That was just frying early, nice. dude. Just vibing. Yeah, he's just fl this flipping now. This has been a flawless hold to start for Miami. And you know, it's, it's going to be one of those things that let's just throw out a very, very, very foreshadowed moment. Let's say Miami hey, runs four dead. Four dead, go, push out, yup, yup. Carolina. Maybe you start to think about their map fluency needs to kind of grow a little bit. But hey, if you're able to get the confidence back in the I'll shoes of so Metals, far, who was a huge upstarter in qualifier stage one, that would be, I think, a major momentum swing for this Miami team that's been kind of stuck in the mud. But oh, rotating over done. towards P2, Minnesota here first with a couple of good eliminations, keeping it really just down for Lucky. Hill, but though. help has arrived, leaving Vivid by himself. Another yeah, oh Vivid's my God, this team has now arrived. Can they find these trades on to the point? No, it's still Miami coming out on top in those engagements. And like you said about medals, he was one of was my favorite name. players to watch at the beginning Great of the year because real. he was just so damn fast. The rival nine in his hand Tough looks like mid. a shotgun, and he's just consistently always Less setting pace. Hit. And obviously, he found a little bit of that in that last series versus Carolina alongside I'm ready from Miami so this one. At least one, two maps. Gain more confidence. You heard in Eric Boo's interview. All we needed was one win to start the train. Oh, ooh, Eric nearly able to finish off the last member into Linz, but lucky right there to find the final bullet. So scrap time going to be fought for by Miami. A couple of contestants here from Rocker, though, not giving up on the full time as of... Yeah, they're going to be late to rotation, though, especially as Metals is able to lock oh down a goal. That was gross. He finishes off the scrap time Eric's Miami. got weird timing. The 30 point cushion and the rotation to P3. Oh, that's right, yeah, good. they're full map control. We were talking about staying ahead of the fundamentals, and that's already three hills in a row where they have done so. And now Minnesota are forced to try to break on in. You have a couple players going through boxes, big one-on-one -on -one gunfight, one right there by accuracy to potentially open up the flank. But you see the rest of his teammates, it's about five to 10 seconds before they even close to the oh, hill. So Miami even get those back spawns, they're gonna be able to take down accuracy, shut down that pitch foot, and put their soul focus again all through middle map. Metal's on a heater. Oh, He's just not oh my. Eric Boom able to follow up. Nice little transfer over to Awakening <laughs> who gets shut down outside the windows. Last one left is accuracy in the corner and he will be dealt with by Lucky. So again, Great stuff from Miami. Sometimes like this Miami team gets going, it's pretty like, and I'm about to make it say a phrase that Tom's probably the only one that knows, but like, it could be pretty like Yoga Benito sometimes. Yeah, I have no idea what that means. The soccer thing. Found a lot of success. Miami only get their first W, which was last week. 
But obviously, practice has been working its wonders as they find themselves currently up by 80. But finally, Minnesota in a situation okay, where Lamar. they're going to be the team to win the rotation this time over towards B4. This could potentially be a money some hill. fucking How long time here. Yeah, really good front line here. You can kind of see the high low setup between Awakening and Lens. Only thing really not being covered would be Vico over towards boxes. Oh my god, lucky that too. Wait, what the? Oh say, my god, it sucks. Make much of a difference. Vico does get traded just as he tries to the hard point. That's fucking shit. Minnesota sucks. on that fucking trade pass. Rich is waiting for the pinch as it's out of the play. Like, we got boxes, it's so late. This play that's so weird, it works. They put three dead. All it comes down to was the trade, but eventually Minnesota Rocker had the reinforcements to push their way back into the HB. The final 20 is potentially going to be theirs. You just got to take care of medals. Good turn, gets a read on him, so Minnesota has slowly climbed their way back into this game, and you already have Awakening off the rotation. Tough gun fight there with Lucky though. Follow up from Linz. Wow, Lucky, just trying to chill out. Must have gotten a one shot. I was a bit of a psych about chill out, Linz. I'm not going to lie. Lucky finds two, no problem. So once again, Miami find themselves winning rotation. Lucky, you're kind of ugly now. Or dead. He can't snap back towards Eric Boom. Forcing Linz to have to collect the trade with that Heretics again. Win the early time here on their final hill. And the crazy thing is that Minnesota in the beginning of the season, they were one of the best game one teams that we had. They were basically undefeated in game ones, but you heard that that's not to oh, lose. Dude. Dude. Someone got three kills. Two, that means you're starting off these series slow, and they're already yeah. showing that. As they're currently down by 60 points, you have to try to turn it around and turn it around quick. Oh, fuck. And a couple kills going in their favor. It's going to lead to some much needed time at this P5. You're cutting out all the proper angles. All of Miami trying to attack from top mid. And eventually, Vico is going to be able to slip on through. But now positioning no. Oh, well, he thanks. does find one. The fact that he's still alive is mind-blowing. But it's still... How's Lamar been alive this whole time? Eric Boom trying to finesse but gets stunned. That's enough for Awakening to finish off. The last couple of nations give him three in a row. And with that, give Minnesota about 10 seconds worth of scrap. So back over towards P1. And you look over at the top of the scoreboard, sure, the gap is still a little bit wider than Minnesota would like. But honestly speaking, they're not getting terribly outslayed. The big kind of culprit right now is we haven't seen Linz be able to match up with the vigor that we're seeing from this Miami front line. Play. Yeah, oh, no, you know, no, no, picture number seven. Before Linz decides to hit that switch. Because he's one of those rookie SMG players who is definitely up for that rookie of the year. And if he can start to turn it around, they can get right back into this game. But it's still a 50-point game. All out mixed facet towards go. top mid. Linz finds two vivid with the third. All you need is a trade on Eric Boom as he's just trying oh to slide God. around finesse with his life. He somehow is able to walk away with two. Now the reinforcements are here. Awakening trying but to spin a little mixy while mixy. Mixy. It's so fucking mixy, dude. The lens still does not give Minnesota enough favor to break in for what is the vast majority of this time. Already here again, one. bro. And keep in mind, so you have to look at your mini map. You've already got Eric Boom on rotation. He's got oh, number four got through alley. So again, I don't know how recent kind of to see him go, both fronts, go like cart. That's enough for Eric to get in towards They have no idea lens. this guy's back alley after they kill this guy. They're going to just... Middle finally collects it, but there are a couple of Miami members nearby that could possibly find this trade. No, he's shot. Oh, yeah, there are Miami's everywhere. Eric had the play and then didn't make the teammates are going to find a couple kills in the middle of the map. They don't find any. So it's Minnesota Rocker currently down by 60. Let's step aside and listen to the comms and see how they can try Listen. to bring this back. I kill Back to one to ten, 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 ten medals, ten medals, one shot. Push up, push up, push up. Mid, 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 mid. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'll see him, ten. He's ten, he's ten, he's ten. Ten medals, I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. I'm in the back, I'm in the back, I'm in the back. Back, 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 back
Wow, I mean, we're in an absolute Bro, Miami just trolled the shit out of P3. Well, to on to six the three the dead and we just didn't block the back. I mean, I looked to get all the kills, but... Miami again, 50, 60 points up. Yeah, they were in the game at the end of that P2, but Miami stayed ahead in the fundamental column. They were making sure that they were the team spawning on a preferred side for P3, and now that's two times at P3, but they have dominated oh. that hill. Holy. And off the rotation, you're thinking Minnesota, the way that they just They will not win off P3, this, but they're going very close. Set up for P4, time. But they're already late to the party. Miami Heretics are in for the initial 15, and they can pretty, get pretty damn close to even winning the game here if they can hold this down for the rest of the 40. I, they're just swarming. It just feels like at any of a moment in time, it feels like someone's hitting a pinch. It just feels like Miami have five members on the map. They're all over yeah. the place. And let's be candid, there are a couple of key 1v1s, 1v2 situations that are coming through for Miami that have really helped establish their success on rotation. So this scrap time fuck. looks pretty darn clean. Minnesota just kind of looking at it from afar, and they're going to have to default to playing to rotation here. Yeah, with only 15 seconds left, I you have to get this up. You have to by the way. now play perfect Call of Duty. No, I get away from them in the middle of last rotation. But trying yeah. to bring this game back. And the P3 and the P4 that's really pretty been solid. Them off guard is, like you said, it's like there's five Miami players on the map. Every time they're trying to set up a push or trying to set up a break on one of these hills, they're getting flanked by one of the SMGs on the side of Miami. And now with Miami only needing 13 seconds, you have to make all these kills count. Lens and accuracy, they combine for two, but Meadow's there with the trade. Currently with top mid control. Look how they're trying to set up Vico on that deep pinch. Yeah, this is all about if Vico can find the 1v1 with Awakening, and then, yep, there it is. Now you have an actual pinch starting to occur. Two players from the front, Vico from behind. He's also on five in a row. Not that I think he may need a cruise missile if this is successfully broken, but who knows? That's tough. They'll shot two different guys. Minnesota, the kills. On strongly. Dividend Lins. Accuracy stepping in. Okay. 28 seconds still to fight for here, and Minnesota have the reinforcements established to try to soak up the marrying time. Yeah, but now you're in a situation where if you are Minnesota, you have to not allow them to get any of that... <laughs> P5 hill, and you also have to start setting up off the rotation towards top B1. One this end. is where Miami, with all those SMGs in hand, have been able to dominate. They find three in the feed. Last player up is going to be Vivid, so they find the break at the old hill, and they wow. currently have top mid control. So you're telling this me Eric Boom couldn't get one kill for two Definitely minutes? feels that way unless Wakening can do something special, but as he you're gets telling me Eric aside, fucking Boom couldn't get a fucking kill. He might get one now. He might get one now. Oh, oh, he got it! He got the end! He got the end! Hey oh, guys, my god, oh, oh my god, Tom! Oh my god, he hit the it. end. It's oh crazy. God. Oh my <laughs> god, like I'm literally by, literally by half, <laughs> literally a half a second, bro. He's in the blendy. Oh my god, it's really good. Slams. Firing on all cylinders right now for the Heretics on Rio. We can help, man. Probably a little match victory underneath their belt to start to get that confidence. I mean, Mesa just got off to such a slow start, honestly. All across the board for Miami. They said there's no way in hell. We're not going to be a good team at Rio. I know we started at I need Miami team. to win one more map, yeah, and I bet heads. I need one Miami to get one more buttons, map. And they continue yeah. to do it, continue to show us week after week now, two victories in a row on that Rio. Let's see, I got also Honestly, Lucky got 24 and Lamar got 23. Bro, this was a sweat the one. Kill. They didn't count the Wait, it should have been. I thought I was going to kill. Bro, he popped up in a kill feed. Wait, that's cheese. He didn't get the fucking kill. All about the fun. That's so hazy. How the fuck? Did he not get the kill? I don't have time. I need to go to VAR. Wait, he actually showed up in the kill feed. Did he, did he, did he get the kill before it clicked 250? Bro, it showed up in the kill feed. He got the kill part of the kill feed. Game ended. Boom. We're going to VAR. Damn, that shit's rigged. We're, we're, we're going to VAR. Shit's rigged. Now that's Sorry, fucking Tom. crazy. I mean, his line was 23, so I didn't lose. But I just didn't win. I mean, bullshit. That's bullshit, bro. That's fucking bullshit. I'm calling, I'm calling absolute cheese, dude. Are you calling Sorry, cheese or what? I'm calling cheese, bro. It's okay. Put up in the kill feed. The fuck the kill. I thought I had big brain to pick no, that map. He, I did he, not. He clicked 250 and he didn't, he didn't, get, he didn't get the kill, Tom. I'm, I have a pause at exactly 250 and he had not gone to kill yet. Shut the fuck up, Ben. Yeah. Shut the fuck up. That's yeah. what I'm saying, bro. What's the next map? Uh, uh, it's so pasty. It's kind of the way that I kind of think about it. You know, reflecting back on the highlights yeah. here. And, you know, that was something we saw last week as well when they played against Carolina. This is easy. The interesting thing about I know exactly it, what's going on. That this thing goes to what's going on? Big more. Same thing there as well. It's just with more ARs okay. than it is with SMGs, obviously. Yeah, okay, and if you continue to play like that, that's what makes it super annoying to play against these kind of rosters because every time you think yeah. hey, right, I've seen, I need a no, Miami no, mask plus since man bro catch my bad please and even setting up pinches yeah. he, he's he's two for the boys Minnesota to execute the exact break that they want to come in just always being a nuisance
it's always being a headache on the backside All for right, Minnesota bro. Rocker. And unfortunately, they just could not get Does anyone have maps for the, the last one. series or the not up yet? If you're, Minis if you're uh, Miami, I don't think you're obviously out yet. you get your victory last week versus Carolina. But you only have one I can victory do. both this stage. You can walk away with the you know, second one. Can you work in Magic Area? That would be appreciated. The way they can cause a couple upsets at their own major. 100%. I mean, it's the right time to start getting hot. Oh, yeah. Oh, all those college basketball fans out there, you look at the calendar, it says... Miami let shit wire to wire, holy shit. Happen. It's trailed into <laughs> Call of Duty possibly here as well. We'll see. So, off the game flow, now we start to look at what's to come. High rise, search and destroy coming up. You heard the guys talk high about rise. it. Neither team particularly great at securing first bloods, but when they do, conversion percentage is extremely good. In particular... I know. I feel good about Miami magic. winning at least one so of these next three. Kind of the main feeling it. Thing. That's the craziest thing because I'm talking about overall in the map. It's like 27% of the time Miami find first blood. They win it 100% of the time. On the opposite side for Minnesota, 42% of the time overall on attacking or defending, they win it 100% of the time. And then more specifically, even on the attacks and defenses, when both of these teams find that first blood, they win the round uh, 100% yeah, of the time. Yeah, so uh, uh, New York and Opti tomorrow. Whoever wins that gun you just get shot right mid-sentence or... Microphone. Uh, I was in the middle of meeting out talking my shadow. Oh, oh, oh. I thought you literally just got stabbed. Oh, mid stabbed. Really good on defense as well. In specific, in specific, I'm looking at what Minnesota's been able to do. I mean, they're seven and three overall in defensive rounds. So yeah, that's incredible. This, this, what well I have in this series is a Lamar a over fucking lucky though. Too. And they're that one's a little bit of sweat. A lot. So I think from the defensive side, you kind of maybe take the focus, you put the spotlight there, and you say starts with first bloods, and then it finishes off with how do you play around the objective. Maybe more in specific towards Minnesota, who's so good defensively at finding retakes on the bottom. Yeah, you gotta make sure it's a team. All right, two times, two times. Force these one-on-one -on -one gunfights, especially the for the you gotta have those. My God, S and D attack is woeful. Top headline. Early into these rounds, when no team has any trophies to work with. Oh yeah, on the ground is gonna be the playground for a lot of these players. So expect the battle between Vivid and Metal. Do that on the ground, red sword to be that battle for the first one. Both teams are still in position to try to fight for a little bit of winner's bracket action as well. You can see the monster degree get coming through. First one, both teams find a way. Yeah, you know the first check that you have to find a way to mark off but after that it's going to come down to a lot of help from the other teams that are playing today a little bit of assistance was earned right there with carolina dropping that kind of takes them out of a tiebreaker situation for that final position in the upper bracket so oh, mars playing a good angle here these two squads find a way to win and for minnesota more in particular it's all about finding a way to maybe be a little bit more successful on the offense saw their ranks are about 12th across the league in almost every category uh lamar still yeah, gotta figure it out lamar is might be the caliber the caliber <laughs> slowly slowly <laughs> tracking down his prey here he's just trying duty. to find this timing for the first blood and he might yeah, have found himself in a perfect hilarious. scenario to at least Fuck, take I need, that I really one but it's looking for the instant trade 3v3 delayed hit though from lens over towards the opposite side of the map is in their cheeks eric boom is the only defensive player Player over on this a site. Oh, I think Vickles are reading this though. Oh, is Vickles predicted this? Oh, that's tough. No, not quite. He looked there for a moment. Ooh. Eric looking. Good lead. Shots Lynch. for the trade. Upper. Decent shots, but no kills. And with that, Minnesota now hold the numbers and the possession. Oh, that's oh, tough. Oh, oh we're getting blown. And the propane tank blows up yeah, right at the end. And so that's, what that's a clean kills. finish there for Minnesota on their first offense. Yeah, they had the right, numbers, sheesh. they had the propane working in their that favor. That propane tank is gross. And they also find the first blood that on the back-to-back. That has got to be crazy. <laughs> Did you see Josh's right, tweet like a week ago? Yeah, I just tweeted out that. I was like, this motherfucker put up numbers. As Minnesota <laughs> get the first blood, they walk away with the attacking round. Now, man, some good Dylan McGee theory and side. Gwen beef going on. I don't know if anyone right was able to develop a couple kills in that and round. And now Gwen instantly walks it back, bro. Sure, yeah. It might be another slow and steady round for Miami here on the attack. See what the focus is going to be coming out of spawn. Bomb will be voluntarily muted. left behind Juni. this initial push over towards A. And wow, medals. I have accuracy over Lucky, map. yes. Takes care of That's why I didn't want Lucky to kill Lamar. Eric, but like what? Like tag up Vivid like pushes him off the high ground, so that will be a little bit of information denied as Minnesota will no longer have I was just going over there to see what's going on. And now you already have a lot of information gained if you are Miami because you're able to take down accuracy across the map. You already have propane control and you already have crack shack, so you can start to push out over towards A. It's just to try to find this time and to work that bomb plank. There's so many different angles you can check from if you are Miami. Lynn's eventually why, is able to take down Vico, even up the numbers at 3v3 now. Yeah, yeah, you're you know, you know, shit, shit, call him shit. Just call him shit. Elevator, but I mean, he shouldn't have said something to begin with, though. It's such a hard position to fight back from. You can say what he wants, bro. He thinks they're shit. He can say whatever he wants. It's the problem. It's the fucking problem. He's actually looking to isolate. Yeah, he's gone forward. They find a way to isolate on the medals, but Lucky responds. They want to hear that Eric Boone. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It might not be true, but he should be. Be able to say if he wants to say. Between Lucky and Vivid. 
Nah, it's, you want to know what it is, bro? When left. people be losing, they get twi- they, they get emotional, bro. It happened with Scrappy. Last information mm-hmm. that you knew. It happened with Gwyn. It's these young guys, but it's these young guys. They'll learn. They'll learn. Yeah, they'll learn. Yeah, so he's going to be able to work this bomb plan yeah. down at A for free. But Vivid's oh, young guys. Young guys. Young guys. Yeah, how does Lucky try uh, to set himself up? Dead. Lucky's dead. Lucky's dead. Vivid's going to shoot him in the back. He's still worried about the defensive side. It's fine. Vivid just says, hey, how you doing? No worries there. Minnesota off to... He has got to be cheating, bro. He just knew you just took the exact route to shoot him in the back. Like, yeah, all right, bud. And that simply comes down to the play from Awakening. I don't know who invested that slow grenade through bottom middle, but he just gives him his position to from top propane jumps right through that b bomb site is able to find a kill and then find a second as well then once you turn it into Adam a 1v1 is lucky coming back he gets to the for free but he's still thinking that vivid Let's is go, in Alex his spawn Earl. shout out to the ring around the rosy all the way up to that b street oh we got maps rio high rise karachi sub base invasion that conversion percentage one of the two teams is not going to have 100% search did make it in Nades aggressively sure. set over towards A from We're Minnesota. <laughs> Nothing landing, at least from Vivid's perspective. Yeah, I'm not a fan of two. The, the, the oh, one map, one, one, three. Map two might be a chance, though. We are this wide open right, we'll see about Toronto on that map. Retake here. Yeah, Vivid already got all the info he needed to get. Unfortunately, his teammate in Awakening does get first blooded, but he's it's instantly there to respond. Chad, do I slam now, the hedge on map two right now on that bet? I gotta do it right now. I gotta do it right now before it's locked. Miami again in a man advantage. Yeah, I think he may have heard shots from Lucky initially and thought maybe I had some Ooh. time to push through, but not the case at all. And Miami collapse over the top of the B side. So not officially a retake since the bomb didn't get planted, but let's call spade a spade. They essentially had to re-grab the site and they do it very cleanly. So good awareness there off that mid setup. And that just shows you right there that Linz is one hell of a teammate because if one of his teammates are getting shot at, he's going to put himself in a position to at least assist them. But unfortunately, that's a gunfight he didn't want to challenge towards the top end of that b street puts his team in the man in, man disadvantage and then miami with the numbers just trade efficiently in towards the b site finally get on the board with lucky now having a phenomenal search and destroy so far I remember right, the beginning i did of the season, i sent it like this, i got that i got the hedge to make my money back footing, miami don't need to be sweating in snd i fear i picked lucky less i'm done putting in fucking picks i'm fucking done everybody, year, everybody, well. thing, but everybody i picked just does the fucking opposite Eric, little mantle. You can't He's read these the fucking morons, Adam. Accuracy. You can't read these He's morons. Deep, but no chance to challenge that. Listen, man, there's a reason why Betty Kelly's making so much money, Tommy. Because everybody just believes this. Yeah, no, it is really fun, though. It is extremely fun. It's extremely fun. It's extremely fun. That's why it's dangerous. But if you double down, you can always win it back. Nah, you get no shots. I was just waiting for him, because you gained all that info about 10 seconds into the round, and no one was going to be in towards the B side. But now you allow Minnesota Rocker to know where the pressure's coming in from. Accuracy Work finds a first bang. blood. Lynch is there for the trade. Great communication from that Minnesota. Coach Zuma prize picks. Yep. And sign up using Coach Zuma. Prize picks are going to eat it. Match up to your first time. Very positive. Nice to win the dollars. Good luck, Jack. Go fuck yourself. Oh, this is a vet hop. Make sure this defuse doesn't just get stuck. This is a vet hop. Wait a second. Minute Man. Health is long enough. The pistol's out. Oh, lucky last close. Last second, bro. That was so close. Immediately have to hop it. Lucky, two in a row. Wow, what a, a what a fucking insane. play out of Lucky with the big buffer here at the end of this. That was yeah. almost a bad hop. Nah, big, wow. big massive buffer Both here. Big massive side, buffer. Though, this time it's a little bit safer, a little bit easier. And Miami respond with a back to back round. Oh, that's good stuff right there from Miami. There ain't nothing in there, Hobby. Gonna get you on them a little bit, clean. but just waiting so damn long to put that bomb down. <laughs> But once they get it down, just a little they uh, update for you guys Lucky later on the flank. We will be giving away four tickets to a nightclub party oh, with a special round, performer. So uh, an artist will be performing at this nightclub. We're giving away four tickets. I just think, uh, like, if you're Minnesota in, in that situation, you know the exactly where the play is going. We just have to be a little bit faster on that. I'm asking you to get that bomb down. I think it's who the artist is on the show. It's a good artist. 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 It's Performing. He is is performing, but it's not him. That's uh, he's performing 100 racks. <laughs> Kason's performing his hit single, 100 racks. Live. Oh, uh, here we go. Eating Lamar, way. love it. Yo, now Lucky is pacing. Yeah, I don't like that Lucky's got eight, though. Wow, that's a hell of a set of shots. Takes care of Lynn. Accuracy top helo. Oh, he's dead at uh, the elves. And wow, how is Lucky still alive? I don't know. Thankfully, the propane tank kept him alive a little bit longer. Accuracy could not commit to his that wall bang. Good shots. But he sets Ooh. up his teammate in vivid and shut down Lucky. No cruise missile is going to be earned. 
Minnesota well, yeah, Rocket Metal's in a good ass spot. You can already see where Metal's in the map. He's going to be able yeah. to find a freebie for accuracy. Instantly a 2v2 with only 40 seconds left. That stalls out Minnesota pretty good. Well, Mark kind of yeah. tweaked. He hopped sure off a he fucking helipad there. Green, and Metal's is gone. He's out of there. But this is going to take time to clear. Awakening's just kind of watching over the top of the map from topside elevator. And he's not going to be able to see anything. So this is going to be a blind commit for Minnesota towards B. Here's the hop for the plant. Metal's rotating back over. Awakening playing inside elevator. Move it on the exit. Not fully caught, but there's information there. But this clutchable though. Nico will drop. Ooh, good shoulder. Metal to the 1v2. And this doesn't look very good. Vivid off the regen's gonna play top propane. Awakening down low. I mean, you tell he's got his smoke. Well, Someone's been blown in a second. No. Oh, oh. Yeah, so that one coming. Hold the phone. Awakening repositions here. Metals has to go re. No, Wake's making a go play. Oh, he's not playing for Wake though. He has to overcommit to check it. No, he doesn't. Oh, he almost oh my God. Wake he almost fucking scammed that so that. Ooh, the fact that Metals even had an opportunity wow. in that fight to clutch up to that round. No, Microphone Miami's just got to win two maps in the series. Peak, but good play out of Awakening to read the setup. Holy shit! I think maps three and four are best chances, honestly. Through the middle of the map, and then. The he almost got fucking hurt on the Rosie. This time it's him going up to the opponent side of that B Street. He has the AR. He hits the early couple of shots. So he has one shot. Pulls out the Renetti to close out the round. Minnesota Rocker. Finally stopped the bleeding. Take advantage again. Up 3 2. Now. Microphone activated. Need to get all the info early on when they're just sending everybody through on the ground, jumping on into the site. Well. Call you Lisan Al Gaib here. You've seen the future, brother. Lisan Al Gaib. Be tested this time by it's Minnesota a, It is a heavy stack Great over reference. towards this B site. All in all, it does end in a two v two situation, though. It's still plenty of time in the clock. The only issue I mean, is lucky Minnesota to stop have being a fucking lot kills of elevated positions bro. to where they will get the intel once it eventually crosses their path. Oh yeah, they have everything cut off. You already had the rotation nice. coming in from Vivid, but Lamar. he does commit to that gunfight. He loses it. Now it's instantly a one v one. Eric Boom. Lamar's got versus this. He's too icy, the bro. Ice man versus he the is the ice man. With 45 seconds left, if your accuracy just try to back moving, on up, dude. force him to be fucking icy, bro. Yeah. Oh man, this is gonna come Eric just see him cross. No, he didn't. 35 seconds on the clock. Here comes the crossing of the so nice. He's so icy, icy. Oh, oh, icy. Good play, he's just so icy, right dude. There. I mean, it really is just down to do you it's find yourself in a position right with the five nine to take the one v one and accuracy. Pretty much make sure the entire way through that wasn't gonna happen. Yeah, it's just Minnesota took so much round after turning to a two v two. You had top heli. You already watched them not push out of their spawn so you had all the map control you know it's only a matter of going work. for eric boom when he walks out of the base you have to check so many different angles of where accuracy is going to be playing probably got to read that he's going to be in the back of his spawn but unfortunately does not check the elevator and accuracy clutches up in the 2v1 for minnesota rocker to not get himself a nice little comfortable cushion up two rounds back on the attacking side and hopefully someone has a trophy on this left street because these nades are coming Microphone muted. Yeah, we've been getting buffers, boys. I don't want to two times though. Because then we're all drifting. Microphone activated. Late trophy placed by Miami defensively deep towards this lane. Lynn's over the top, just making sure Vivid stays safe. He's hopping in for the plant. Quick play here for Minnesota. Miami gonna have to have a, some sort of a gut check reaction call, and uh, there's a trophy down to keep them safe. This is gonna be a tough test. Because you have to check all these corners, but at least you take care of the bomb carrier. So now in the 4v3, oh, make no. it a 4v2. Great read out of Lucky to catch accuracy. Now someone just stick the, the fuse. All but Linz hops in, finds the kill, gets out of there. Awakening follows up to the middle of the map. Hold on a second. This isn't done yet. Awakening does get traded out, but Linz is still in a position to where he may just hop this. Smoke comes through first, and he's got mind games in play. Over the top. First uh, oh, but Lucky right there gross. just to make Bro, sure Bro, Lucky's everything, up. dude. Maybe God damn it. There for Linz, but... Just flat out overwhelmed, and that's enough for Miami to find the defuse and put this back to within one. Yeah, Miami found the first blood. They found the second onto Agerson and the 4v2. Someone on the opposing end has to walk away with at least a two-piece to make that round even count. But once it turns into a 2v2, able to trade Awakening and a double chow. Not really worried about the smoke grenade. And those cheeky plays coming in from Linz. Is Miami Reddit? Yo, am I the only now one who thinks three. going to the default bomb corner every time you plant here, the though. fucking bombs is a terrible play these days? But everybody who gets picked and everything. Yeah, let's Even plant the bomb and go to the fucking day one default Minnesota, that everybody checks right as soon as they enter the site. On this map. Correct. But at the same time, the fuck out of here. The bomb drop in and get planted pretty often. So 
Can there be some success here for Miami to actually find a way to get this thing fully back to level terms? They're gonna have to do it eventually. Wow, look at Lots Lucky. Oh, this guy's inspirational. Yeah, absolutely fine. Right back, awakening also Sorry, alerted Ninja. that this play is on the way. And it's all good. It's more maps than series. Off his angle. Yeah, Meadows is just gonna back on up. Wait for his teammates to try Honestly, to assist. I prefer for Miami to win this map. So that if you are Miami, because if you can jump up to the other ground, potentially find this kill for free on towards the B site. That could be just enough to work this bomb plan as Meadows is going to try to clear it out. Yeah. This time, no Ooh. stuns are going to be there, but Meadows gets the read on oh, it perfectly. 3v3, but Vivid instantly there to response, puts his team in the advantage again. Yeah, man, I, I, this is the third time we've kind of seen this same setup defensively for Minnesota. This time, Linza steps into the site, though, but you've got accuracy kind of on Surely top we don't scam numbers on defense here. Windows. He can watch any... He just is just watching that ladder push. Vivid from Heli Stairs can follow up if accuracy gets the intel, and it's just... So difficult for Miami to break through this setup with Man. having no pressure mm -hmm. at all. But somehow, some way, Lucky's, Lucky's able to walk map. right up through the middle of the map. Find that kill onto Vivid. And now with only 15 seconds left, you have to commit yeah. towards this bomb plant at Oh my B. god. So it all falls into the hands of Lucky. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh oh my god. Is Rocker scamming? The the are we shit? Are we serious right now? Onto Vivid, but then knows that the, the last Rocker two players terrible. from Minnesota Rocker are in their spawn. Bro, they the have to plant the how, 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 but, but how is Lucky just running awakening. down middle map and killing Reese? Yeah, no he's not getting killed. Whoever was watching that is 14 of 5. Is that what I saw? Yeah, Jesus. I know it. And the fact of the matter, like you mentioned, like, they win that round 2v2, moving through the teeth of the defense. Oh, that was 2v3, shit. wasn't it? Yeah. The sheriff's put me a bit. Oh, yeah. Crossfire yeah. set up some ARs deep in towards mid, and they still push through. It's 14 and 4. Lucky gets his trigger be big, by the way. Yeah, again, yeah, yeah, his trigger be massive. For Miami. We're back to a 4v4 and 4 2 4 over on the scoreboard. And Accuracy is going to get dropped early by Vehicle, the sole defender over at A. So now all of a sudden, Minnesota have issues they need to deal with. Yeah, now they're in the man disadvantage. And if you give a kill to Lucky, you give him a cruise missile. It's going to put himself in a very good situation to potentially at least walk away with one guaranteed round. Awakening throwing a couple shoulders. Vehicles finds his second, this time on to Vivid. Instantly a 4v2. Eric Boom finds a third. And this is where, you, if you're Miami, you have to communicate okay. to try to give Lucky this away, final Miami. kill. Oh, but Vico is feeling himself. Minnesota has he finds no three in a round. Miami now at game point. Still. And the trends have completely been absolutely flipped on its head. I don't know. I mean, Maybe Minnesota's not a good location like for this Minnesota team. Maybe they got to move to fucking Florida. They're mid like this has been super successful oh, for them. Yeah, 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 you know what I mean? 4v4s, 4v3s, yeah, it's but cold outside of Minnesota. Now all of a sudden Miami has completely changed the tone. When it's cold so I don't care what you're outside. Saying, break right through that. Quick round to follow up immediately afterwards. Have to have Minnesota second guessing. Me. I don't know what you run here. Heavy defense. What do you call? Everybody keeps saying happy birthday, Jeremy. I think you just do the same thing that you did Go before. Fuck yourself. Adam, I actually called out that cross, but get your SMGs in positions when they do. It's exciting. Unfortunately, the propane is going to be able to take down Awakening. Oh, so my fucking God, they are collaborating. Put me out of my and misery, Rocker. Here. I mean, the only bit of good news is he's got Vivid watching his cross over the other side, so he's not fully isolated. And on top of that, the All heretics right, have no idea that he's positioned this shot. He has and he's gone. Before. Oh, and then he dies. Relief. And he's Shots gone. Shots across the map. Accuracy hunting for a trade. Oh, no. Please, Vico no. Lamar, the please trade this. Resets. He's oh. off the region, but the pistol so is too good. Follow up, though. Trade. Perfect. Cruise Cruise missile. Missile. Hey, hey, drop that shit. Great. Drop Lynn that shit. Find him. Find him. All the way back through underground to his spawn. Oh, wait. They're wrapping right back to him. Lucky's already positioned forward just to make sure if Linz has to make this call, he will be taken out, and now the information will be known. And now if you are Miami, don't right. really commit it. Good shit. Fucking no holy holy shit. And they're just going to send it on to Linz. That. that hit. Wow. That was the only three rocket through that the back of the game. Correct. In that game they did. number two. Miami, right. This might be a three. Get this shit over with. My food's here, bro. We are back. But Clutchy got on a map that you only played once. Keep in mind, they only played high rise once time, and they lost a 6-5 versus Atlanta. Now you walk away with it in a clean 6-4 versus Minnesota. Oh, they're going to start adding this to the map. Map pool, you best believe that. Miami up 2-0 in the series. Massive stuff, man. And I think this is, again, layer by layer, map by map. We're starting to kind of shed the creeping doubt that we started to have about was the performance last week versus Carolina just kind of a softball for them. Now, all of a sudden, you blow out Minnesota on Rio. You string together four straight rounds, three straight rounds at least, yeah. get on the high-rise search and destroy, all of which are super convincing. And let's be honest, 15 and four from Lucky was definitely assisted, especially in some of the closer rounds. But flat out, Miami 
this is again I, I just keep going back to it. I, i'm sorry fans out there but this is the miami that we came to kind of know and for some of us love in the first four weeks of stage one qualifiers they're just playing with so much confidence yeah they're playing with so much confidence that even down four three lucky with 20 seconds left just run straight up the middle of the map we saw accuracy before we even switched player games he was watching every single angle from the back middle of the small he must have got some really bad timing because lucky just sprints right through the middle finds that kill onto vivid and then takes down accuracy and awakening behind enemy lines like that's a round that if you're minnesota you can't let get away because then you put that at game point instead it goes 4v4 and then lucky his confidence is just there and continues to go on through the rest of the map well it's a dominant map number one for miami a little bit of a comeback effort and some heroics from lucky to get that map number two and all of a sudden we start to think is it possible that miami could somehow pull off a 3-0 which by the way they don't just need a win here if they can find a way to 3-0 that helps out their map count differential for possible tiebreaker situations so call it what it is if you're a miami fan it's a must win karachi we'll see you on the back side of the break for the control Upgrade your game with the SCUF, the official controller of the Call of Duty League. The Call of Duty League is brought to you by Monster Energy, the official energy drink of the CDL. Ten in a row, looking for the 11th! That's the round! You may never see one like it! Everyone from Vegas leaves the trap behind enemy lines. This is tough! As Ghosty finds three with one clip, those are great shots. That is what Shotzi buys his team so much time. He's able to find three more. He is just going, and you see what this does for their hard point. He's just so good at being elusive. Yeah. It can be such a pain in the ass to deal yeah. with. Yeah. It may be long yeah. Yeah. Long yeah. Long but those are, that was a very, very good listen in. And a reason uh, you're seeing this score busted wide open. And map yeah. one is done. This guy is insane. Same time Asim once again gets a kill. He's got two in this round. Every time you get numbers, if you're optic, Asim has brought it back. Asim working on the ace. That's three for him in this round. It was plant or hold for the kill. Dashi chooses to hold. Get a child, not gonna happen. It's an ace for big Asim. What a brilliant moment for the newcomer on this Boston Breed squad. Faze holding it down. Looking for the win right here and now. It's Abe and draws in the feet. Sim joins them for the posterity. And that's giving you the final 10. And that should be map one. That is a nail in a coffin. They'll sit by the way with nearly 7k damage. So, Simp was almost untouchable. Shotzi might have the timing on the flank. No one's going to turn. Bonus as well. Oh, come on. Shotzi's playing real good tonight. Nice tags. I don't have a clue as to how he has managed to survive. Shotzi versus the world. He can't get the third, but here comes Shotzi. Ten in a row. Around. You may never see one like <laughs> Sound muted. Chat. Yeah, look at this nice. Oh. Look at the nice place of fucking sushi we got. A couple sashimi pieces, like, oh man. Oh man. Sound resumed. Yeah, I took the uh, the hedge off of um, the thieves one for now. We might drop it back in, but for now, I took it out. Not only if they, well, they need to win. Um, just because. Uh, would love to see it go three zero. Oh yeah. Just because this other shit popped. Series doesn't get any better for Minnesota. Yeah, what's gonna see? Because this is not gonna hit, so I might go a different angle at it. But for now, we're gonna let it ride. And we got a little bit of Connie salad too. Is like a nice little. 
crab salad, like Connie, Connie situation going on here. I, I assume this is not real crab, it's like imitation, but either way, the Connie salad's pretty good. Obviously, the first major wasn't the best to him, but now they're going into their home turf, and the way that they are looking right now, they're definitely trying to cause a couple upsets at their own event. So far, it's been, I won't say upsets necessarily, but it's been kind of eye opening matches. The win versus Carolina last week, and now a chance to possibly 3 0 Minnesota Rocker, who, again, just based on their record, have not had a great stage. And I'm sure there's lots of people out there kind of wondering why. Well, let's get into this fucking sushi thing. Went on kind of the end of stage one. Either roll, never do the sashimi. One, but that has not been evident at all in this stage qualifier whatsoever for minnesota so miami with the karachi control ahead of them a sub base also lingering and then minnesota who's terrible at map fives i mean it just doesn't really feel all that possible no this is, this is chalk Jeff, this is chalk. reverse sweep but i don't know maybe there's a little bit of a lifeline here to reset the series and come out with one of your better controls if you're the rocker yeah this is their best control and this is the lifeline for them you're going into your bread and butter control map and then on the opposite side for miami they haven't found success on karachi control in about two months that's the last time they wanted him they played versus atlanta Dude, Lose bracket, but you need all the maps that you can get to potentially earn yourself a winner's bracket so you get multiple chances at your next event. 100% the case. And again, map count will be massive towards microphone. Yeah, maps are out. Uh, wishes uh, with a four dollars ninety nine. I think map two is high rise S and D apparently. So go a long way. But they will be starting off on the I'll read them out to you. Keep in mind here, Jay, about both they these are... two teams is that from both sides, from both offensive and defensive, they're great at either finding success capture. Real high rise Karachi sub base invasion. So I think map two is the most interesting. Because uh, Toronto is not that great at high rise, but I appreciate the five dollars, bitches. Good for chat. Thank you so much. Microphone activated. The way that the SMGs are playing, how fast the ARs are playing, they're going to be able to set that tone early on into this control. They find the first couple of kills around the middle of the map. The second second progression is about to get called in. You already see their setup. No one's trying to edge on out. Minnesota Rocker, they're more of more in their setup. Trying to play no, no, Gwen's, Gwen's those two like, kills, they're going to be Gwen's able rolling. to take that player down in Definitely. A and now force all of Miami to hit. Them, that the, the things on Twitter after you lost for sure. Microphone activated. Ooh, big wins. Opens up space on this over I'm locked. I'm right. expecting a 3 0 3 1 in favor of Miami here. On. This he is over. On top fire. Well positioned here for medals on four in a row. I think like 3 0. Like 3 0 in a series, but the control's ending 3 0 3 1. Like this is dumb. This is dumb. And it's going to start with his first offense. He's picking up where he left off on the Rio. Get this guy a sub and he just goes crazy. Yeah, this is what he does. He's going to be able to find those timings with the SMGs, but it also allows his teammates now to sprint up freely up through that junkyard area. But now he's just trying to get a baited switch going because he can earn that cruise missile. If he finds it, yes, he finds that kill onto Awakening. So cruise missile earned. You already were able to extend that time by completing that progression over towards the end. Yeah, Lamar so Masterclass, man. It first starts by taking control of Drunk. You got to eliminate Linz, but Linz shuts down that play by himself. The nine, nine kills are lucky. It's going to be hard to make that out. Again. Should be dead to rights here in the corner. Should nope. be. Please, someone get the trade. Don't let Linz do this. Piss no power. You're going to kill him with a pistol? Finally, <laughs> Vehicle gets the kill, but boy, that was expensive. Essentially a three for one. Accuracy also makes sure that Metals cannot sneak over towards that top soda position. So even though it's a great start for Miami, Minnesota hold a four life advantage and we're down to 70 seconds left in the clock. Damn yeah, it, at least now if you are Miami, you have somewhat junk control. But for how long? Because there's a couple players from Minnesota reading the pressure. Yeah, the there's one super from. deep. Yeah. You also have accuracy all small, and knowing that one player is going to go on that. Pitch, what was that timing? Red. In. What the and fuck? Oh, Lindsay. Got a minute wiped off of the game clock. Not a single player from Miami even. Eric Boom going nuts. To that deep point. The defensive side of right now. Dude, but this is what I don't understand strong. about this map. So, like, killed yeah, awake the car, and number two still spawns well, like around the back, Eric all the way out. Makes his presence known over towards the rocker spawn. Bro, Ben, we uh, talk about this every fucking day. We talk about this. So, it but why? doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. But like, sense. We, this game got spawn cooldowns hit. This spawn doesn't have a cooldown. Like, both spawns. Minnesota set up from the front side of the zone. Every day you say the same fucking thing when somebody spawns there. Every day. It's dumb. This is fuck. The last I'll keep saying it. See those swans from Miami. Everyone over towards the chicken coop, so they're forced to overextend. You have to get past Awakening. Who was the player who just came off the respawn? You find that first uh -oh. kill. Vico finds a second on to Vivid, so this is the last opportunity for Miami to try they're, to get They're creating in. space here because they're him out, dude. So you gotta go. Accuracy on the cross, only able to take down one. Linz, tallying information as he steps in as the last defender. But Shit, that's around. Miami's gonna go big here. Nope. But 
does eventually get traded away eric boom now the last one left it would have to be a one v essentially three he's getting challenged from all sides Stop. and minnesota AG, will eventually find round. Minnesota. So they only held the three ticks is nice gap at the end and really no progress to speak of over towards the other zone at b yeah, that's just a good, good defensive for Minnesota right here. from Minnesota. At the beginning of the year, they were one of the best defensive teams that we had on Karachi, and they continue to show it as they are every single time off the respawn, refilling those gaps that were needed Black to be top filled right now. over towards the junk side, making sure no one is overextending. The players coming off spawn, that's your angle. They just had a read on where every single player from Miami were trying to apply that pressure from. And they hold strong on the defense, only allowing three segments to get away from them. And I'm pretty sure Linz is now activated. I don't, I don't yeah, know if he's yeah. saying that 10 already. Yeah, 10 and 3. That's a good start from your main SMG. Yeah, 1.05 control KD for Linz. He is by far the best on the team. So if you can essentially provide what he had moments of on the Rio hardpoint, but throughout this control, that could be maybe your X factor to try to reset this series. But quickly off the break off Miami all over it, not allowing Minnesota anything over the top of the A zone. Eventually, Vivid will survive long enough to kind of keep the clock stopped, but Lucky Top Bricks thought he had okay. an angle at it, but not quite. Vivid wins it relatively cleanly off the reset, not quite, as Eric Boom will make sure that Miami continue to make sure this clock keeps on ticking. Yeah. Don't even allow, allow that first segment to get complete as well. You already have players up to a junkyard. You already have players trying to cut up through the middle of the map as well. So Minnesota, they do not have an angle. Or at least the trades, the gunfights going in their favor to stop this go this game clock over at the A point. Finally, though, Vivid and Accuracy able to take that. Okay. Eric Boom, yeah, first segment is going to be completed. And you see Miami on their setup. They're going to be nice and slow to this one. So they might just give this one up for free. Awakening playing from top third finds Eric off his spawn. A couple of shots from Lucky, kind of similarly so, over towards that top AC position. But we got some red yeah, control, okay. Not enough success nor kills to find a way to break back over. So the extra 60 gets tallied. 20 plays, 21, small advantage for Minnesota. But still, not a lot of ground to work with here in terms of breaking things open. And oh. as wins will drop, okay, Minnesota has to come off spawn. What happened to the quality? Is, your, is you guys... Spawn, my quality looks ass. So I went to 720 somehow. Towards junk, so you can apply that don't make no sense. To red side. You knew that Vika was the guy at least playing over towards Ticket. He finds a freebie onto Accuracy, able to dance with death and walk away with his life. If you can earn this cruise missile, you have two to work with on the side of Miami. They're just trying to have the same exact setup, the same response that Minnesota had on their defense. Already 45 seconds knocked off that game clock. Trades back and forth. 50-50 gunfights, largely speaking, but Miami start to earn a bit of an advantage in that life lead. 60 seconds now, down two. Microphone good plays, Jenny, good plays. Kind of sneak Microphone through the middle activated. of this defensive setup, and as vehicle drops, maybe a bit of cause for concern here if you're Miami, because Minnesota's going to be able to hit this with some force. Lucky tries a wow, challenge Louis on MCW. accuracy and a, what a huge gun. 1v1 win. That'll slow down Minnesota just about to a halt. I don't see anybody Metals clipping that and putting it on Reddit. Forward. All he these close-up kills. And now it's just down to finding these last couple of rock rockers that have made their in, way in four in fucking bullets. Map. And speaking up, it is just awakening last one left as Vico finds the kill. Clean defense here for Miami now in the set of the first spawn trap. And that was such a big kill from Lucky because if he loses that gunfight, it all falls into the hands of Metal. So trying to shut down three players over towards red. But once he finds that kill, you see Metal with the heads up play, turns around, catches the player off spawn, and then Lucky continues to slay in towards top red. And now that's only 20 seconds left. Minnesota's last hoorah. Wow. You have one player Wait. going to the pinch, awakening through middle. So they have an avenue to try to get on in. Accurate should be able to just step on into the zone, stop the clock. Yeah, he's even got oh, names that are hitting over the top of the jump wall. So that kind of keeps Miami. How do they know about this for Okay, fun this guy's got Cruise a pinch. Missile round heroics here for Minnesota. Second player gets stacked. There's the extra tick. Cruise missile called, doesn't find anything. Kills for Miami, start to come Maybe they don't win this. They the fucking ticks are big. Zone. Second ticket progress. Now finally contested, but Lynn steps out, finds the kill. Eric and Metals trying to work out for the last couple of the yeah, kills. Man, they will, they're up on the ticks now. The extra tick does get talented there for Minnesota at the last moment. Yeah, you would take that if you are Minnesota. To at least put yourself up in the segment column. Now you're leading by one, but you also get back the investment of at least one cruise missile on the side of vehicle. So you don't have to worry about that going forward. But Miami, good on the defensive end. Back to back defense. Phenomenal. And now you just have to make up for those segments. I would like to see an early B pressure play because I feel like Miami, at least in the beginning of the year, they were one of those teams that would catch you off guard. Everyone was sure. going over towards A, stacking that point. But when you're able to catch them off guard for a B play, you're basically going to guarantee an attacking round. So I'm really curious to see what their initial start is on this round. That'll be probably the kind of thing to highlight for both these two teams. Yeah, the Miami plus one and a half hit here. after the second map. I mean, so we're good. From the desk. We also mentioned it briefly. Because we're going to say it three and a half on the spread, which control. is, you know, you're not going to be able to top we'll see that. see if so. they do get tested, they have a response, or if they have Microphone something activated. possibly up their sleeves on their own right. But for Miami, nothing strange here. 
little bit of focus over towards hotel eric gets traded out but at least finds one for his life as equal stays safe i'm gonna phase optic it, uh winter semis trying and to halo jump probably in, like an hour and a half quick to recover and that'll be the first thing show which is tough yeah first segment already complete you yeah have a lot phase of optic are playing uh, during the lucky. show yeah also i know finds the timing it to is not really allow tough to eliminate his teammate on towards the point and Miami with all these kills that they're getting. Uh, maybe not. I mean, if, if uh, what time does the game start? To push out towards the backside of Cafe. With uh, all your teammates it's after this whatever matches I'm in right now. So I don't know yeah. what, how what series go is that. But. Opposite, but oh yeah, true. It could be during the third map. Be That's a good point. Or the third series. 18 seconds of work over towards B. Which your teammates having a little bit of map control before they all get cut down. If it does get caught though, so Miami. Like case I never talked to you about the idea, like he had floated to you to go to Arlington. The only one inside yeah. the zone, Lens, seen over towards Arlington. Case on, what Case on wants to do is form a kill. He, he, he wants me, Tommy Temper, well, and him. He wants to be. He wants to do like an esports thing. He wants to go to all the esports events. He's talking like Rainbow Six events, Halo events, COD. He wants to go to everything. It's not a horrific idea. Just get you away from the stream, which is the only issue, you know. But no, I would still stream it. Oh, bad. This is over. Wow, no, Miami. Got but you might call the three one dead ass on. I know they had two you cruise have, missiles that got nothing done. I'm gonna absolutely Keep fucking call mind. the shit. When you get a cruise missile, it's usually gonna guarantee one kill, but when you're finding those kills close towards red, at least finding that trade on the vivid, you keep influencing those spawns for yep. Miami to spawn close over towards that red side junk. We can watch able to the just use their to match before we do the show. The cafe. If you guys are keen for and that, boom, yeah, that yeah, round it, on five, but it shouldn't be too. I think the Miami, match. I think it's gonna one, start during the third one. match. I think it now, is too. Three to four seconds. About the phase Halo thing. So you have to try to make that up if you are Minnesota. That's exactly way dude. You wanted to respond on that attacking ground. Now one kill from that room until he earns himself a cruise. Yeah, they're gonna need to obviously win this offense, but as you mentioned, it's a five tick difference. Yeah. So if they do it by lives, they have to at least capture two ticks over towards this B zone. But once again, Miami, <clears throat> Miami just right off the break off. Not worried about just waiting to see where Minnesota are going. They're saying, no, this is our map. We'll take it. Thank you very much. Tough gunshots here as metals and accuracy are in a really tough argument over the top of Palms, but Awakening My is Lamar there to kind of over lucky bet is not looking good. Play, and with that, Minnesota stopped the clock as they start to make some progress on it. Yeah, and they have a lot of map control as well. You have bridge side. You currently have top red as well. So Eric Boom just trying to play for at least one kill, and he might be able to earn it. Oh, no, the so shots close. in the back from Vivid is able to keep his teammate alive. But the first segment Three does dead. get complete. Okay. Now Minnesota find a couple kills in the feed. Now it's time to hit that go button let's try to get over towards b and hit that early transition but, but vivid gets cut down lens is going to get red on the flank he does find that kill but now miami are going to get all those close bonds over towards cafe it falls into the hands of uh, eric boom who finds two shuts down that pressure so it's going to be time extended but miami ready for the push yeah absolutely massive double kill though by the way from eric boom I mean, because Lens is just Microphone out here. Just yeah, Miami, my, my show prediction was looking good. Yeah. Disconnected from your Real Madrid wins. On this B zone, Miami, can essentially Miami wins. You know, that's a good call. Why in the on fuck? In a row. Now, all of a sudden, he could try to hit this, but shot at over the top. Lucky try to challenge, and that will be enough to shut things down. And in the Microphone meantime, Vico over, over the middle of the map to shut down Rocker, shit, trying to hit from the front. So, all of a sudden, what would be a good setup for Rocker gets completely foiled, and now the Rocker's going to be spawn trapped. At least if you, at least if you are a Minnesota Rocker, you have red control, so you can decide to fight right through the front end. But these next couple of fights are going to be massive because if you lose them, you allow Miami to put you in that trap, force you to not overextend up through uh -oh. Coop's side, and they don't find any kills in the feed. Last player up is going to be Awakening. He does take down Eric Boone, gets Ooh, free on some medals, able to open up that avenue for his teammates to sprint right through forward. This is all out mixed mix in towards Junk, and it's still Minnesota oh, getting no, those close pawns to reinforce. Break some these timing back out. I don't think they saw him on the zone right here and stop the clock. As they just continually labor on the ones in front of the zone. Lynn's tagged oh, up. No Finally finished off by medals. Eric still oh. watching with the cross. Vivid eventually gets yeah, taken down. And, yeah, side. Here we go again. Miami just not content at holding still, but I mean they are pushing every given moment they can. They're trying to win back these key positions on the map, and so far it's been very successful for them. 11 v 11, 40 seconds of the clock to go. And now if you are Minnesota, you have some map control. You already pushed up in towards red. You're found in this two fights. All you have to do is eliminate these last couple of players before the rest of the cavalry jumps over that half wall. 
It's all about these fights. Unfortunately, Man. they do not come out much no in the trade engagement. Miami up close and personal with those SMGs. They prefer those gunfights. With only 20 seconds left, Minnesota, this is your last push. Yep, absolutely. Even players coming off spawn will have to go in one by one. So this is the last concentrated hit for Minnesota. Divid dealt with immediately. God, these teams quickly. really just take turns being fucking horrific. It just feels like everything is being covered. I mean, these two give teams, me yeah. Break. There's no, just just all the time. Everybody that's not top four just take turns being fucking In terrible. In these last two series, they'll get the series oh, done. Oh, he's just going stay away from betting on this one. I don't know one. which fucking Miami Minnesota we're going to get. I don't know which. Listen, I called it on the show. Called it on the show. Why'd you pick him, Ben? What was your reason? On the show, I said, listen... If Real Madrid win, there Miami the Heretics win. And you know what happened is Real Madrid beat Osasuna this morning. And, of course, Miami beat Minnesota. So There you go. And then I'll be right back. For us. We just have to figure it out. And when you figure out those rotations, you're going to find success on map number one. But the fact that they walked into a high rise SD, which was game mode number two, and they've only played it one time, and that was versus Atlanta probably a couple months back. They walked away with it a clean 6 4 versus a Minnesota Rocker who were undefeated on that map. They yeah, usually do yeah. not have any openings. But when you allow Lucky to just pop, take over, drop 15 and 4, absolutely dominates in that map number two. And then. Map number three, this was Minnesota's bread and butter control. Yep. We're talking yep. about Karachi, where they used to be one of the best teams on defense. They started to slowly figure out their attacking round, so no one wanted to square up with them on Karachi control. But Miami said, no, nope, screw that. We're already feeling great. We're going to play you on your best control map. We have the SMGs who are always applying the pressure. And I just think if you're a Minnesota rocker, it's going to come back to bite you because you had a lot of situations where you could have hit that rotation quickly over towards the next side. But every single time you tried to do that, there was a player from Miami contesting you, finding two and then shutting down that play every single time miami just came to play today man clean 3-0 from them i think we may have to do like a brief little analysis on this miami stage <laughs> two qualifiers because losses to toronto atlanta new york were pretty bad but a map yeah. five loss to vegas a map five loss to la thieves now two wins maybe we're sleeping on this miami team a little bit but we'll let the desk talk about it after the 3-0 comes through and the heretics still have upper bracket hopes alive not just upper bracket hopes, I was doing some of the math here, Nameless. So with Carolina losing 0-3, that means that Carolina finishes with 11 map wins, 17 map losses. With the 3-0 from Miami, they now have 11 map wins, 16 map losses, a better map win percentage, and would have the A seed over Carolina in Puckett's current math bracket. I mean, with the way wow. Miami, Miami has Heretics on might be sneaking in and to lose to either play. Optic I mean, or New York in round one. Oh, vamos. I'm buying bucks. That was probably the only map this entire qualifier Miami has shown any life on. I think that might have been a misstep by Minnesota Rocker allowing oh. that through. However, I will say to that point, even though Minnesota were heavily outplayed and rotated in the beginning, they started to make a case for themselves around the second set of rotations. However, Eric Boom was a two-piece machine. Even though he ended even every single life almost. When I mean, I think the Vamos bucks was said, I'm not fully back in on the Vamos bucks. Seconds of scrap time. It was on the rotation. It was but you know, no bombos, folks. but you know, yeah. the market's open, and, and I'm, I'm taking, I'm taking a look, bro, and it's it's looking decent. Are we buying the bounce bin? No, I mean we gotta do a taste test first, Are and like the bounce bin? We, gotta, we gotta sample the ice cream first and see what flavor we're getting. Bombos coin? No, we're not. Oh yeah. Bombos coin. Diamond hands. It's rotating over towards Not the yet. hill. They send only Vivid up the middle of the map. He loses his gunfight, and from there, we all have played Rio. You know how it goes. You lose P3, you're likely losing P4 as well, especially when you're at a deficit. It's so hard to break. We get to the S and D. They have a 4-2 lead, guys. They're in a great spot. They have bomb down at B, all four players alive, and you get picked one by one to get retaken. I fear the These Minnesota cats are just... On the flip just... side of that, the turnaround from Miami, incredible. I'm playing like, really These shocked. guys have looked so much better, and in in this series it was a statement like we deserve to be in this league they did make a statement especially their leader let's take a look at your scuff play of the game it's young lucky not even 25 yet and he's still putting up 14 plus kills i mean this search is right was insane the biggest change like nameless touched on it was 4-2 end up winning a round going to 4-3 it should have been a minnesota rocker win Microphone to go 5-3 round number uh three. eric does a bet some bavada he does a bet some bavada Three players. Sound like, he had no reason activated. to get that final kill on Awakening. He had no reason to stay alive right here. We're actually watching in front of us. Eric, you're he here. The three piece, and that is yeah. Miami. You've been on Bovada. Some of my chat was asking. You do Bovada, right? Who, me? Yeah. Maybe, allegedly. Allegedly? Okay. 
Is that a Fed question? Like, what's going on here? I don't know. Hypothetically, if you were to bet, you know. Hypothetically, yeah. I'd hypothetically, use Bovada. All right, fair enough. There you go. How good they were at Karachi control seems like it's back. We listen, Eric. Honestly, are we thinking thieves in the series, or are we thinking? In the series, or like we just talking the spread? The one player returning from the mutant Not thinking thieves in the series. Now joins us okay. live. The spreads? Vic, we're coming home to Miami um, next weekend. You guys have a chance to play in the video, winner's huh? bracket after that 3-0. What's the talk like in the camp right now? Um, I'm pretty sure doing the math, you know, my dad is a big math guy, so he told me um, if Carolina lost and we beat Rocker, we would secure winner's bracket. I trust my dad, so I think we... Uh, we secured pretty, uh, we secured winners bracket, so we're pretty happy about it, you know. Oh. Um, big win from us, and I'm looking forward for next week. Shout out to Daddy Vico yeah. following along, <laughs> doing the math for you every match. Vico, congratulations on this win, and congratulations on securing winners bracket. Uh, you know, I was one of those people kind of screaming from us beginning of the season. You know, having you guys come back to the league, haven't seen you since Black Ops 4. You know, starting major two qualifiers wasn't what you guys would have hoped for, and so I start, I stopped believing in you. I think some of us did, but now you guys are back. Do you have anything that you want to say to the Miami fans as you are heading into Miami next week? Um, shout out to everyone that stayed on our side for when we were 0 and 5, you know. Um, Eric is still adjusting to the league, you know, it's uh, being on the big screen is not easy. So he's been uh, working on, on himself, on his confidence, and he's been looking so much better. And that has helped us all overall, overall in, in practice and in these last two matches. So um, I'm hoping our rookie of the, of the season keeps up with us because he's going he's gonna to show up on LAN and we're going to do great things. And thank you to all the fans that stayed on our corner. Um, we didn't take any of you for granted, so appreciate all of you, and we love you. Uh, Javi, vamos, man. You guys have righted the ship. What do you attribute that to? What was the change in the gameplay? Because you guys have completely yeah, I don't turned know, I don't it know around what that was. Is that this my, last week. I don't know what that was, Charlie. I mean, <laughs> I think Eric mentioned it last week. Our practice wasn't going uh, bad at all. Um, you know, the top four teams are still, you know, the top four, so... They, they give us really hard practice, but the rest of the teams in general, we were pretty like, um, we're winning most scrims. We're, we're working uh, hard against like against everyone. And I think it was just uh, making sure that um, we translated our practice into games. You know, I feel like the top four teams, uh, I think we played three of them, um, just are on top. So they beat us really easily, but it was a close loss against Vegas, a close loss against Thieves. And um, I mean, we just had like that little, um, you know, zone to to pass, and we did that these last two matches, so we're happy about it. Vico, final question for you. I need to ask a favor for our editor. Can you please just look into your camera and say "Welcome to Miami" in Spanish? <laughs> Bienvenidos a Miami. You're welcome, editor. There we go. That is Vico. That's your monster winner spotlight, and we will see you on land in the winners bracket next week. Have a good day, guys. Thank See you. you. Didn't think those words were. So, Eric, the spread on the first map is 47 and a half for me. Just before these qualifiers are finished. Yeah, on a Rio. We taking it or no? Um. Oh, I just think Toronto's look so good. Fucking. Yeah, that's my that's my issue too. Toronto's average differential victory has been about 20 and a half on the map. The four times they played it, I think, is correct. And for Thieves, you guys are minus 25, so. Upgrade your game with the scuff, the official controller of the Call of Duty League. I might do it so I can Start the season strong with the Call of Duty League pack. try and make some coin off the two and a half if it doesn't hit. Cause I feel like Toronto might scan the map too, but I don't know. I might just wait. We think. We think. Do I just take the cover chat? It's only minus one twenty though. It's only minus one twenty though. Is a problem. I don't know. It feels like a trap ski for me. If it's plus money, I'd be down. Minus one twenty, like I don't know. 
started competing, it's probably um, last year with the Florida Mutineers. The line is too good. It is really good. It is very tempting. In the main stage in the first event, we lost against them 3-2, but then we had the opportunity to play them again the day after. And beating them 3-2 uh, was a really good memory for me. Talk about aggressive knocker. Four players over towards that. Well, so my stake is 750 and I'm up. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna hold on it. We're gonna hold. I think the hedge I don't think Toronto's gonna lose map one to Thieves. One back garage, one back garage, two garage. I don't think so. The the hedge is map two, bro. We get nice plus money odds on Toronto or on Thieves and Map Two. Live bat. he got be so happy. He finally does That's gonna be the play. That's gonna be the play. Get out, but he can do front flips. Oh, daddy's hungry. This shit's so trolly, bro. Oh my god. Riley takes him out. Oh, it's done. Hey, uh, hey, Eric, you there? Yes, sir. Eric, do you Snapchat at all? Do I use it? Not really. Okay. How, how does it work, bro? Is it, is it, do people subscribe to me on Snapchat? Do they follow me on Snapchat? Like, how does it, how does Snapchat work? Or do you not know? I'm, I'm pretty sure there's like a, a following thing because there's a page that shows um, like an algorithm of just like a random feed. So I'm assuming you can follow people on it. Right, 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 right. Yeah, I just open it up. There's like a little tab for people you follow and then it just like shows through their stories. I've also oh, like never really okay. used it though, so. Okay, okay, okay. So, can people follow me? Or do I need like a creator account for them to follow? Because I'm just getting hella fucking notifications that people are trying to add me as a friend. I don't know the difference of adding by a friend and following. Because when I used to use Snapchat, like I only used it for like personal friend stuff. Like, what the f I don't know how it actually works, yeah, but I, I don't know how this there has work. to be a way to follow you because I see the like the following tab. It's friends and subscribers, people are saying. Bro. Two, different, two, different, say. two different shits now. And everybody's saying to make your account public, but I don't know what the fuck I'm Wait, doing. Tom, are you doing the creator program shit or are you not? Well, I need to make an account first. Snapchat's still like big. Bro, apparently Snapchat's like, I don't know. I asked my chat if they use Snapchat and they were all spamming yes. Bro, they were like, last summer, bro, they were paying so much money for creators to be on Snapchat. Yeah, I know they were last year. I just didn't know if it, like, yeah, died out. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how this shit works. Someone bro. said you gotta create a public profile. That's how you get the subscribers thing. Gotta create I've seen a most of my random like, yeah. videos and shit on like Instagram reels. Welcome back, everybody. After taking where I down Vegas, hang out on the Miami, internet. Minnesota, and LAG with a 12 and 3 map. Count. How to make my Snapchat public? Let's look it up. The Toronto Ultra, they fall in 03 to that Atlanta phase. And so, Eric, you know what's been annoying me about this TikTok shit, by the way, on like a side topic? Obviously, like, I think the, the bill's a stupid idea. But people acting like the bill's gonna pass and Biden's gonna sign it and then TikTok's just gonna be banned. This shit's gonna be tied in courts for years. Like TikTok's going nowhere. Yeah, I don't actually know what'll happen with it. And we're acting like IG Reel's gonna pop again. Like, it was just still gonna be on TikTok. The app's still gonna work. You get injunction easy. So, like, it's gonna just take forever. I agree. I, I think that this series in, in Search and Destroy, I, I feel like LA Thieves actually has the edge. You know, there's a lot of like small things Toronto has been dropping the ball on. I mean, they allow the they allow teams to plant at an alarming rate, They're actually second to last in the league in that, and then they can't retake. They're third uh, to last in the league in retaking as well. So defense and, and S and D need some work, and then also the control. Three and three in that game mode hasn't been the best. They've had some tough competition. You can see for the Monster Energy pregame, sort of yes. reiterating the S and D does look vulnerable in the last One and five. Four. It hasn't been great, man. In the defense like i said not great as well that of course is toronto ultra locking in and controlling you could be coming away with your fifth win 
here in stage two. On the other side of this fight, though, it's not going to be an easy battle. User joined your channel. Squad that has been surging as of late. Let's break down the LA Thieves. Dan Ghosty and Afro now joined by Nasty and Crimp. And since this squad has merged Good together, gamers. a four and two record with their only losses to Optic and Hello. ATO. Yeah, they've been finding a lot of sex Good dog. success when it comes to the search and destroy. Hey, Chris. I think in the hard point, it's been How's it going, Sam? Watching. It's, been kind it's of going great. I'm about to watch LA T3. Oh, these no, guys. Oh, you voted or you uh, predicted it, Toronto. They're still top three so? when it comes to that game mode. And nice. No, what that? Was that? Was that was yeah, yeah. That's true. Three game win streak, Mr. Chris, what's good? Those hard point wins are against teams like LG. I mean, this is the team that was 1 and 12 in hard point in stage one. They're now 5 and 5. They've been playing it's good good day today, potentially, huh? Yeah, you had some good into getting on a time monitor there, by the way. And they look unbelievable. I'm hilarious. Yeah, I was going to work out of you. Good, good. Good flank co flank pundit fucking instigating going on. Oh, yeah, I got like dick riding tweets or something. I'm like, who's dick riding? Now we're trying to create content, bro. I'm trying to create some entertainment. There is opportunity in this series, bro. Nah, you want to know what's entertainment, bro? Hey, bro, get you guys to watch Kaisen that last night. I saw a clip today on Twitter of him <laughs> wearing some Yeezy pants yeah. or some shit. And like, <laughs> so he wore the pants, and then apparently someone sent the Kanye, and Kanye fucking did him on Instagram and lost full. <laughs> Imagine being that big from streaming. Uh, this dude, guy's just getting this guy's getting tweet or Instagram DM by Kanye. Kai, no, that's what that was what Kai was saying. Kai was like, I, I can't believe how far streaming has gotten. Like, I couldn't imagine this, like, a couple of years ago. Yeah, now, exactly. Now I'm like, I got, like, Connie telling me to go fuck myself like, on Instagram. <laughs> like, like, what am I doing here? Uh, this guy was in high school listening to fucking college dropout. Now he's getting told to go fuck yourself. Microphone. I mean, wishes. I don't know what the legal arguments that TikTok has against it, but they are going to try and it is going to get tied up in court. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like. It's good. Federal court does not move at lightning speed in situations like this. It's going to take fucking forever. Uh, and, one more uh, day of uh, qualifying yeah. matches, bro. Just so, one more fucking not, day. It'll be an absolute fucking barn burner tomorrow. You're not expecting this shit, them to win this matchup. This fucking They've split lag, bro. This shit sucks. This shit was horrible. Last four was not bad. 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 This split is terrible. There were just some absolute resident sleeper days, man. This is last split. We also like didn't know a lot about the teams. This split, we're like, all right, everyone's ass. Here's the two times. Just a little bit. All right, let's lock. Menace. Let's get down and lock. Well, we are locked. We are locked. SMG on this map. He's been doing outstanding uh, for him. Yes, I'm highlighting this shitter. There we go. No one cares. Well, that is uh, a very dangerous stat line to see if you're an LA Thieves fan. Let's find out how the actual match goes. Here we go. Toronto Ultra. LA Thieves. Map number one. We fly into Rio. And the nades and the stuns are out. It is going to get tied up in court, bro. Because TikTok can also just choose like not to fucking divest. And what they can do, get blocked by SPs. They're just going to sue, they're gonna sue TikTok to force them to sell. Like, it's going to end up in the court somewhere, bro. Was just cracking jokes about it, but him and Insight talking about getting cameras. So, <laughs> watch, watch. Something weird is going to happen. And LAPs are going to somehow. But for the moment, Thieves, great nope. job inside the hill. Of course, well, <laughs> okay, that never moment mind. has dissipated. That's a clean four, man. Wipe okay, never mind. bad spawns for LA Ultra. Now, this is planned. Uh, should I hit a Vickle and see what's up on that? Apparently, my location's on on my fucking Snapchat. That's not good. Yeah, people are saying you should be careful about following people on Snapchat. Uh, unless you want some uh, eggplant emoji. Uh, my location says it's off. An absolute weapon here. I think there's like a mode on Snapchat where you can like show it. Oh, you can. And the kill stays around the time. Ghosty makes the play though. Picks up a two piece towards the middle of the map. So you might be quick on this P2 break. I mean, Toronto Ultra is terrible around the hill. My location's off. Afro pouring on the pressure, but Ultra they alleviate the pressure on the B. Look at this map. 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 Look
Thieves certainly want to keep the pressure, keep these players at bay. Nasty doing a good job, just staying alive. He's got to make sure to lock this P3 down. Eventually, Ultra able to make that break. We're going to have a 40 second lead going no towards one in you. Hill. And Envoy already taking a route with right, Clay. Yeah. They died left too. About flipping those they're spawns. They're and you see where Ghosty's find. dying on the map as well. So, LA having to look so many directions at the same time. The pressure for Toronto, though, is still going to be working the flanks. Insight pierces his way through boxes. Just thinking about that contest. There it is. Dips a toe. They know where he's coming from. The Thieves pounce. Nice. Good Straight hold. in the feed. Time still going their way. Toronto, not too far away as reinforcements go. But number four is going to be the man to cause some problems. Crimp, though. The four spree is done. Afro now back on the stair line. Quick contest. In and out. Ultra keeping the LA Thieves on their toes. Nice shots out of Afro. Oh, nice. It's the second as well. 25 to go here on third. Uh -huh. He'll take all that time. Oh, that's the nice. Boy. He could it have might been there earlier. 20. I mean, everything for LA was so good up until they don't get that one trade. Still have the opportunity to fight back on this time, but you just see you know, the amount of if you really think about it, LA Thieves kind of is a win-win series because either they, they win or Envoy wins, you know? The spawns. You might Shut not get up, that scrap uh, time, and LA Thieves might have sort of <laughs> evened up the, the score count, but... I see what you're saying, you Ben. You try to be funny for you, too. Hill, they don't have yeah, boxes controlling really Afro, continuing to piece, slowing these players down, and ghosting next man in line. He feels like the guarantee for the Thieves squad to get those trades. It's happening all over the map. LA Thieves nice and stable on this P4. Great shots as well. Dan Ghosty. The hard point's all his. He's it's trying to turn this map on its head. Time. Bit of a pinch now from Ultra. Lead change. LA Thieves back in this one. Kleenex is going to send it. Easy trades here for the LA Thieves, boys. If they're able to make the play, they'll push their way forward. Oh, no. Insight gets his. Nasty's been pushed out of the hill now. Ultra have swarmed in, and that's a late break and a 20 solid second bit of time to have there. They're just trading rows, like so but Ultra like so keeps breaking in for the last, like, 15, 20. You know chill. He's just going to be L triggered, but when you feel the pressure yeah, from we're, his we're teammates in like the it's back side of your spawn forth. flanking, yeah, yeah, you're like forced to make rows. a move. You run into his irons. It is a dangerous place to be. Even now, Ultra are just setting up. Oh, a Gargantua a great and Page Envoy taking the ultimate route. He takes down Ghosty, and well, the players on time yeah, are just and that should be fodder. A Everybody getting wiped off there. the map. And that's a Route, that's why on the prowl now. you win fucking one spot. world championship Tags with a guy and you think you know him but he's a loser flank god in the fucking lines, pussy the no stick fucking the hard dumb chicago person takes care of Krem. dumb on chicago on person the 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 he's on a it's a six comes to a close lovely work though he has the cross what do you call people what do you call what do you call chicago in is that what you call chicago in yeah so Easy to just because I was going to go with Bears fan, but he's a fucking dweeb. He doesn't even like football. Moment, this has been a beautiful well, Bears are popular for Hill. They have run the score up. And again, it all started off the back peace. of just a monster pit. I fear the full city so from P5. That they didn't want to take them. I fear this is where it starts to the spiral. No, I fear this is where Nasty goes from 6 and 13 to 19 and 14. Massacre across the map. The LA Thieves, they mop up the remaining defending players of Toronto Ultra. These old boys are on board. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh my god, god. Dylan is just in fucking gills. Still with the cruise okay, maybe he won't be. Magnificent work out of Toronto Ultra. Let's go for a Yo. listen in. Thieves oh, are next to the back. Nice. 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 Push that cat, maybe? Is that me? Yeah, yo, it's the bathrooms, bathrooms. Bathrooms? Yep. They're playing out. Hop at too. He could have pinched bathrooms. Yeah, I think he did. Oh, cool. Good job, bathroom. bathrooms, dead. Nice. I'm gonna nice. hit front. Yeah, we hit front, fast. Push. We're gonna hit front for me, shot for me. Shot for me, dead. Close, nice. I'm absolutely good. Last one on top of you. I'm just giving him up, bro. Yeah, that's fine. Spotting here. Calf, no? Uh, it's still not there. Look at my deep pinch, just in case. Oh, one in the back of me. Stun him in the back. Yeah. One shot dead. I'm one shot. Another one, one, more, one more. Close. Close. Shot, 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 shot. One shot. Still back there. Yeah, shot, shot, shot. Shot. Shot the node, I think. Drops are pushed out. I spawned. I did. Might spawn front of us. Never mind. Okay, Cap then. I'll hold pin. Try to pin. Dark. Shot now. Shot in. Dead. I stalked too. Ghosty. Ghosty. What can I do? Watch me gate. Don't try me half wall. Just spawn. Good time. Not close. That's it. I'm just spawn behind a jello. Gate. It's already out. Half wall dead. Gate. Gate. Gate dead. Map suit. One half wall on the left side. One shot. I'm so weak. It's uh. Yeah, push. Go see, go see on the half ball. I'm, I'm so. Yo, he dropped down, bro. Cramp, 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 cramp,
still not pushed. Nice to be more. I spawned pretty deep. I'm a tree. One already whale. He went down. I spawned garage. I'm making him suck, bro. Yeah, already. Oh, one I can hit my yellow. Deep whale. Deep whale and one cross caution. That's one garage. Like whale. Whale is absolutely dead. Afro here as well, no? Oh, Watch out, Afro. One more stun caution. Hey, caution window. There's two. In caution. We nothing. Nothing will blow. Nothing. That's all four. All four. Yeah, it's maybe where the match went right here. This is where it's bad. That's one of the Toronto listenings of all time, bro. They did keep the hill white for almost a while. Are we dead asking a four hit streak two lives in a row? Incredibly comfortable game. Never mind, we're four hit streak two lives in a row. He's able to pick up two. Maybe that can soften up the push such a big wow. because they spawn so close. Insight together. Well, they just body you. It's an 80 point lead. You are back again to square one, spawning so far away. Looking like you're not gonna be able to get this time. Had to break in though. It's magnificent. Brick yeah, board dead. Here we are. <laughs> Sprint. <laughs> so, getting ready to wax lyrical yes. about impenetrable oh, situations. They are inside <laughs> the, the point. Next bit of time is all theirs. Rotation down as well. And what a turn of events this is. Old hard point time is about to be lost there. Ultra will take that. But now the setup once again towards the garage. Jamie's in a great spot. Uh, Jamie's making a play. Yeah, Jamie's just the play. They're going to break the pressure. They're, they're reading. Players literally swarming everywhere. It is two players yeah, no. on the hill that have That's to look perfect. at. Okay. Direction. Is everything, Might be able to pick up two. I think we're not able to keep these ultra players. Guys, I don't think we're gonna win this series. I'm gonna go high race surge coming up. Has been quelled, and now of course inside maybe a victory lap with the crews. Players are spawning distantly. You got all your bases covered. Number six <laughs> Trent gonna be going on a flank, but his teammates in the meantime seemingly getting picked apart. Death from above. Come on, Queenies, get five more. Come on. Developing here for the ultra boys, and this time it's Kleenex. Will he get a cruise? One more. Uh, and nope, nasty ends him. We're still on control of the hard point for Ultra Insight there with the Renetti. It's not gonna end here. Somebody oh get a God, fucking trade, bro, please. Melting these players this is right the now. problem, bro. They lose his hard so points. For him too. Every single kill Insight's been collecting. He's just Playing out here shooting players <sighs> underneath cars. They're running into irons. Prep is like randomly yeah, fucking them, but like with that hoodie up. How? Now, of course, though, we're having a, a similar question. Thing how how get to the hill first, but you already see the idea maybe setting up for another massive pinch. Of course, Insight could be out of the picture for a little bit, but they are just taking a deep route. Oh, waiting got more Drakes. There's raining Drakes on us. Cruise missile to roll through. I know they're from Toronto, but you don't have to rain Drakes on us, man. Six, six, six. 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 So Shut the fuck up, then. Oh, no, you're running out of reinforcements. Thieves numbers dwindling. Oh, Scrap my. Now on the pinch. Picks up his own. Final Good thing, I, good thing we didn't take the spread. Holy shit. He will shit. get one. Consolation. Can he get the player mm -hmm. at the time? Has to move. Has to fly. Is it good thing he didn't? Safe yeah. For now. Clear Why? Still in play. I love what a fucking loss. this point is nearly done. Last ditch oh. attempt now from the LA Thieves. Why would you take the LA Thieves? Why would you take the LA Thieves? Somehow nasty. I did better than that, bro. I'm going to hear that from a mile away, though. Really on this rotation. Oh, I guess everyone's just kind of getting shit on. It's not really there. I don't know how, how Kremp is playing. I'm getting so weird. And uh, as he goes on a spree, but cooking, maybe too little, too late, fuck. trying to stabilize. Yeah, to be 29, 23 when you're getting fucking well, like, the teams are going to shoot their team. Ultra though, it's just a matter of time. You feel like before they break it down. Sends some good pace. He's running and getting one and dying. Yeah. Big one over the Kleenex now. Can he get his? And this is to end. The map potentially another ah, one on one engagement. Afro I mean, they're alive. Gives Dokan, no, goes to a taste of his own medicine. Still alive and kicking. Envoy wins the fight. That should be the map. It should be done. No, no, no. Oh, wait. No, the oh, wait, 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 Dax is popping off. He's had a great like past few hills. He was struggling. Surely early, don't make this comeback, right? I'll bring it hey, a little bit to towards towards the, the, the table. table. Yeah, Still, though, fair. you have so many things yeah, on the map that you actually it. have to do. You want to I mean, no, we're not going to let the map. We're shooting. Yeah, I don't think it. they're second. making it look closer Anyone than it actually is. I want to break this hill in the final they're moments. They're just sprinting one point. Swarm. Two man down on the feet. Nasty, one of the last men on defense. Dude. It is not going to last. Ghosty versus sure. the world. Sure, we'll get the KDs up a little bit. They got them up. They did damage control at the end. They did damage control. They should do that earlier. Yeah. <laughs> what do you trade for the entire first rotation? It's fine, it's fine. It's fine. But you're absolutely gonna need to rehydrate after that one, lads. That was a Here for Octane's distress. What are we doing? What are we doing? Haha, see that's why I'm here. What are we doing? 
Like, I'm never in the watch party. But, like, they had plenty of shit. 5,200 kills? What the fuck? It really did seem like any time we were watching his point of view, it was just very comfortable. Amy had a map, 31 kills. But you watch crazy. They were down by a lot, and, like, they pretty much should have lost way earlier. They ended up getting, like, what, like, five, six kills? Take those five, six kills away. He has under 3k damage, that map. He was getting Kentucky. He was getting very well. They're always making. It's okay. It's okay. Don't overreact. It's just a hard point. We don't care about hard point. We're gonna win it. Not only do we have a shot, we're gonna win it with conviction. Once they really got things going, there was no looking back for Ultra. They were just so, yeah, so strong. Three sets of streaks, massive runs individually, and as far as the time goes, I mean, the stats showed it. Wonderful work in the assist department as well. All basic up a bit of high rise. To Ultra, a spicy start. And the LA Thieves, again, kudos to them. A very strong yeah, show. Gonna be interesting here. The game there. But many will be questioning, was that Make a What AR should Carolina pick up? We'll talk about on the show. But, uh... Because let's face it, by the time we got to that moment, I feared Geo would have been a great so option that is no longer barely, available. Barely lose it. I did oh God, I just saw a jump scare on the timeline. So wearing that hoodie is because it is quite cold up north at the moment. Our current kings of the north. Uh, yeah, I think we're just riding the two and a half at this point. In the weather department over in the not cold. Let me tell you that, boys and girls, we're sweating over here in my little studio. Better go to high rise and try to catch some of that sweet, sweet high altitude air. Search and destroy coming up next. That commentator of the year at one point in time and a meteorologist who knew a man of many oh, talents miles the gas mate the gas not shocked by this but what i am shocked a little bit by is the high rise s and d it's a you know it's the first time la thieves have played it all year brand new for these guys on that front and then of course Roltra, it is only the second time that they have played this map all year so uh, a bit of a surprise to see but of course <clears throat> i know the theme from ultra basically this entire Just stage the has either been working on the he map pool, which they've been spamming real hard point and s and d so seemingly at every given opportunity or even when ultra are playing against the other best teams in the game they're squaring up and going against them on their best map so these two teams looking for the experience Looking for those reps and uh, deepen that map pool as much as possible. But SD has been an interesting thing for Ultra because they have been getting slammed as of late, like ninth overall in the uh, opening duel win. Yeah, front. Neutron step up in the searches. It's still fantastic when they're getting it's the been, plugs, It's been a huge problem uh, spot the last couple series they played. Double six over. Six over by Optic at one point, six one on another front. Ultra has been on the, uh, the positive and negative end of quite a few six O's in SD this year. Of course, now it's a brand new map for him, so we'll get that look on high rise. To see exactly where their head's at. Yeah, I mean, right now everyone's head seems pretty cool. It's uh, an air of sort of calm but focused anxiety there for the LA Thieves. It has been a very difficult run of things as of recent. Either Jcap or Shane there, just keeping the boys hydrated. Playing out of the Cash App compound here in Los Angeles. Can the LA Thieves turn around what has been a difficult season so far? Adding Krim to the roster has definitely given them a, a nice sort of bump of firepower, as have Nasty. But is it enough to get the team together? Time is the only sort of thing they've really got now that they're running out of. That major is next week. There's no room for Microsoft. mistakes. Ravens, they, just, they don't, Again, they don't pack up. They don't have any kind of punch, bro. Absolute clear cut favorite. There's no they're jab. The team has jabs. They, they don't got any kind of fucking done. knockout power totally at all. Rise. And and basically, the, the, the like, curious is how, nice how way for me to say it. Going to be playing it. Microphone I think they're on record. It might have been like one of the first or second two times, two times. they played all year now that I think about it. Because I'm re remembering the analysis I was getting at the start of like Envoy's player. Let's go on the flanks. All right, it's Toronto going to cost me on my fucking bet on this map. Yeah, they are. Because they're about to get Ultra six out in 10 minutes. Time to shine. S&D has been his bread and butter so far throughout stage two. Plenty of fire. I don't know about that. I'm losing money. Yo, can we fuck it? I didn't know we were Toronto Ultra fans in this call. That's weird. We all predicted them to win. Fantastic. Yeah, I fear I, I am kind of that margin. So, yeah, I'm sorry. Play to look out for, but sorry, Brad. Haters, I'm just, I'm just watching really this show with a bunch of fucking haters. It's fun. Maybe versus Afro down low. Now it's life. I don't know commits. No one's committing nothing whatsoever. This relationship will not get very far. Just every minute to play it, and no one really seeing too much. Here comes a commitment towards the B Street. Finally, the Ultra Boys. They're terrifying. Take things a bit more seriously. 
Is there about Toronto? We're talking about Toronto. We're talking about Toronto, but it's fine. We're on defense. We're on the other side of the bridge. We're on tags either side. This is going to be the start of the round now. 45 seconds to go. Oh, and they're going for the bomb plane straight away. So a four versus four with the bomb plane, and Ghosty is going to fall. Ultra finding all of the kills Tom's in Afro. Peppy there. Well, he's made his way towards the bomb. Nah. Two players up top, good shots, but still a man disadvantage. He's waiting for Nasty to get in the mix but ultra players are crawling all over the map there is Here nowhere Marcus's. you can go that is an efficient first round outside oh, of the see moves afro well his teammate saw him but he Last did half. it in a little bit too that was late. a quick ultra round there dominant one. yeah without any sort of pressure on the map ultra just creeps in towards that round, bomb site scrap the man and get the bomb down as oh he gets the first one <sighs> as they get that so bomb down say. asap and after that it's curtains there's no hope even the gun skill of the LA Thieves not enough to save them then. Toronto Ultra laying the foundations for the round uh, win. They're in the first. And again, just incredibly efficient. No time wasted. I mean, good stun and uh, nade usage as well just to go for the clearance. And as soon as they found that opening, no time wasted. Now LA Thieves turn on the attack and... I assume All right, don't fall from that, please. Come out, Ghosty, actually the bomb carrier for the SWAT. Yeah. SMGs, <laughs> and or Whoa, yeah. that's around. Ghosty will just I mean, Sam, that's just the round that you just wish for in this map. Oh, they're trolling us, Sam. Oh, yeah. Somehow. Gets the second kill, Afro. Two one before, they went on board. Why are you getting excited? Like, he's going to clutch this. What is wrong with you? He's going to just kill an envoy, and he's already got two. He's not clutching shit. Look, he's tweaking. Oh, we were tweaking! Oh, oh my god! Why? I was hesitant to say anything there, but Ghosty knows oh, a steal. Oh, reset. Keeps it all together. But Sam actually almost should have been, so I'm not even gonna lie. If we got 1v4, he would have never heard from me again. You get to get a true 1v4. And by envoy, none the least. Nonetheless. Yeah, bro, didn't they get the fucking memo? You're already on Ultra, you won an event. Throw a dog a bone, man. CLTV's absolutely popping. Holy fuck. Thieves, though. Holy shit, man. Yo, Dill must think we are shit. He just reach out 25 HP. That actually was crazy, bro. they played this map, they might have forgot about that massive exploded propane tank. It can be a problem from time the time so uh what a first blood there from dan ghosty in the previous round and yeah if i'm kleenex blow up the barrel see if you can get free too hit it two time am i behind forget about it you know and it hits at the worst possible time i think i am in search and i already hit it two times Yo, right here we stop behind, i know we're blowing a lot right now but can we stop oh no it's such for sure, blow the other team, not our own boys. Wait, Sam, so is the Kleenex biggest instigator. The I just yes, saw a tweet. He, he said that hit the awakening that played a rank play yesterday. Wait, what's his wait, 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 what wait, 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 People come in chat talking about what was his wait, rank play bullshit going on. These boys are shooting too. I think Dylan Envoy might deserve the credit for that. Did you say wank? I think Nasty got it. Wait, big wank, big big wank. I don't know. Whether it be your team that gets the credit for the kill. Did you just say fucking wank? Takes one away. Is that your mind out of the gutter? It's your head out of the gutter, man. He said wank, not me. He said. On the attack there from Ultra, guns are singing sweet. And Envoy, a map that you imagine can certainly be his playground. He has been thriving thus far. Yeah, run the show right after this. Right now, from Ultra, microphone dodge, activated. Massive exploding tanks. LA, keep those nades up. Any more propane shenanigans in this map, Marvin? Blow them. Oh, yeah, we might get Blow it. Scrap. Mm -hmm. oh, now, this one's safe. You can be right next to this massive exploding barrel, and it's perfectly fine. But if you're far away from the other one, that's a problem. Get on. <laughs> oh, Don't be too far away from Afro, though. Two HP and a big win here in the round. He gets himself too nasty. Ian Afro now versus Envoy and 2v2. It is a sub machine gun rival nine throwdown here on high rise. Oh, that's looking good. Oh, it's Bombs not. To be recovered. Why is Hopefully. no one an LAT fan yeah, when LAT Afro plays men? Yeah, you guys are a whack. Wind of that crazy that play. That needs to be the side oh, kill. Man. And that should be. What would we be doing right now if you guys so cared like more? He's got himself MCW. Yeah, Sam, they're just solo running around, though. Look, now that Nasty's here, he's oh, dead. Is they know he's here. He's screwed. I do believe Envoy saw him, though. No, he didn't. Wait, no, they have no clue. They they didn't see him. Excuse me. I don't know. Dill just blacked out. He blinked. Do they? Maybe they. What the fuck is this? Wait, wait, what? Wait, wait, what? He's gonna get his plant down. Wait, what? Yeah, it's a round. Nasty now puts himself in a situation wait. where he might be able to get this done. Guns what up the at the ready, son. I hope you're at least in a position so to take these fights. Maybe he gets a bomb check. Yeah. Let's see. There goes the propane. It's a good play. He's got out. Yeah, he had no intel. This is super doable. 
Byron Plumridge has gone for a bit of a walkabout. Less than 30 seconds to go. And oh, he gets my God. Kleenex. Well, yeah, I don't know how I'm going to see him on him. The right weapon in the right place. I should have zero clue how dope. He must have been looking hard right, like, he's like, in front of Spawn, maybe. He's going to turn things around massively. Dill hit a blinker and didn't see my boy. Get that ass. NT, go next. NT, NT, NT. Why is chat saying slam? Why are we saying slam? Yo, block the fucking. No information. Just checking everything, fucking fantastic setup, <laughs> fantastic awareness, and I gotta say, Nasty has some of the best player reactions. Anytime he oh, does, he's always I'm about to turn my all the way back in his chair. But that is turn the difficulty of playing against a team like Toronto, even when the odds sort of work out, out for you. These are getting cooked. Like these are getting cooked. Even with ultra struggles, their conversion rate in these rounds always That's not very dope and energetic of you, Chris. Advantage. Yeah, I know. We're learning very quickly about how to play. Uh, so we leave those in the past, Sam. No, no do we? Just like your playing career. Bitch. Just, just like yours. Just like yours. Perfect spread yeah, across the why are you what the fuck from bed? You never had one. On defense. <laughs> yeah, but I wasn't not getting paid to do one. Oh, that's a weird chirp out of you. Bed stress. Yeah. Fake smokes. Oh, fuck yeah. Fuck you, Ben. I'm down. I'm gun. down. Fuck you, Ben. Yeah. How about you? Hey, what's wrong with you guys? Ben, man? how about you take a fucking route out of here? Oh, Jesus okay. Christ. I'm just kidding. Ben. Enjoy, enjoy getting your plane ticket canceled. The fucking plane next week. Trying to stay alive. No. Scrap with the MC Good luck going to go see fucking Ultra Festival. Ben. I'm not going to Ultra. I'm not going to Kiko. It's also just about the only information. I'm going to be locked in. Everybody else on LAT is very stagnant. So it's tough to read on these corners now. You know, Ghosty owned him back, but you see the spot. Nasty has put himself in. If he ever gets the call up, they're planting on B. May Nasty will swoop in with a free kill. No, right, Tom owns you, Ben. No, I'm with Ben. Yeah, yeah. You're playing again. You should start showing some respect. Right now, still on point. <laughs> Brilliant work there. The hit and run from the LA Thieves. Nasty's holding that yeah. streak. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. They're crumbling. He he is, they're crumbling. This is a beautiful round there from the yeah, LA Thieves. Here we go. Held their ground. They're about to get one more forward. No, they're fucking not. This is Christ. Oh, this. Bro, Bro, Toronto thinks you guys the stink. They're just ego challenge. No, they're disrespectful. <laughs> and I think the patience what is the well fuck? certainly pays off. If they start trying to make plays down the B street, because... You did have Toronto more or less leave it open. Like that was a pretty heavy stack over on the tarp side of the map. But user joined LAP, your channel. Trust in the comms. Trust in the yeah. 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 Patience Guys. again pays off. Nice Let's round go, there go. from LA. We've also had back-to-back -back rounds of dodging those massive exploding right, probing tanks. Good. So hey, I'd love to see man. the adjustments. How much? What are you up to? I mean, how much? Just got home. No, when did the game come out? Did you warm up today? Late October. Warm up Toronto. 2009, you bitch. Right. Yeah. Theory, you're not wrong, brother. Here we go, though. Nate's I fear Sam is breaking down. Sam's not breaking down. Frag grenades go boom. Yeah, down, yeah the thieves are breaking down, man. Soon the rival nines will go boom. Ooh, I mean, this might just be a free round. Unless because they got rain, rain and it's very like soft. Kills in the middle of the map. Kleenex is going to get maybe a free kill. And that's the guy the with activated. bomb. Kleenex is never going to expect it. Why would you even check it? But for LA Thieves, you have to wrap all the way back towards your spawn and find Kleenex in the meantime. Round. Good luck. Have fun. But actually, they catch him out. There you go. So man advantage. Good. I've never seen us you lose around with numbers bomb. before, so this should be a guarantee. Oh, good yep. read, oh, Nasty. Oh, Nasty. Great timing there. Peaks. What if you saw him with crossing the mid? corner, catches out in sight. Uh, we got a good map here. We're about to be tied up at three here. Unless Dylan Envoy pushes the 1v3. Previously. Yo, what are we doing? Oh, yeah. Just saw him. Damage, no kill. Nasty. Thieves with another strong we go. round. It was a good yes. pick up to pick up the tissue Man, in the spawn say, there. That's kind of a funny one too. Yeah, I don't here we think go. you would ever expect a ghosty to be the bomb carrier and B having to be the bomb carrier sitting in his own spawn while his entire team is pushed up like We're actually around the uh, Super chat Sam, that you, uh, you might need to put the ring and jersey back on. I think that's they're saying over here. It's not saving him. Spawn, but, uh, you don't think it's saving him? No. Oh, it's so hey, weird days. that as soon as Some LAT are, uh, starts so playing, bold. everybody Let's picks a new fan base. Bold, I don't know. Else. It works out. Super yeah. weird. Love that. Bro, Sam yeah, could be rebels. dripped out in LA Thieves merch, oh, tattoos, hair color. He could be at the compound. That should have saved him. For our red clad warriors. Ghosty backs on up. A lot of damage dealt his teammate Krem oh. and Ghosty now finding their respective kills gives the boys they don't need really my a help. massive advantage. Suck. Yo, scrap is spawn in. For his life for they Toronto, don't need my help. These guys suck. Oh, Afro, I was going to say, he's been doing the scaffolding hot from both sides, though, and nearly had a free so beast. Scrap able to stay alive, good, though, but... but with the man advantage, Afro doing the smart thing. Backs LAT down. never lost around Krem numbers. 4-3. Never lost. 
Or so the beast. Oh my god, we're grouping. Oh my god, we're grouping. Rolling together, rolling it out on fire though. Inside with the tags out there for the cleanup. And I think now the Ultra Boys know exactly where everybody on LA is. And if we didn't know before, they certainly do now. Scrap even with the angle checks. That is an absurd one. I asked if Scrap was going to spawn in, and I fear he did. I'm so sorry, Sam. That is out of control. That is you're doing. He fucking heard me, dude. That is for Scrap going for the checks to spot the players pushing through blue. Sam. I'm so sorry. Sam, I'm so sorry. That's fantastic work out of scrap. Take notes, folks. Back up. Right there. Holy the fuck. Checks to make sure you know exactly where that player is going. Feeding that information <laughs> rapidly to his teammates, allowing them to pick up the kill. Ultra with a magnificent bounce back. Mike no, was it was not close. Nope. Not at all. Fun. 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 But it delivered for a master class, but either way, Ultra one mount advantage Crash after the first one. Like, three so row, dude. Happy. Just to go for the challenge, oh. Afro. Think about a scout oh, oh, again. In the meantime, though, his teammates oh, yeah, cleared up the extra kills nade. towards Bomb. Does get traded up by a nice nade. Ow. For a two oh. versus two. Yo, he is moving. Oh my god. I think Afro had he did his spot. Butt butt cheeks. Cheeks. Oh no. Shit on. Oh, it's a gunny. Good win. Gets away with his life. And now no, like I've never right seen down. Jamie one v two before, bro. This is a guarantee. Never, never, never. He's literally never one v two before. Oh, oh okay, shit! Oh, oh, that's a good one. God damn. That prevails oh, here, and damn. they are starting to believe. Map's kind of a banger right I'm now. So good. Did, uh, am is. I crazy, or did Afro run oh directly my. in front what of the inside player. screen? Oh, it's just TDM, think, bro. There's been like, like two bombs planted this whole map. Caster, so it looked weird, but I think inside just straight up didn't see him. But he I did run one directly team, across too. the center of his screen, did he not? He may have missed it. We'll have to go to VAR for that one. Yeah, Jesus that fucking Christ. But for now, possibly a slight error. A millisecond of a mistake has cost Ultra the round. And with that, we're back to 4-4. Four, four. Nades up. Start the round with a bang. Well, trophy at least there from Ghosty, just for the coverage. You see Krem being incredibly oh, aggressive. I actually got a blow. Oh, he's pushing it. Oh, wait, is he pushing it? Yeah, he is. Oh, oh, yeah, he is. I like this. Excuse me, working out the street. Oh, he's it. And this might just be a free <laughs> kill for him. There you go, yeah. set up for the kill. Look at Krem, go, it's inspirational. That next one, and he got out, LA Thieves. Four versus two, man, advantage. Afro, I mean, he's oh, a that shoulders. diabolic. Great Thanks. shoulder. Looking for the reach out, but it's the coverage from his teammates. Again, the LA Thieves, the trust Holy is fuck. there. The team is there. Right now. They are toyed like a toy gun right now. Massive advantage, and they're not giving it up whatsoever. St. Patrick's oh, Day tomorrow, oh but an early yeah. celebration is not something you want to have in this round. Oh, oh they have no map control. Oh, oh, it's nice one two shut versus up, shut four. Up, Envoy shut gets up, traded between up. X. Last man standing, 30 seconds to work with. Kobe has nasty zero ice. And ghosty. And if they're playing this distant, I mean, this is clutchable. It's yeah, not what easy, the but bond the possibility is there. They're playing the replay. Uh, I don't know. He's, not. he's running an MCW. He's with off. Bomb he's off. Here we go. He's on. Oh, he's got it all. Clean yep. it. Fire oh, him. Couple of tags oh, now. You know he's got to be down low. You know he went low. 35 to go. Oh, yeah. Here's Give the race. Energy. Kleenex does not look the right way. Oh, but Ghosty doesn't commit, and now oh, it's nearly a 1v1. Send it. Dang, Ghosty. Oh, Kleenex tags up. Why are we saying all? Ghosty didn't make what the move we, when he what did. What are we doing? I'm saying MTM, I'm saying MTM. That wasn't oh, me. Nice, nice round. round. Oh, nice round. round. Bro, this call is whack as fuck. That was whack. That was whack. That was whack. Get the first blood. Get crap up the B street. That was whack. That was whack. That was whack. That was whack. Fuck you. I saw a look of disgust in Kleenex's face for Ghosty to be flanking him from blue in that moment. But a well played oh. two versus one, swarm in the map. Wait, it's not over yet. So it's not over yet, Ben. It really isn't. What do you mean it's not over yet? It yes, it is. Get the round win. No, it's not. And Nagus nah, might have been you. correct. He did say he thinks LA Thieves might have a, uh, a bit of an advantage in the SDs, one around away. And that Jamie might just ice right here, watch. True. Jamie has no ice. He's literally never clutched anything. This time, Afro is grabbing the bomb. Makes sense to me. Uh, yeah, he's, he's a very mobile player. I think the last time we saw Afro really run the bomb quite regularly was back in Vanguard. I could be oh, wrong. Shit, we're swearing. Nasty says, get that paperwork out of my face. Get me that gunfight. But both teams being rather pissed. Here we're just not even looking Afro, at B Street, by the way. Trying to move this bomb. Why am I just forward. calling me a thieves hater? I'm just a thieves real. Oh, they're gonna really check this. Look up, 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 look up. Yeah, you see him. Craig, what the fuck? Oh my god, bro. Oh, Dylan Envoy's gonna make the fucking play. 
Oh, he's not assassinated. Perfect. I would go for the assassination, but he's going for all the kills. Great damage done. He's Dead. got out. Oh, not for long enough, though. Goes to get a hunt him in another man advantage from LA Thieves. Oh, this is for the map. You better dip out of there, This is for the map. To stay alive, man advantage. Surely they don't choke a 2v3 it's here, right? The ultra voice. Krem's going to get the plant bomb down. Holding firm. Scrap roaming in the middle of the map. Here comes oh, the Oh, yeah, first full flank and this shit's over. Yeah, yeah, yeah this is done. GG. Gives his voice the biggest End advantage it. you can ask for. End it's it. on the scrap now to win the Dead. 1v3. And it's not gonna happen. Not Tarasso such as Matt. We got back out of your stomach. Oh, he's pissed about that. Good bullshit something. Yup. Scrap, scrap, fucking hate this map. Yeah, consolation map. Yeah, Toronto's first consolation map. 3-1. Often than not, oh, I've been on struggle bus on betting, bro. What are you down five bucks today, Ben? It's gonna be big wins, bro. Today just I just got hooked, man. Well got hooked. Some of these early rounds, but that is fantastic execution. I mean, we really gave we Toronto one just for on just just for fun, to be honest. Ten out of ten, why not? Sure. Alrighty, get up to the strat that last round. That underground hit. I actually really like that. That was good. I mean, in all in all seriousness. All seriousness though, like channel. Toronto, like Toronto's the same map pool problem that Optic does, dude. Like they don't like terminal and they're not good at high rise. So like channel. you're gonna get one in a series. So That's why got, the Optic maps are always gonna be ego childs because they don't want to play anyway. Yeah, so like Toronto's Toronto's got to figure out one of these because the huge problem against New York is a huge problem against Phase. So all right, <laughs> what's the next map? And dreams of maybe going the distance with There's a cool Do Ultra have what it takes to close Rachi? this one out in on the Rachi? control game. We will be I'll tell you, Rachi, yes, correct. All right. The Rachi has I mean, sub base. Would be a shame if we won this too. <laughs> oh, man. Mm. I don't know, Sam. Yeah, you don't know, Ben. It's okay. I think, I think there's a 3 1. You're actually right. It is a 3 1. I wish I could lie back because I'd absolutely just lie back at 3 1 right now. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Ben. This is a 3 1. Yes. With the scuff, the official controller of the Call of Duty League. Slice up your competition with the Executive Chef Operator. Now available in game in the Call of Duty store. I wait three minutes to watch another map one. That's so cringe. Microphone what did Jake tweet? A team of inside Kleenex nasty and Afro win a chip. No, the fuck they won. Uh, no. Smoking Papan. I think that team would be deep, but I don't think they've got the grit and tenacity required. I think to uh to to win a chip. I'll be straight up with you. Not a not a huge fan of that squad. Not gonna lie. Microphone activated. Microphone Chat, I'm in the bathroom. I'll be right back in a few minutes. Stick around. Will Toronto win the next two or Steve's in Toronto? I'm going to go back and forth, back and forth. Be right back. Ben, I have a super chat. Would you mind if I read it to you? Ben. Ben J. M wants to talk to you. Am I getting donut walled by Benja? <laughs> what does that mean? I'm getting donut walled by Benja. Where's uh when's phase optic playing? Is it they're after this match? Uh form with the next match on BTH. Like now. No. Okay, so so right now Cloud9 and FOE are on main. Cloud9 next on main and sure. 
Do you guys want to watch the phase opti match and I'm then down. do the flank, or do you want oh. to? Yeah, he's not know what the fuck you talking about. <laughs> I had yeah. no idea. Uh, uh, do you guys want to watch the the Halo match first, or you want to just hop straight into the flank and just call it? Uh, I will do whatever you want to do. I mean, I'm down as long as you guys don't mind waiting an hour or two for the match. I'm for, I mean, I'm match. down. I'm, I'll just get food and then probably watch the game then, and then down for the show after. Because I'm definitely down. Face optic Halo. That might. I got that nothing might go going on. Crazy. That might be fucking crazy. We might yeah. need to watch that. Good for that. Um, and, I, and it's gonna the phase optic halo should start um, in the yeah. middle of this no no during this series I think it's gonna start during the series look at fights look at fight look look he's look he's spinning the look look at spin look look at wow wait fight bro we're biased we are blatantly biased we are blatantly biased we are blatantly biased I I'm sorry I can't be silent anymore this is rigged for views I've seen it live are we serious I'm just trying to keep track of everything there was so much going on I didn't realize there was like a room in the front left of the shot as well but there's a lot going on including major two gotta get your tickets we're going to miami very soon just a week away now and of course we're gonna be able all to right. watch all these wonderful teams in action just scan that qr code maybe play some rank get the vibes flowing ready to go Absolutely. Well, that QR code will be available on screen for a moment longer. The Miami Heretics hosting Major 2, presented by Gamergy. Come on down and maybe meet your favorite pro player. They might sign something for you or kiss your firstborn. Whatever you want. They're all very friendly and very accommodating. Best to catch them after a win, though. That's when they're really at their best. Here we go, though, folks. We find out who's best at this next map and mode in this exciting series. Toronto Ultra taking on the LA Thieves. We're going to Karachi and we're playing Control. And no second borns. I no love to the younger Absolutely siblings. Not. I'll Absolutely remember not. that. That's the I, uh, I was the first ball. Oh, can I say, brother? Here we go. We can refer yeah, well, to that as the monster energy fountain from now on, I think, for this map. Should we do that, Charles? I'm down for that. I think the, uh, All the right, first I'm on this map, though, might have been Same. Toronto Ultra. A 6-1 record two times, two overall. Two times. Been fantastic Let's offensive do it. end, defensive end. It does not matter, these guys. Absolute class. LA oh, great. We don't certainly win. a tall task ahead of them, including off the opening break. The nades on point Tell already. Tell Ben to rip the pen for down. every map so LA Thieves wins. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Absolutely eviscerates him. Nice. Oh my gosh. Oh, Max oh. Reed, the West Midlands That's finest with a multi kill. Yeah, rival what gun is he? The MCW is insane. That, that is absurd. Clean shots there from Afro. That's one of those moments where anytime Afro drops under a one KD, it's like, again, dude? how? Like, he's I see him when he shoots again, dude. Like, you in suck. an electric point of view. Oh, but shit. Maybe too twisted for his own. I was 45 and Rake played once. I didn't even tweet that for the 45. I tweeted that for Nature. I tweeted for Nature. Rival's insane, huh? Rival's insane. Envoy is Ray and McGilligan's right now. A lot of teams. A lot of players in life. Okay, Rival's insane, huh? Okay. Rival's Did you watch that three piece? Did you miss the three piece, Tom? I saw the three piece. Look back up and watch it. Look like Toronto got fucking shit on. That's what it looked like. clearly stretched before today's match. We can't take good shots. No other over there by the archer. Good shots. <clears throat> Long defensive lineup here. Only oh. a single segment gone. Here comes the play. A little wind, a little wind on that street. Absolutely perfect. Ernie's heads in the clouds, not because his neck is long. Dissipate, but that's oh, a lovely shit. bit of time now garnered. You're looking to close out the A zone. Clean. now flying forward. Afro. Done. Not needed. Good nade. Envoy with the nade. Final cool, 30 seconds here. Three. And Ultra take the round. Yeah, I love the patience as well. I mean, oh, he ran right through. We're taking way too long to ride over here. It's on A. Slow going for the capture. Next plays with oh, positions. Oh, gets the two that kills. Well, oh, we're on B. We're on B. Yeah, he did. Oh my god. Bro, he just took the route for a lifetime. He just took the super B, duper route, bro. Yo, can we get on the fucking point? The meantime, Thank you. They have to get to this A zone. These oh, ghosts, it's only a matter of time. Bro, they take so long to do everything in some respawn. Oh, Kleenex. Oh, Christ. Oh, Christ. That should be the round now. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Oh, my word. Final five. Wait, same cap though. A cap. Oh, a cap. Wait. Contest spot. No. Wait, what the fuck is happening right there? If your team is the, your team is the LB, you gotta rush the A. Wait, is that contest spot GA, by the way? No. The a zone to um, stop the I don't think Ultra. so. Clearly not. Very strong defensive round. Only two thing. segments gained. I mean, that's a, a round of near perfection. Almost every decision that they made on the map completely on point.
LA Thieves might have actually gotten out of like the blender spawn trap, but again, you're down on lives and you were just so far oh, down on time laughing. that it doesn't make a difference. Also a great decision by Ultra, at least double chow, uh, Ghosty when he's solo capping over on the B zone to make sure that no funny business happened. So completely on point in round number one and Kremp and Nasty, two and 12 combined, not a fun start. It's Ultra, well, they've safely made it to the A zone on the opening break. Yeah, two of them have. This is going to be a fast capture. First segment on its way out. And halfway towards the bit of work that the Thieves in the first round. Oh, no! Oh, oh my God, no! It's Afro time. unable to get any of those players out of the zone. So now the second segment is gone. Ghosty may find a two-piece, but you've already tied the effort that the LA Thieves made in the opening round. Ultra looking strong. This is going to be two mm, minutes and 20 on the game clock. That is Fine, really give me point. Point. Really the as well. The only thing is, the thieves didn't get A. Why does everybody always got so something negative? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You know what? No I'm, positivity I'm, actually I'm actually rooting for situation. thieves right now. I'm rooting for them. Yeah, that's what Almost I thought. Big nose Luigi fuck. Come on, bro. You don't have to show that way. They can lose map five. Come on. Going towards the back alley is the timing right? Yes, it is. Indeed, doesn't take a bullet. And now for LA thieves. Good luck trying to break this one down. You go good luck trying to break this. What is this bias? Well, oh, scrapped. they're oh, stuck in the market. No. They're stuck in the market what? spawn. They're, no they're getting the market spawn, I fear. Lost my life in this side of the map. The pressure is on. Can he hold these players? Good chance. Good, good luck. Good luck trying to break it. Fuck you. The players the <laughs> and that's going to be a nice bit of time burn. That minute gain from the A zone is soon to be gone. With a minute thirty to play on the clock. Oh. Ooh, interesting moves, but not quite able to get away. LA Thieves doing a nice job on the hunt to get these trades. Scrap gets traded out in Long Alley. Uh, boy gets traded out top red, and now it's just about trying to set up that spawn trap, but patient play from Watch. Ultra. They're not going to get the scoop spawn, the even if they have full control of it. They're still going to spawn red, But okay. here's at least his first free kill. Yep, look at it. <laughs> LA, you broke this down once, but... Was four, she just don't know, Chris. She just don't know how it does yeah. not make sense, Yes, it, it makes perfect Please sense, bro. LA Thieves forced that spawn. You just don't get it. <laughs> with a minute on the game. Now you all one thing that I have a theory that it, it, it forces it. If you're able to make them spawn there when A is still up and then they cap A while they have that spawn. That's a crazy theory. Like they got the crazy. I mean, that's that checkmate spawn. But that's what happens over there. We're getting shit on. But we be saying some just we just making up some theories. We're literally making shit up. Wait, dude, Pat was making shit up about the spawn system and we got confirmation that was true. You they can yeah. be with the once, market spawn. Ultra, <laughs> the away, like, again, when you get the market spawn, not to get auto loss, bro. Yeah. As soon as a single yeah. player yeah. yeah. the right time, yeah. 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 they got a market spawn. They, 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 they were getting <laughs> <good. laughs> I can't and still won the round. <laughs> yeah. 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 got enough dick for everyone to ride. That is incredible work, Tom. Right? It's so impressive. Everyone is riding. Captain B will get free spawns. Oh my god! It's so impressive. Already, I can't we'll believe the it. B zone together. Exactly what <laughs> happens. Trying to ultra oh, another Jesus decisive Christ, round. 11, fuck. So far and correct. Yeah. What's going on? <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's tough. All right, Kleenex. Oh, I'm scared. Oh, ultra was funny in Sugan and still got me, bro. All right, you can shut out these nuts, bro. Shut up. Kremp's been good, bro. He's been good. He's due for a stinky, bro. He's due for one. He had a great first map, bro. Yeah, he's due for a stinky, bro. He's been playing well. Freebie kill number one. Kremp, though, nice trades. Now he gets some back alley pressure up. Of course, though, Cramp not quite Fear. able to deliver. Nasty going to be forced to make the play, but Kleenex oh already just being annoying. That's going for the flanks. Stunned. The coordination yeah, is there. Say. Another opening break. Absolutely stuck. Like here, don't Ultra. get turned on. As is tradition, completely on point. Yeah, this is the more sort of... Well, I thought Nancy nice. was about to kill him. I saw the stun land. He just couldn't even see him. Defensive work. The only saw the LAFs get his envoy guy, man. He's fucking loser. Right, he already got his win this year. Can we fucking throw the dog a bone, little bread for bros? Yeah, 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 yo, FaZe Black is playing right. symbols for top oh eight right God. now. No way. So what's the map going? What's the map going? Guys, I'm not gonna lie to you. No way. It's the fucking zoomable. It's not like zoomable right now. It's not like it's zoomable. It's the fucking zoomable. Just to make sure you're blocking those close. Somebody got a 12-hour ad. I'll see you in 12 hours. He sees the players up top, goes for the objective first, and now he's team shotting with his boys. Hey, Dan Ghost is shooting his gun, bro. 
death taxes in danger. Here, nobody else right is out. Back to Guys, sure smoking that, that chronic, that putting these men down. To keep D Let's nice go. And secure, death ultra. taxes in Toronto. Who did? Details, they are doing everything I right. fear I need fucking LA thieves to get on the fucking point. We have zero proactivity on offense in this map. I swear to God. Everybody just seems like they're scared, bro. Yeah, they're just not scared at all. I agree with you, Sam. It takes them eight years to do shit. That's what I felt about FaZe sometimes. I'm not even gonna troll, bro. I felt that about FaZe at certain times. When they were breaking. I mean, when FaZe is getting the streak. Wait, wait. Dan has a streak and he's 17 and 10. He's gonna gonna hit the backboard and fuck him clean. Damn! Somebody got him. Somebody got him. I got the Dangos, D-more! I just need him to get a few more. Know, so I hate that you say more. You gotta pay over. No, I'm not better. It's probably way better. It does not. It does not. It's It's protocol for price extensions. Oh, my bad. My bad. I'm not to go against my my my, my prize mix is not happening. I'm my bad. I'm not familiar with prize mix. Yeah, nah, I'm not allowed to say that. Nice bit of work with that friend. Well, if you're not familiar with price fix, price fix is the easiest uh, wow. betting uh, website. Uh, that's around. Uh, yeah. 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 I forget. I don't, promo, I, don't, I, don't, I don't do the promo. I don't do the promo. It's Pat. I'm going to use the streak and use the deal. This is fucking over with, man. You got players in round corners as well, playing the guarantees and Kleenex. Wait. So annoying. Yes. Chopping it down along the way. Yes. Oh, damage done. What are we on? What are we on? Why are we on? I fear they got slammed. Karachi. Sam. A oh my god, there what's Scrappy yapping about? This guy looks like he's on fucking drugs. Look at him. Oh, he's really mad. Even after the high rise, he got so tight. Control. No, so I'm just working up right now. Yeah, he's probably Ultra pissed that it's not a 3 0. I don't blame him. Good God. Well, two, one here in our series. Series. My bad, my bad, Sam. My bad. Yeah, it should have been to be honest. You know what, man? I, 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 I be fucking yeah. down for the rest yeah. of the year. Yeah. I'm rooting for it. I don't give a fuck who it is. Let's run LG next. Sure, I'm a huge. I mean, I've always said that LAG was example. underrated. I mean, you can read the stats. Well, 20 and 13 from Dan Gosey, 20 and 12 from Dylan Envoy. I mean, that's phenomenal. You're telling me that Dan Gosey is 20 and 13 with 4,200 damage and Cramp is 6 and 17 with 1,500? <laughs> I can't believe Sam retired. He's ruined the You're telling me Dan Gosey has more non traded kills than our team has kills? to Toronto. I fear yeah, like dude. I Dan fear. Gosey almost had slayed the team. Like imagine if Sam, Octane, Larue, and Dylan Envoy were still teaming with each other. Listen, you know Sam, I, mean? I fear you know. You know. I fear they had the blunt rotation. And everybody just took one hit and they're done. And now Dan's got to finish that, dude. <laughs> That's not <laughs> oh, right. Jesus that fucking Christ! That is so not right. It's a good one, Benji. It's a good one. <laughs> Going map Yo, five in the other series. What's the Halo. map four? What's the map four? Sub base. I think it's Skid Row or Sub base. <laughs> one or the other. It's sub base. Sub base. There you go. So does that mean? We, so, so does that mean we can make high jokes about Dan now? Uh, I don't know. Uh, sub base is easy, bro. Sub base is easy. Aussie bro, Matt. By the way, like Nate shots tweets oh, were man, a banger. Can I read you a super chat? Yeah, go ahead. Someone in, uh, gave me five dollars. Big five dollars here. Said, and I quote: "Ben is a hundred T hater. Just wanted to let him know." I'm not a hundred well, T hater, but that's he's, crazy, bro. he's not a hundred T hater. He's an LA that's team crazy, hater. Come Ooh, on. This is, that's just not true. Good. That's not true. Semantic cheese there, Parasite. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm here for. Tap it, it up, everybody. Great. Wow, great. Oh, ben, your up, comment? Base? It's over. <laughs> We're I'm great at less. something. <laughs> No, you're not great at sub base. You're great against the LAG sub base. You'll see. 23 and 3 in hard point. Guess what? They're about to be 23 and 4. And guess if what? 23 LA, and 4 is backwards. 4 if, and 23. If LA, <laughs> get fucked. If LAT win this series, I'll strip naked on the flank. Yo, yo, LAT lock in. Actually, <laughs> never mind. Please get 3 1. No one wants to see that shit. <sighs> Gonna fucking rage today. Eventually, the zero rings is just like in the Luigi's. You're gonna break one day, Tom? Eventually, they break you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to see Haggy's parasite. Nice. That's I'm not gonna lie to you. If my peen was referred to as a parasite, 
I, you, you might want I don't know what I would do. Might not hear from me again. Your peen is a parasite? Yeah, it's in the last Look, we're board. first in rotation first percentage. This shit year. is locked. Why are you laughing? Really it's just a little bit of sarcasm in your voice. You know what's crazy? They're first in rotation, but like eighth in holding. That means they can't. That means they can't. That means they rotate and then can't buy one. That's crazy. There was any semblance of an advantage in hard point. This might All right, be let's go. Come on. want to play Toronto on. Of course, though. Oh my God, Sam! Right. I just got still an insane tweet. How the practice has been in the meantime. Four Order. stack of flank co-hosts beats LAT a in a five-game series. I'm surprised we didn't slap a logo on the side of that. What stuff. happened? I've been quite. They got tweets well. saying that, on, that four of us on the flank could beat the LAT. I listen. I feel like I could do better in half the league, but that could just be my ego talking. And I'm just like, I know I'm watched, but I feel like if I scrim for two weeks every day and shit, I, I can drop better numbers, bro. I, do, I really do. Oh, you took it seriously? seriously? I think yeah, you could. Uh, I think I could, bro. I think I could. But I'd have to pick my team. I'd have to pick my team, though. <laughs> nice. I also think I could do well with Simp and Abizi. <laughs> yeah, those guys are shit. I think for a ring. You guys suck. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, yeah, I said it. Yeah, I fucking said it. Good, that's good, Chirp, Sam. I'm trying to get him in position. Crap. Oh, Come on, Eastside! Right now from the LA Thieves. <laughs> yeah, nice work. And again, Crimp nowhere near full power right now. Look how far away he is. Are they going to read the split? Are they going to read the split? They're not reading the split, but it's not going to matter because they're going to shoot him on the side. Never mind. Never mind. Man, clean him up. Yeah, for everyone. Thieves retain control. Looking for the power ups on the LA Thieves players. Pay attention to the tongue of Afro. It'll start making moves. The more pay attention to the tongue of Afro. Good comms, Chance. Michael Jordan's looking at his tongue, staring at it. I hear you, Chance. Way to go before that's a justified comparison because he gets chopped. Afro's like Bucks Bunny in the fucking uh, on the first hill, Space Jam. Complete map control. They right now have on P2. Scrap is this pushed is so far up, he's almost guaranteed a free kill or two. Yeah, indeed. Well, P2's up. Afro trying to get out. Mm. Target out. Scraps there for the three. Number five's making oh a pitch, and he's gonna go. go. This might be a perfect 60. Oh, oh, down again. This oh scrap, scrap is six and two. Seven and nice. four six. Oh, it's the scrap master, master, master class, man. Is that one of the? Is that what's about to happen? The damage. So much pain. Oh, it's good bang. It's good bang. No they just threw everything at him and didn't kill him. He didn't die. Yeah. He doesn't need it. All he doesn't need it. He doesn't need it. He's dead. He's dead. I think his trophy blocks some of it. So the arm strength on the LA oh shit, Dill's through. They know he's through though. They're looking. They're sniffing him out. They're sniffing him. They're sniffing him. They're sniffing him. Good sniff. Great sniff. Now push back out P5. Push out P5. Push out P5. Make sure you stabilize this game. He virtually got full 60 on the P2, but sort of a similar situation. Nasty's pushed up in prime Nasty's position. Oh, in a good wow. spot. Right now, in a good down, spot. So getting turned. Oh, my God. Nasty needs God. to be the He's first contact point. there. All right, guys. I think the elves might have taken over. Forward. Of course, somehow they're losing Two these Fuck. gunfights and getting out of the time and maybe a slightly painful moment. Ultra putting the pressure on. I mean, damage is one thing. Good yeah, movement. W finish. Taking care of business okay. on the inside We're here. of the tunnel. Good P3. That's all the members of Ultra away for now. Ghosty pushing the front line forward. Afro driving the spear in. Go P5. Space, he made his pushed out P5 already. Here's the lead change. <laughs> See again, Krem, just a good information. Man, rotation He's getting is even before it. he falls. That is, again, not quite a full six. Right. Sam is on his Ryan Garcia so shit watching this series. So let him know we are worried for him. Of course, though, it is. I don't know what that means. Ryan Garcia is basically going crazy on Twitter. He's been tweeting. He's just been tweeting. He's been blacking out on Twitter. He's been blacking out. He's been blacked out. The elves are talking about him in real life. W elves. No, you know who the elves have been talking is fucking Ian and Mabel, bro. He's looking for him. Hi, this guy's stuck in his nubler gimmick every time kill. I talk to him. He can't no get out of character. He was tweeting last night at the party all night. <laughs> I used to tweeting like it. I'm like, dude. Talking like sketch the whole time. The in hand behind you. I will not be he I, we joke he might have CT. I think he's actually <laughs> Going forward, but those spawns, my god, they're very, very close to the hard point. Guns will be at the ready for Ultra, so the approach here from the Thieves, very tough chance. We get more time. Yeah, very tough indeed. Again, you lose just that first we line. We need to break a hill. Like a flock of mm, that's not a good way to break a hill. Easy trades there from 
I don't know. Yeah, he did some decent damage. That's actually surprising right here. Time, though, so that is oh, a gunfight that strips that's away. Maybe oh, that's 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 good. Good. All right, Sexy's going to run all the way to the silos. This map goes down to the wire. Little moments like that. It was more like a 40. It was more like a 40. And he's turtling. Turn on his map control. He's late to the cut that he can't hit anymore. Oh, 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 oh. That trophy's going to help. Unless it's just outside of the effective range. And out the nades there. Envoy steals it. Bye bye, trophy. Hello. Uh, yeah, the the trophy five. Thieves being kept at bay. And oh, Kleenex still Take desperate it for that cruise. With number five. Maneuvering around. But this timing should work out. If he turns, he's in a sweet spot. His boys are I fear this is a full 60, Sam. Envoy yeah, inside finally kill kills and feed. Good looks, Ultra. Uh, you just see how easy it is to be Kleenex at this moment. His team is just killing everything. He's waiting for a freebie, but right now it's just too much Obi work being put is on the rest of the Toronto Ultra players. Or, oh, now he's finally forced to back down, so but bad. you have Kleenex in a situation. He hasn't taken a gunfight in 45 seconds, and his team is still getting every second of time. I mean, Good we're rage. at the point where the cruise this game almost doesn't matter. <laughs> finally, LA teams get the break, but yeah, it's a 50-point game. We're staying on Kleenex until he gets the streaks, and if he doesn't, he'll get it. Ah, oh, 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 like, what the he fuck? He wanted that streak for like two minutes, bro. No problem, yeah, I get it. Like that, bro. Honestly, That's crazy. He didn't shoot his gun for like two minutes, and they still held the hold up. unreal. Uh, but no, LA oh, is we are in this first rotation where we lost. Oh, Jesus Christ. Success. Sam, what gun is that? What fucking gun is that? Right we can't get good shots yeah, nowadays. We, got we gotta shot. blame the gun. He hit fire in. That's good shots. He hit fire in the majority of the gunfights. He hit gun in with this shit. This shit does it all. Now he shows up in the kill feed. He hit fire in like with all those bullets. We can't get an important kill, bro. No, that's just captured. They got full 60 on last P2. And they do not have any map control on this rotation. Is the hit from Kleenex. Holy yeah, shit, we cannot get it. Oh my god. Second guessing decisions. Oh, this is tough. This, this might be a red carpet series, to be honest. Why are we going all oh, right? The roster. You walk past Ghosty, you've double backed on it. Good job, Kleenex. Oh, swaps to the pistola. As much as he can more out of it. Scrapped down. Why are we wrapping into them voluntarily? Yeah, you can see it. Oh, 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 oh my! And that's a rap arena. I see you got the Jamie Moore and the Afro Les. Let it rip! Wow. You got it right, bro. We got a 423 pace right now. I don't think he's going to die enough times to get a 423, unfortunately. Afro is getting cooked. So is Crep. Wait. Crep got a three piece off the rip of the game, bro. Yeah, wait, so you got three kills. Wait, three kills. I'm like, three pieces off, though. I'm not even lying, bro. I'm not even lying, though. You don't gotta say all that, Dwight. Bro, you got a three pieces first life, bro. That is insane. Was that a rival? What attack that was. Yeah, I think he's crap watching right now. Again, you have to put him in the P1, P2. Yeah, they put him on the P1, P2, P3, P4, P5 blender. Yeah, they put him on the Yeah, they put him on the P1, P2, P3, P4, P5 blender. Oh, Jamie Moore. Now you're just jumping um, in a deck. Nothing you can do. You two more, right? For three up top. Uh, and fuck me. Now they finally flip the spawns. They, at the Jamie worst needs two more. Time. Ultra again. Afro's on good pace. We're good there. Almost flawless. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> terrible. Delightful work from Toronto Ultra 25. Who's, is, who, who's facing this match? Oh, he's he's soaking. Right oh, he's, he's not going to get it. He's moving forward. <sighs> Ooh, the hard point Sam, for Sam, face hate nasty. doesn't affect me. We already are hated. We get booed every event. We're booed line. everywhere. Nice Everybody's booed. Yeah, and you got plus one in the brew category. You just fucking got plus one. Wait, this is good. This is good. Take everything. LAT broken. Insight's going to get a kill here. Come on, Sam. <laughs> yeah, good bitch. Like, yeah, 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 more. God damn it. Oh, uh, we're not going to. Oh, end. no. No, he's good. He's ace him. He's no, there's oh, he's don't, don't make Jamie rotate yeah. to the hill, please. As well. Oh, wait, he That's might. Good news. No, news someone should die. No, 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 he's good. He's no, no, he's getting on the hill. Oh, I like yeah. this. Oh, we're going to no, break through the right. front. He's good. He's good. He's good. Someone, someone's going to hit water. Oh. Here we go. We're going to get back to back breaks in a near impossible situation. Oh, wait, they're doing Come on, Jamie. Here we go. Come on, Jamie. Get one more, Jamie. Yes. He's looking. They don't know what's going on. We don't know. They don't know. Look at the arm. Look at the arm. Look at the arm. Okay, no, that's fine. That's more game time. So we broke a hill. More game time. Oh, he's spot behind him. He's gonna get a kill. Never mind. 
Oh no! Oh, I, please don't get a kill. Why not? I'm just hoping for Tom oh, about to not hit. Please don't get a kill. No! 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 Don't give him a kill. 10 seconds. Don't give Jamie a kill. Do not give Jamie a kill. Do not give Jamie a kill. Five, five, five. Do not give Jamie a kill. Five, five, five. Oh, yes! 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 Little wins. Little wins. Yes! Oh my god, he said bye bye, you sweet, you shit twat. I swear to god, I read his lips. Yeah, is there some chirps going on? This series? He said shit twat. He said shit twat. I know, I know he said it. What's going on? There's some chirps in this series? Just as I thought, Chad. No way they got no way they got Cammy straight. It's okay. Go see me water me twice and put Jamie in the back. LA Thieves, not bad looks in the hard points. Sorry, they had some hey, fantastic Jack. moments of greatness. Four and Hold three. <laughs> I'll take it. That control was Winner's bracket secure. Slamming. That was a, a real ugly one. That was where Ultra... God, God damn, damn, bro. We're uh, replacing uh, Winner's going to get oh, a ball. Oh, we're we're ready to put the lobby. We're ready to put the lobby. We have two nasties. After 1, 5, and 18, we rage quit. They rage quit the lobby, so we can't see the stats. No, how the fuck didn't he get a kill for that long? How did he not get the kill water? How did he not get the kill water? Two kills water, Tom, too. He had two opportunities in a 1v1 against water lane. Oh my god, there goes another $5. Yeah, get fucked, Tom. Fuck you, Sam. Oh my god, look at that hard point spread. That was close. Very slow start for a few players that started bring things back. Alright, so are we watching Halo now? Again, I'd say for yep. LA. Let's go. Let's go, Optic. Yeah, I'm, I'm the biggest Optic, Optic fan in the world. <laughs> I can't <laughs> wait for Optic <laughs> Halo to slam you morons. Wait, when are we, uh, wait, when are we doing the split of the show? <laughs> it's after the phase Optic, Optic match. Man, I can't wait for the phase Optic match. I'm horny for Formi, Tom. Let's go. It's literally right after this series, which is about to end. Horny for Formi. All their predictions were correct. Horny for who? Cool. I mean, the whole guy, everyone picks what? You all picked the, the Toronto boys to win it. We're such a hard it call, written. man. It was so tough. Yeah. Oh, my know, God, bro. Right. These guys. That was in 12 before stage dude. two. Today, we picked what, the dude. right team. We look Rick, wicked smart. Got cooked, so bro. Like, Ultra. I was looking through some of the numbers little bit. here. Slight cookage. Why did you quit out early? Nah, Why bro. Why did you want people to see your <laughs> Shit was slow roasted. I mean, when you get a uh, Shaq burger, do you get double or single kill? Did, did Pocket just read out their stat Toronto. lines? Yeah. Uh, what'd you say, Zim? Yeah, this so when you get Shake Shack, do you usually get a single or a double patty? Uh, I usually get a double patty with shake sauce. I add onion and I add pickle. Um, not a big cheese guy on my burger. Not a big cheese guy on my burger. I don't know. Everybody's going to be like, wow, what? Yeah, people are going to be like, what? Um, hello? Okay, and, and it's not It's not that I don't like cheese on a burger. Hey, ZZ. Actually, you're the perfect person for this combo. It's not that I don't like cheese on my burger. I like cheese on my burger. I don't like cheese on my burger. I know you don't. And I don't like, uh, Two meats on a, on a burger. Come oh, on. What? what? I mean, like, no, one, I'm done. No, I'm done. One beef no, my, my argument to the cheese is Why that sometimes the cheese overpowers the meat, and I like the meat, right? Like I hear you all like meat. Right. Love me. But I like to right. get the double double, no cheese, strictly meat. Are you dead? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> bro, what's wrong with you? That sounds wild. Nah, wait, wait. Nah, bro. For, for, <laughs> for you on double double, here, no ace cheese. Here, some ace, some ace, on uh, on Shack, on a Shack burger, you gotta get the single patty, cause otherwise it's just it, you, you, it's just nothing now but I'm meat, conflicted. bro. You said single, but Tommy said double. Who do I? The, the, the Shake Shack bro, patties are thicker, shake shack, dude. Shake Shack, yeah, Shake Shack's thicker, bro. You got you gotta get a whole onion. You get a whole onion on top of the burger with one with one uh patty. Whole onion, just slowly the entire fucking. Yeah, they put like a whole onion. Like that's just fucking. That like... shit is fucking gas. In and out though, you get double. You get, you have to get a double in and out. Their patties are tiny. Hey, yeah, they get more in the fucking cheeseburger because the fries are so ass. But no cheese on a burger is crazy, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Nah, I'm a, I'm good with the just a straight up hamburger. Some people like not a, not a cheese fan. Like that's, that's acceptable to me. Did you guys the see them from arguing at the Dan end of that match? Ghosty got more kills in his streak on Karachi than two of his teammates got the entire map. Uh, we, we know. Uh, I was reading a breaking point tweet on time. Krimp got, got half his kills from that Karachi in his first life of sub base and then proceeded to only have six kills towards the end of the game and he got three of those off the rip. That is in fucking incredible. 
Is that good or bad? And Afro still had less kills somehow. <laughs> I don't, oh, never is that is that bad? Ooh. All right, I got some butter chicken in the in the microwave for this phase oh. uh, optic match. Let's go optic. Come on, Sam. I'm horny for Phase and optic are playing today. He phase Halo. optic Halo right now oh, after this Halo. interview. Oh, right. uh, Jamie inside on interview. Maps. Yeah. Talk to me about your guys' strength right now as a team. Where do you think you have an edge over the rest of the competition? Come Miami. Yeah, I just think it's our respawn right now. We've definitely been putting a lot of work into our respawn, especially Hardpoint on the new patch. You know, when it first came out, we were nice definitely struggling a little bit. So we hammered it down in practice and stuff, and I feel like it's actually showing in matches now. Absolutely. And piggybacking off of that, that is your no, biggest strength bro, right now. I should have Obviously, the biggest head, weakness dude. kind of being that search and destroy. So what do you guys plan to do as we head into the major today. next week to try and tighten that up before land? I also got sold by one kill. Yeah, I feel like I'm the done. biggest thing in our S&D right now is that we're not Microphone getting activated. big kills in like clutch situations. Um, we definitely have been trying a few things in S and D, trying to switch up the vibe because everyone has a lot of vibe from us. A major one, uh, but I feel like the biggest thing for us right now is just knuckling down on that, uh, getting out all the creases, and uh, come land. Like hopefully we can clutch up. Uh, Jamie, you know, throughout stage one, there was a clear difference. You guys were on another level, another tier than the rest of the teams. A lot of people say there's a lot of parity in the top four, that anybody could come in in the top four and win this next major. What do you have to say about that? Do you agree with that at this point in time? Uh, I do feel like the top four is definitely like leaps and bounds ahead of like the rest of the pack. Uh, I'm not sure why that is, but if you just look at like the points difference, I feel like it explains the story itself. Uh, but I do feel like any team on the day in the top four coming into the event can definitely win it. I feel like it will come down to the S&Ds personally, mm -hmm. how respawn is right now. Um, but yeah, I do feel like there's a big gap right now in the top four. You know, coming off of a loss, I saw you show up today with a new look, had the hood on, you're absolutely dialed. <laughs> is that something like you're about to be doing in matches on land? Chat saying he's a Sith Lord, man. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Today, I was like, you know what? I'm going hoods up. And uh, I don't know. It worked map one and map four. Map four, yeah. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll keep the look. Love it. Insight chat noticed that you have been increasing the trash talk. Is this something you're learning sitting next to Scrap, or has this always been part of your game? Uh, it comes out against certain teams, I'd say. You know, th this one today was for Kami. You know, they did my boy dirty, so I had to get a revenge for him today. Yeah. Uh, I'm not really a toxic guy, to be honest. But, you know, today it came out. <laughs> Love to see it, man. Never stop. Congrats, Toronto, in the top four officially. We'll see where you're seated at the end of the week. Cheers, guys. Oh, that's Sounds inside new. Toronto that's Ultra. All right, chat. We're going to switch on over to Twitch. We got the flank and then probably some clubs afterwards. So see you guys over there. I'll be there in a sec. Appreciate y'all locking in the YouTube stream. Head over to Twitch. See you guys.